question she it's time to maybe hope we finish Dark Souls 3 it's exciting okay okay left is going to be stuff in the ring city and there was one item I was looking for Let's see if I can get it so some things over at the start of the drag heap Particular, there should be. <clears throat> Can buy some rusted coins and gold rusted coins from the stone humped hag. Street blood. Let's see. Oh, inquire of the Ring City. Can buy a couple of these. Yeah. Keep your ready. Six thousand souls in total. This should be. Mm, you know what? Alright. This would be useful later for farming after I beat the final boss. For sake of... Oh, you can buy infinite... The other ones, but those are severely limited. Hello. Why, where did you hear that name now? Oh? Oh, it doesn't matter. I'll tell you what I know. From the DLC trailer, if I recall correctly. Is said to be at world's end. Exactly. Cast this heap of rubbish as far as one can go. Mm -hmm. But you better think twice. The Forsaken Ring City was walled off by the gods to contain the pygmies. The original humans. And the dark soul is better left well alone. Hmm. Hello. You're not well. It's just. We may finish things off, I just gotta keep going through the rest of the city. Don't go and take it for granted, I suppose. Or to do any better than Tin can't would have been lap. Not you. See what happens in the other city. You're not very well. Okay, okay. Don't run. It's a nice the, the most interesting thing that I just simply did not really realize is that the area we start in is basically a part of Wathrop Castle, and the area farther down, especially with the Merkmen, is more specifically similar than when we go to Earthen... Of course. T tell me anything. Go to Earthen Peak, which is from Dark Souls 2, so as we go farther down the drag heap, we're going farther and farther back in time, and I need to go and get an item from a legend branch over here. But there's something interesting about, very specifically, the arena in which we fight the demon prince, too. Yeah, I gotta figure out how to get onto that ledge. Pretty sure it's just a twinkling titanite over there, but I still want it. Just gotta figure out... I'm gonna... Oh... That didn't quite work. Uh, huh. This is here. Oh, it's... Okay. Interesting. That was all I had to do. Okay, so in that case, there was no real issue. I just gotta go back to the Demon Prince arena now. And you have to Sigbrow. Interesting. Okay. As one does, I guess. Cat Souls. Oh, was in... That's the vaguely furry one, right? Oh yeah, humanoid cat. I actually heard about that. It seems interesting. I saw the Kickstarter and a weird amount of game elements seem to be locked behind stretch goals. Which I guess is somewhat reasonable, because, you know, it takes resources to develop. But I wonder what it's going to end up being like. I think I might be interested in playing it, but it depends on how it turns out, frankly. Because so I could see it being really good or really bad. I would want to wait for reviews to come in. In the end, there are, pl there are plenty of games, plenty of games in the world that I have on my backlogs. It's just another add to the list. What's interesting is that I didn't really see it that's over here, but... This over here is Firelink Shrine, the Firelink Shrine from Dark Souls 1. 
So you see, we went, we started in Lothric Castle, the ruins of Lothric Castle from Dark Souls 3, went to the ruins of Earth and Peak from Dark Souls 2, and now we've gone all the way back to Dark Souls 1. Interesting. One day. Possible only visions of dragon. Let's see, we're down this tree trunk and... Skeleton? If I do, and I hope I do, it would almost definitely be Insurgents. Yeah, and this architecture is also very fire link and okay this is this is all empty there's nothing else in this arena but we got this small envoy banner which is would arguably maybe sort of link together with this if you put it the other way around main castle gate escort path to the end of settlement was blocked banner duty had no way of returning envoys of Gwyn in the days of yore ringed cliff facilitators of transport Pygmies who took the Dark Soul, Great Lord, Gift of the Ring of the City, Isolated Place of World, and Beloved Younger Daughter. Youngest daughter promising you would come for her when the day when the day came. Grey Rat. Okay. Well, alright. We can actually go to the Ring City now, and the question is whether it'll have a separate tab from the drag heap or seems familiar but wizard. And that yeah, this is where Frampt was in Dark Souls 1. Let me see. Visions of chests, because this is where the special treasure chest was. That higher ahead, praise the sun, that stored items that you lost. Wow, and we're... Right, so this is the hole down to Firelink Altar. At least it was originally. Where we went to... Dark Souls 1's version of the Kiln of the First Flame, and can we see anything? Oh, when it says Ring City, so that's the ring. Okay, that makes sense. So, the edge of the drag keep. What? Treasure ahead. Alright. So we're holding up our banner. And we get taken to the city. Come on. Come on. Yep, it's more bowing demons. Just like it was to Undead Settlement, like it was originally in Anorado in Dark Souls 1. And I think that also in Demon Souls, there's an instance where you get grabbed by gargoyles. Vaguely similar to those bowing demons, but I won't know for sure until I play Demon Souls. What is the whole time thing, or? There we go. What's interesting is that this is very... It's kind of specifically like the intro to Anor Orlando I mean, in a certain sense. That... Ah. Uh, you come to the city and you see a bunch of the sun. Oh, and thanks for dropping us off on this pillar instead of just putting us where we need to go. Now, I know I can't expect all that much, but... One Titan at scale. We really just haven't used any boss weapons. Interesting. Well, that is cool, but it's also very, very easy to claim. References and inspirations. Okay. I actually didn't really ever take notice of how the sun's over there. But the Ring City, arguably... Well, not even arguably, it predates Dark Souls 1 timeline-wise, so we've gone even further back in the past. They brought thee here, did they not? Dost thou the gods serve? Or merely that role affect? Do we have to answer? Sure. Uh-oh. Was that the right answer or the wrong answer? Uh... How wouldst one such as thee do service to the gods? Uh oh. Scheme is known to me. Our desire is the blood of the Dark Soul. The Dark Soul? No? Yeah, I want the Dark Souls. One day to visit this I thought it was the Drake. Ah, a locust creature. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Not a Corvian, but actually a locust. If it is the Dark Soul thou desirest, then seek. Fiend's Church, the 
face of the cliff. There, without the sleeping princess awakening. With true Our love's kiss. Is a descent. Maybe. A lid covering an overgrown privy. privy. A prop to keep thee from the dark soul of thine desire. Mm-hmm. Anything else? Don't worry not. I am a true friend to thee. You sure? If thou art yet human, the earth human. will soon begin to swell. To curse the gods and bring ruin upon this mm. accursed heap of dung. <laughs> All right. Not fond of this place, is he? Now, yearly to fill in the base of the cliff to rouse the sleeping princess. If thou yet the dark soul desires. <laughs> is he okay? Now, if. <laughs> Wonder what he would have said if we had said we were not servants of the gods. If I had recognized him as a locust, I probably would have said something different. And yep, Ring City is separate, so the final tap is going to be occupied by the kiln, I presume. Or it might actually just be in Cemetery Vash, but there is room for one more. Try to keep relatively small, and then this was probably just to kind of fill space. Because it started over here, and it was left by it started over on the left side and slowly grew so it wouldn't just center itself so it had to, had to add more so presumably this would be good probably lightning spear too frankly that's a concept so we got our we got our things and I were right at at a decent equip load find where I am. Let's put our tears up. Actually, right. Might be better. Eh, we can keep this in the left hand until we actually need to use it on somebody or something. Actually, there should be Herald Knights around here somewhere. So I'll keep that in there. Put our flame arc up and I know that when we get over to that side, Oh my goodness. Invaded? Really? Now? Where is... Of course the Judicator Giants are coming now. Where is that guy now? This is a silly time to get invaded. And they're shooting at me from all the way over there. You've got to be kidding me. And where is... Where is my quarry? Ah. Uh. I don't exactly want to proceed over there while I have someone likely pursuing me. Uh, no, seriously. Obviously, they're probably just gonna wait. Oh, what a what an obnoxious hold up! And yep, the Judicator Giants right over there. And are the ghosts gonna appear and shoot at me now, or what is going to happen? Just come over here. If you want to fight me, fight me. You obnoxious imbecile. Ah. So we have another swamp in there, but I don't think that one's poisonous. I'm not sure. So one of these clearly is accessible. The other one clearly isn't. I just... I don't know where that guy is. Um, wait, what? Oh! Did they kill the locust? No, they hit the locust. Okay. I'm just gonna sit over here until they decide to actually show themselves. They're definitely just hoping that I get killed by the archers. I am not going to make it that easy for them. They don't want to come and actually fight me. I will simply not pursue. I might not have better things to do, but I do have my pride. Really, it's just... You even trying to kill me? Clearly not. It's just... I swear! They have no intention of actually fighting me. They want me to either just... Run forward, get killed by the archers, or... Hop off a cliff to kill myself to get rid of them. And I don't want to do either of those. 
If I wait long enough, they'll just give up and go home. Presumably. Oh, I hate this. I hate this so much. I just... The Ring City itself is not all that long. But if I run to bastards like this, I... I just... Why would I go forward right now? Why would I? Well, he's gonna kill me. I don't give a shit anymore. Okay. Well, whatever. Or I could be funny and just hop off and die. Oh, they're- what? Huh? They're there, too? Uh, okay. Yeah, but these are illusions of the Voice Knights from Dark Souls 2. Interesting. Epic chart of William Voice reference. What's over here? Oh no, they're Ruin Sentinels. They're Ruin Sentinels. That's why it's. Cause it's the Ruin set. Okay, cool. Yeah, but no, seriously, where is that guy? Hmm. Interesting. It's all about finding the right place to go. Budding Green Blossman. Oh, thanks. I. Oh. That's just infuriating. Because that was obviously what that invader was expecting and hoping to happen, which is why they didn't actually bother trying to even fight me. But it still fucking pisses me off. What a scummy bullshit tactic. Ugh. Oh. Motherfucking bastard. Okay. So, let's get that back, and this pattern clearly we way behind here. I'm not finding the right place to hide before that Judicator Giant is going to summon. Oh, thanks. I Alright. What? Okay. So I guess I just can't go there? I guess. Oh, it's just... There was an invader who did not even bother approaching. Because this part over here is infamously pretty terrible. What in the goddamn? And they were just all, you know, I bet. I bet they're gonna get killed. I bet they're just gonna die and I won't even have to fight them. So I waited for five minutes at the front, you know, by the bonfire because the bonfire just wasn't accessible, which was just. You know, that's the sign that someone's invading. They were probably AFK, frankly. They probably weren't even playing the game. Which is just stupid and ridiculous as it sounds. It's just... If you're gonna invade... Deliberately attempting to waste everyone's time is... A little beyond the pale. Okay. Where is my... Oh, goodness. Oh, so... This is where you hide from that. And where is the actual bloodstain? I do not know. And then... Right over there. So that was a place to hide. And... Okay, thank you, Merkman. Okay. Then we heal up and... Oh my, okay. What, what, okay, alright. Then, where is... Wait, fire? You have a fire attack? What? Huh? 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 Oh, please. Yeah, it's... Basically the same thing. Well, it's not, because... You can get your reward. You get your reward, regardless of how your quarry dies. So they were simply trying to get the enemies to do the work for them entirely. Not even in any kind of creative way, like trying to bait the player. They were just standing at the end of something annoying, basically figuring, you know, I don't need to do any work. I don't need to be creative. I don't need to bait anyone. I just need to wait in a 
area where they can't find me and wait for them to just die of their own accord because while I'm in their world, half of the game's mechanics are closed off and inaccessible. Okay. Uh, it is! It's incredibly lazy. They're still in ahead. Wait, what? How did they... They're hitting me in the safe zone. Okay, whatever. I all right, die, die. Thank you, Merkman, and oh goodness, I need to just run for it then. Okay, please. And really, really, really. Of course, your fire attack is gonna. It's so stupid. Oh, I need to run under the stairwell, or I could be funny and use flash sweat, maybe. This is annoying. Okay. Well, I don't think... I don't think that guy responds. I'm not sure, though. I hope he doesn't. Okay. Merkman over there. Basically, I need to find a way to get behind him and then take him out. They're not all that troublesome. It's just... Annoying... To fight, but those guys are basically illusory versions of those ruined sentinels from Dark Souls 2. In other words, Dark Souls 2 mentioned. Okay, and now we have you over here. One more Merc Man. Hello, one, two, three, and oh, all right. Two, three, one, and there we go. Thanks. Exactly! Huge W. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, what? Huh? There's just not a... Okay? Okay. So I need stone plate ring for this. I need stone plate ring for this garbage. Mm -hmm. uh, Alright. That's fine. Take Ring of Steel Protection plus three. Oh, goodness. Uh, excuse me? Something seems to be wrong with my... Looking up things on the wiki. Okay, never mind. Let's see. Let's check in. Bosses, Judicator, Giant, Judicator is weak to thrust, somewhat resistant to fire. I swear, they really went out of their way to juice faith builds in this game by making so many things resist fire, and so many things weak to lightning. And it's not kind of like in Dark Souls 1, where there are hardly any sources of lightning damage, period. They're locked behind a secret covenant. They just give you a lightning spear. Pretty early on. Faith builds are... Almost undoubtedly, I would say. Probably the best way to run things. Yeah, I would say, and... Yeah, the best... If you're just going for pure optimization, build in this game would probably be... A dexterity faith build using... Cellsword Twin Blades and some kind of weapon buff. No, I am using Soul Sword Twin Blades, it's just that Dark Blade and Lightning Blade are at least partially locked off for me right now. And come on, come on. Which is why... Well, she wasn't going for any kind of damage. She was doing it because she wanted to have her boyfriend play DPS while she stuck to heals. Not a, not a faith build for damage, even though that would be really good too. Wait, what? What the hell? What? Okay. I mean, I should have rolled, but just... The most annoying thing about that, that attack is that... There's no knockdown, which means if you get hit by one, you're getting hit by every single one of them. You're stunned, but there isn't knockdown, and... Okay. Well, whatever. 
Yeah, also because... She would have access to Dark Miracles too, which would be very, very good against certain enemies. Basically, if you're a faith build, you've got access to every elemental damage type other than arguably magic. And very few things, if anything, are specifically weakest to magic. Which means you don't really have anything standing in your way. It's probably the strongest. Okay. Dodge, dodge. What? What? Huh? No, you can go the other way too? Excuse me. Okay, but I think I need to roll off that sidewall. Don't think they'd be able to hit me there. It is, yeah. Faith and Dexterity are kind of kind of the god stats in Dark Souls, Dark Souls 3. Which makes it really funny that people often joke about miracle builds being bad. Because I'm pretty sure that the joke is that, well, they aren't. That they're really, really good. But, effectively... I think I... The thing about Dexterity is that in earlier Souls games, some of the compensation for strength weapons tend to be heavier and therefore requiring you to skimp out on armor or otherwise build vitality to use them was that generally they were oftentimes better. And greatswords are still good in Dark Souls 3, but they're also just dexterity greatswords. And also just weapons like Cellsword Twin Blades, which run very well off of decks and don't require much else. That was nice. You know, the Cellsword Twin Blades are also really, really light, too. Despite arguably being better than the other things I have access to. Oh, please. Uh, what? What? Okay, alright. And heal, heal. One, two, and... Where do I go? Where do I go now? Where do I go? You gotta kill that Judicator. Oh, goodness. Okay. So I need to get up top there, then just hit him with spears, probably. Oh, what? What? Okay. One, two... What? Huh? How can you hit me here? It's nonsense. Okay. And of course there are more workmen. You've got to be kidding me. You fight like DS1 skeletons. Whatever. Get over here and die. Okay, cool. That means we gotta switch to the Twin Spears. To Thrust, and then... There we go, keep our hood on, I suppose. Come on! And, oh, is that a... Oh! That was an illusory dragon head! I didn't see that. Okay. So we need to go over and kill you. Kill behind it. Not a winner. One, two, three, four, five, and... Just, oh my, what? What? One, two, three, four, and... Luckily, you can't use as many now. Okay. And just... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and finally! Finally, it's done. Get out of here. Drop the Divine Blessing, which... I presume means you won't be coming back. I hope. Okay, well that means that, among other things, I can freely poke around this area now. There were a few treasures that I'd like to try to get. Oh, another locust. I speak of thine kind and mine. Behold this city. We are kindred. Another locust creature. Two eyes which gaze mm. Interesting. Fear the dark, my friend, and let peace begin. Well, he said it. Time to eat some crackers. Hmm. Probably... The original Dark Souls 1 bone rules. One was a wayfaring knight. That'd be all the... Endless, forbidden search. I'm just talking about the invaders. this granted closure, if not reunion with his beloved. Fear not the dark, my friend. 
and let the feast begin. That's literally what I said. The original Dark Souls one bone wheels, because the bone wheels in the other ones are nerve. Many of us, if I, I speak of that, behold, fear and let hmm. one only fear not. Okay. So I wonder if, if I killed all, though, would he tell me about a different invader, or? I'm going to eat you. Oh my goodness. Okay. And... Oh! Okay. Hello. Oh goodness. Alright. Hmm. Weird. And I keep clanging off the side of the... Uh, spears here are not great. Hmm. Yeah, see? It's keep clanging off the side of the wall. Hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, all right then. All right. There must be a bonfire around here somewhere, right? Right? Probably not. Thank you. And oh, interesting. What are these clerics are all up to? But I do feel as if there should be a bonfire somewhere around here. It's got a... And, oh, hello. Just fall down to your death. Oh, wait, no, you... You didn't fall down? That's nonsense. Whatever. And... We have ambush. Hello there. Hi. Okay, and... Okay, that actually killed. That's good. And then, where is... Who and where... Oh, okay. Hi! So there was another. Classic. Okay. We're over here. If only I had a soup. This is... What bonfire is this? Hmm, and this is not open from the side, so we've already found one of those gates. This is the ringed inner wall, which I believe is actually pretty close to Medir. Hmm. So I found that. Giant should be dead. Still, and... Oh, okay. So he revives, but now that we've accessed the other bonfire, I can just kill him from behind. Okay. Well, I still do want to poke around that area. Hmm. That would mean... Okay. Put my tears up, put flame mark on, go back outside, kill those guys, switch to the spears to take out the Judicator Giant, and then, yeah, okay. Come on, come on. Thank you. Two. Or just fall to your death. And slash, slash, and. Oh, goodness. Okay, dodge, dodge. Okay. Sla oh, goodness. Slash and dodge. Oh, what? How was I not able to dodge that? This weird sort of turning around and okay, whatever. Hmm. Although we'll invade somewhere. He'll drop a ring, I believe, and is that? I think that's the Church of Philionor. Maybe. Oh goodness. Come on, come on. That push is silly, but. Not particularly damaging. Oh, you're trying to push me off the edge of the... Oh, or, you know, go ahead, fall yourself. Okay. Let's switch back to our spears. Alright. Does the giants actually resist? Standard is actually resist slash damage, but are weak to thrust. For whatever reason. So they're over that way then, so... One, two... One, two, three, four, and... Oh, come on. Thanks, and... Okay, clearly we need to dodge up of there. Okay. Hmm. Alright. It's funny that they just keep coming back, and... Oh, is that... Summon Silver Knight Lado if you go over there. And originally, that was something you'd be able to do via an item yourself. And... There we go. No more... Oh, cool. Thanks. Yeah, but that guy 
Silver Knight later, he'll be another invader. Oh, okay, and then after the first time they drop Titanite Chunks. So it could be a Titanite Chunk farm, not that we really need any more. Okay. That, mmm, interesting. Alright then. Yeah, but there are a few things over here. Oh, a blood scene, actually. Something down this way. A couple items to a budding green blossom. Soul of a weary warrior. Titanite. Crystal lizard down there somewhere. Yeah, there are a number of things this way, which you definitely want to be on that different side to try to get. That down there is really just dropped down to that. Two Titanite trunks. It's over here. This is... Oh, an ember. Alright. I need the health, I suppose. And anything else over this way, or... Hmm. I oh, got the ruin set from over there. Hidden path ahead. Oh, I could have just used this to get to... Could I have? Maybe. Let's just see where this takes me. That down there has something. That's Soul of a Crestful Knight. Not bad. Not amazing, though. And, oh, so around that way will be some more stuff. Oh, and goodness, I... All right, just fall off the edge. Fall off the edge, why don't you? Or don't. Or don't do that. And, okay, so you're not trying to die. Well, that makes sense, but... Twinkling Titanite, Titanite Scale. Okay. I really feel as if I should have upgraded and made some actual boss weapons. But none were particularly suited for my build. Which is why I didn't really make any. Because those Titanite Scales, I haven't used a single one all playthrough. I haven't had a reason to. If you're in Dark Souls 1... Yeah, in Dark Souls 1, I did some transposition. Okay, so that... That's the way I could have done it, but frankly, that wouldn't... This is where things get hard, frankly. That part over there, so... Actually doing the approach. Oh, and... Okay, Hidden Blessing. Frankly, it wasn't all that hidden. Okay. Just use our Coiled Sword Fragment and go back to the last bonfire we rested at. In Dark Souls 1, I got a lot of use out of... The Cursed Greatsword of Artorias in Dark Souls 2, I got a lot of use out of Crypt Black Sword. And I tried to use Moonlight Greatsword. And the Elan Sword, which were okay, but not especially suited for my build. Soup. That will lead to... Hmm. So we got one lift door. Let me open up my notepad. Notepad. Or by a ringed inner wall on fire. Okay. Then. Oh, interesting. That. Can't break that, can I? Interesting. So Madeir is supposed to be around here eventually. Be wary of ambush. Oh, someone right on the other side. Side him. Hmm. Could put on our conjurator stuff again. Said so I don't imagine it'll be incredibly useful, but still. You are decent lightning res too. That's actually very notable, very useful too. Let's flame mark up again. Set the bonfire again. I do wonder how much. My stats will be at near the end game. Probably 25 and a lot of things, but oh, here's Lab. Hi. Oh. Well, I'm not all that fancy. A true blessing that we should seek the same place and find ourselves standing here together. Thank you. I've got the last of my crew. Ah, another signal. Let's have our own little toast with it. What I find interesting is that that's Sigmire's beer, which suggests that. When Patches imitated Sigmire by taking his armor, he developed a credibility for his beer. To my search, and to your duty, and to the joy that lies before us. Oh, hmm. right then. Bottoms up. <laughs> Goodness. Now, I'm off in search of we can tell him where it is when we find, I find it. it. We've got some stuff. Who I was. What I lived for. What my name was, and what terrible 
grudges I held. I don't know. I just have this feeling that that's the kind of man I was. Maybe, oh, maybe not. Don't hold it against me. Mm. I only think I was. You think? <laughs> now, once... Okay. Another fatty message. Another ember. Okay, so that's not somewhere I can go yet. It just gave us a little panoramic view of the city. So this is the only way ahead right now. Alright. Somebody on the side. Hello, hello. And two. Okay. Hurry up up. That. Wait. Up up. Is something gonna drop down on me or. Wait. Oh, hello. That's what's going on. Okay, thank you. Nice message. Time for message. That's a good message. That's not a good message, but it's fine. And why was there curse build up and... Okay, you are a lot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is it because of the pot I broke, or... Is it something I touched, or... Okay, whatever. Thank you. And, oh, goodness. All right. Thanks. Slash, slash. This sets fast enough that the pushes don't really matter, actually. Hmm. Then, in that case, exactly. It was, in fact, a message. They didn't lie about that part. And... Hmm. Okay, and... Oh, ring knights. I should. I presume they're weakest to blunt. Presumably. And one of them should drop something relatively useful to it. Let's just chant my hammers and see how much I can maybe knock them down. They're humanoid enough and relatively small that... Well, we'll see. Let's try to stun you and... Oh, well, I... All right. Are you not poise breakable? Well, actually, I think we'll be okay and... Hammer... Oh, all right. Do you drop your sword? Then you just dropped a tide in that chunk. Okay, that was simple enough to do. Frankly. Okay. Those are the ringed knights. These human knights with the dark sign on their chest. Because it was... The dark sign is explained here as a seal of fire. From the darkness of humanity. Let's see, actually. All right, demon prince, common guess. Everything between that it's a fiery soul. Right, the prince in your faded flame, last demon standing, may rekindle it. Let me see, do I have right? It's not have been cursed undead, driven from their homelands. Sword. And the Soul of the Old Demon King is also kind of reddish, but it's not yeah, it's like that, but it's not like this. It's not literally just fire. Oh hi! Hello. And interesting. What was up with you? You seemed different. Ominously so. Oh, alright. Right, time for miscreant. Oh, hello. Hi there. One, two, three, four. And. Interesting. So, fire is definitely better. So, to slash on these guys, so. If we find any more of these, switching everything around is a little tiresome, but not horrible. Okay. So let's see who's next. Is it going to be another ring knight, or... Let's see. Let's see anyone. Oh, and a... Alright, what are you? Okay, some kind of hollow cleric. Oh, you're just healing yourself. Oh, but it... It's a damaging area that heals you. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like projected heal. Oh, but I... Okay. This is certainly something. Oh, but eventually I can flip you on your back by poise breaking you. So hammers would probably be the best option there. It's interesting because they have the same blue cleric set that I would wear sometimes. And that shell on their back is actually relevant because they're, well, they're just crawling on their bellies. Hello there. Hi. And, yep, you're using sort of evil heal. That's interesting. I wonder what damage type it actually deals. Oh my, oh, okay. Okay, cool. And, no, not that one, not that one. Uh, okay, 
Okay, thank you. Should be coming out now. Let's just... Thank you. One, two, three, four. Or we can just bludgeon you to death, because... I guess it makes sense, even if we're trying to hit that head, that... Uh, oh, the blunt damage would be pretty good against you, and... Okay, we actually managed to knock you over, which is nice. Thank you, and... I think there's one more, because they're still using projected heals. Hello there, hi. We're more projected harms, I suppose, and... Oh, goodness, alright. Come on, come on. Thanks for healing yourself all the way back up to full. And one, two, goodbye. So what is over... What might be on that chandelier? Feels as if... Dropping down there... Would do something of note. Maybe not something good. Hmm. And... Okay, we can go down there. I do want to try dropping down. For now we can just use the stairs. I think... Yeah, because there's clearly something on top that we can't quite reach yet. And... Oh my goodness. Okay. Gotta kill that remaining cleric, wherever he is, first, before we... Wait, where is... Oh, we have to drop down the chandelier, don't we? I think. Maybe. That is not a hidden... An illusory wall. We have to drop down onto the chandelier. And then we can... Oh, goodness, I... Oh, I waited too. Didn't wait long enough. So if I... Oh, please. Drop down onto the chandelier, I can... Find my way onto this little area and jump. Should be the remaining cleric over this way. Thank you. Three, four, and there we go. That hit well enough, and then we can take out that ring knight. Should be something over here. And yep, that was the purpose of that chandelier drop down. Fun stuff. Alright then. And where is. Oh, we could have dropped down the edge to not take the damage there. Okay, cool. And dodge. Slam. Two and three. And slam. And okay, you are actually a lot less... Hmm. Dodge and... Okay. Your attacks are a lot longer and more telegraphed than the Lothric Knights ones were, which I'm not disappointed by. Let's check out the description of that armor. Just picked it up and it... It's quite heavy. Not as heavy as a Lothric armor, though. Alpha and Black Armor of the Ring Knights, Forge in the Abyss, Betrays a Smidgen of Life. Gods cast a seal of fire upon such armor and those who possess them. Yep, and that seal of fire is the ring. Kind of like the ring city, the ring is... the seal of the curse. Mm. Oh, Herald Knights! Isn't that just great? Okay. That would mean we can take this off and... Go for a miracle setup. Let me see. Then, oh, interesting. Then we have our Sun's Firstborn, and then I guess we could wear heavier armor. Well, no, we need stuff that we can freely change out. Sure, we'll wear this ugly Northern Helm. Sure, why not? There is. Hello, hello there. Okay, the question is, how far inside here can you get? And boom, and... Hmm, alright. We can lure you inside here. Two, three, four, five, six, and dodge. Alright, and... Okay, well, we should have... No, oh, please. Alright. Come on. Dodge! Ah. Heal, heal. Uh, Alright. Uh, going for the melee hits on that would be pretty useful, and... Come on, thanks, and dodge, and... Okay, cool. Move in, and one more, I guess, and dodge. Okay, cool, dodge. And then you fell off, and died from fall damage. Nice. Okay, so melee lightning spears, actually, would deal really good damage to these guys, and I actually wouldn't have much trouble engaging them that way either. That's how I should do these things. Let me see. Just so many of those knights. I don't want one of them to a spot where I can fight them decently well. I think there was a third, or am I am I tweaking? 
Okay, cool. Hi there, hello. And just... Oh, what? Alright. Huh? And... Interesting. Interesting. And we did get their sword already. Which is pretty nice. Okay, I... Alright. I just wonder... I thought I saw two of them. I mean... Two of them patrolling together. I might just be out of it. It's possible. Oh, they're high. And... Interesting. And... One, two, three, four, five, six. And... Dodge. Thank you. And... Dodge. Dodge. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's really good damage. But... And... Slam. Okay. And... Interesting. And... Take that. And... They're slow enough that we can actually... Do that pretty well and dodge. Okay, and that stuns. That's impressive. Two and stop. Thanks and another. Thanks. And oh, interesting. There are limits on how much we can actually stun you, I suppose. And all right. We need our Ash and Estes. And oh, okay. Ha. Huh. All right. And I guess a couple more should do it. One more, one more, and there we go. Herald Knight is down. Okay. Hmm. Herald Legion Gauntlets and the Titan Knight Chunk. Let's actually check out the description that they're basically to kid to nothing. Herald Legion who sought the Dark Soul, saying that the Dark with the Legion weather partially melted and leather metal pieces signs have been slightly bloating. Hmm. So in other words, it their armor fused with them. Interesting. As one does, I guess. Oh, well. I suppose the question is... What would this lead to? Is this a shortcut, or...? Is this Shira? Speak thee the name of God. Thine own God, in fact. Oh. Gwyn. Ah, then that's not the mm. Perhaps is why we need to It's a shirt, if I believe. I know a yep. shirt. Servant of the Princess Fiona. Matriarch of the church. They who can to God's name are surely can to the terrors of the dark. Very or not. Please. Mm. I will really take not from the princess her peace. But we have to. As the fire waneth, does she lie by the dark? For the sake of man. Isn't that nice of her? Last a kind heart. Speak to a captain. Take down a somebody. No surprise, I remember. You see her very barely under those bars, actually. Interesting. May I ask thee a kindness? We can open this Perhaps up if we kill Madeir. Actually, no. Madeir is his name. Our forebears. And the arch dragon were his forebears. He once railed against the dark. It was by dark afflicted. Now here, return. He remained to watch over the sleeping princess, true to the old call. He and is yet, going to be the hardest boss. I would have you put the dragon to rest before the dark consumeth him, mm. and his vows are forgotten. All right, gotta put him I down. My sincerest gratitude. Thou no no problem, me. thank you. Please, oh. take this. Mm. I have asked a thing most terrible of thee. May this token of thanks be a pain. Thank you. Not all that amazing, but sure. Chamaphilianor, yeah. It is mainly for healing. Shork of the church knows no boundaries, but sending effective miracles that heal, cure, provide other enhancements. Pray for favor. Slight healing for multiple people. I beg of thee. Put the great dragon to rest. What about the just kind of okay Before dragon? Mid dragon. Mid is in his name. Okay, cool. So, are there other Herald Knights around here, or. Just, there's gotta be a way back to. Oh! You were right over there. Okay, cool. Hi. Actually, maybe. We can try Lightning Spear, or we could put our. Okay, you don't see me. We should use our spears for this, because they are weird to piercing. So I suppose that the 
Their weapons are fused with their body enough that they're basically scales. Hmm. Use your chain. Ring of favor. Still protection is a fun idea, but this is still probably better. Okay. Let's put our play mark back on. Then, oh, we could have used tears, but eh, whatever. We'll probably be fine. And, oh, you can... Wow! You can do a special plunge on those guys? I didn't know that. That's really cool. Okay, that is very, very interesting. And, oh, they're just cursed. That's annoying. Okay. Well, that was interesting and new. That was fun. And... As we'll take you down like that. It's a good thing we waited for that Herald Luigi Knight, but it's interesting because it suggests that I could have used those bridges to take them down, or just otherwise plunge on them in the initial area. Alright. Well, I should make... should put these back on. They do seem to be my best option at the moment. Sure, why not, Chain Helm? Then we could take that be a few more guys on these streets. Okay. Cool. And one dodge... Oh, thanks. I... Alright. Not expecting that precisely. And... Oh, goodness. I, okay. Please. Run it and slash. Okay. And slash. Slash. Alright. So what's over here? This is... Okay, just moss fruit. Wonder... Hmm. There's a ring at night over here. That is horrible, but at the very same time. What just died? Huh? I feel as if maybe one of the locust NPCs we were allied with got attacked by something. Okay, we should put our hammers back on then and. Oh, goodness. I, okay. Oh, okay. Alright. And. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Not mean to do that. Gonna drop down or what? Are we gonna? Oh, okay. Run in and slap and oh my. Ooh. All right. Thank you, Ring of Night, and just dodge. Slam the hammers to three and okay. Interesting. I could have and should have waited for that and oh my goodness. This guy's. It's gonna suck. And just dodge. Slam the hammers. One, two, three, four, and cross the hammers. Okay. Use a big special attack. Oh, I, okay. Oh, goodness. I, all right. And, oh, what? Huh? Interesting, I guess. Go in for a charge or something, please. Need you to get in a place where I can actually hit you. Oh, well, what? That was some bullshit. Just clanged off the pillar and go to hell. Hmm. I guess I need to go through all that garbage again. Hmm. Stupid, stupid, stupid. And we're in such a good position, too. Hmm. This chain helm is so hideous. I wish there's something else that put me at exactly 50% equip weight. Okay. Let's rest over here. Put those clerics, those herald knights. The nice thing is that I know I can plunge them now, which is good. Oh, I need to... Oh, and I can't... You're too close. Stupid. What? Okay, die. Oh, oh. okay. What was... I just don't know what that effect is. Presumably it's what happens when someone else in an area beats a boss, I would think. Maybe. One, two... Clang, but it's okay. And I guess they were proliferating first in the meantime? Okay. So you're over there, running this somewhere. Let's see that, clearly. Okay. 
But it really is just a question of how I'm gonna... Okay, and... Oh, I missed. Pretty much entirely. Alright. Mm -hmm. They are resistant enough to bludgeoning that other options are a little better. Mm -hmm. Put our hammers back on, take this off. Then... Okay, they do respawn. Okay, cool. For a second, I didn't think this guy was coming back. Let's just slam down it. Okay. Oh, well, alright. Oh, barely missed. That was truly obnoxious. Two, three, four, and... Dodge. Oh. Quite frankly, these guys are not as bad to fight as the Overgrown Lothar Knights. Dodge, dodge, oh, please. Okay. And just, what are you gonna do? Thanks. Oh. Do oh, what? Okay, thanks, one, two, three, four, and five, six, thank you. That only took way too much. That chunks. Won't be as good against the Hollow Clerics, but it will work. And it's, I mean, the little guys, little guys. But they're better against the big guys, and I guess that that's arguably what matters here. Yeah, but they have really high bludgeoning resistance in comparison. It's a surprise to me. Then we, hello there, hi. Thank you. One, two, three, four, and slam. That worked. For whatever reason, some of those attacks pierce that better than others. That's interesting. Come on, come on. And... Herald Knights are... Okay. Slam and... Oh, goodness. We can break through that, but we're still... Taking some hits that I would rather not. Dodge and... One, two, slam. Alright, and... Couple more. There we go. One more down here, so we gotta... Drop down to that. Okay. And... Oh, we just... What? You're kidding. What? Oh my goodness, that was stupid. That was really stupid. And the ring knight's up there. So we didn't actually jump, which is the source of our agonies. Okay, alright. Have to jump down onto... Yeah, but we don't jump down onto... Or drop down onto the chandelier. We just can't do much. And what? Excuse me? That didn't work. What in the... That's so stupid. Dodge. Oh, please. I, oh. This is becoming increasingly nonsense. I... Okay. We drop down to kill that guy and... Please, have mercy. So we got over there and now we can... Jump to that and jump. Thank you. One, two, three, four, and... Thanks. Alright, cool. Oh. Oh. Okay. They're trying so hard to torment me. Specifically me. They hate me specifically. Okay. Where is that ring of night? I want to try to get a plunging attack on it. I guess. They might be. Well, they're, they're not agile enough to be ninjas. They might be turtles, though. No, seriously, where are you? Okay, hi. Dodge. Oh, what? Huh? Interesting. That hitbox was a lot more than I expected. And two, three, and one, two, and... Oh, what? Oh, you have a lot of poise during that attack. Okay. Dodge. Okay. One, two, three, four, and... Ah, oh, please. Okay. Just to kill those Herald Legion Knights is gonna be obnoxious and ah, stupid, stupid. Okay, it was, but and if and when I get their spear, I can use it myself. But dodge, sle oh what? Oh please, like one, two, three, four, five. Oh what? What? Okay, please, like dodge. Oh come on, I. I need to get my stuff back, but that Herald Legion Knight is going to be the death of me. One, two, three, four. Okay, you're dead now. 
Not not chunk. Uh, okay. Yeah, I uh, having more trouble than this with this than I probably should be. Or do I want to... Are Herald Knights over there? And the best way to take them out, queerly, is going to be to drop down on them. Use that big, cool, special plunging attack and to... And... Oh, well, I... What? 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 Okay, please. Alright. What? 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 Alright. Oh, thank you for doing that, I guess. And where is... Where are you going? Come on, come on, and so that's you coming down all and I oh well alright, that didn't quite work. That didn't work as intended. Okay. So we need to figure out how to get down onto you. Pull you over there and so you come up and move over this way, why don't you? So you get to a spot where you can drop down on you well Twan it Oh well I No 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 my timing was wrong. Timing was very, very and I was stunlocked. I was just completely stunlocked. Stupid. Okay. Mm. I just can't afford to let them see me. Mm. Yeah. It's tough. It's not an easy place. And this is literally post-game content intended to be the hardest thing in the game. Okay. This question is, if I leveled something up, what would I level up next? Probably Vitality, honestly. Mm -hmm. Well, that's fair. I'm just wondering. Just wondering. Slash, slash, and- Oh, what?! That was really dumb. Okay. And just fall down, why don't you? One, two, thanks. And we'll kill the remaining clerics in here. One, two, three. Should be a couple out front. I don't think they drop anything of note. Or anything at all, maybe. Okay, one, two. Then a ring knight will show up. I'll take him out, hopefully. Herald Kirk Greatsword, Gold Decorate Kirk Sword, Who Sought the Dark Soul, in the Dark with a Legion, Blades are Severely Corroded, Giant Blade with Blue Pan, Slash at the Feet. Then it ends with a big jump, which we've seen them do. Alright, alright. Come on, come on. I'm begging, I'm praying. Please. Hello there, hello. And. Dodge! Slam down, one, two, three, four, and cross. Yeah, they're actually kind of fragile. Not crazy fragile, but okay. Slam the hammers down, thank you, and goodbye. Finally, all right. And I chunk. And so those fights either go really, really well or really, really badly. There isn't a lot of in between there. And oh, hello, all right, and. I wonder what would happen if they got me with that melee hitbox. I wonder if they have the melee hitbox on their lightning spears too. I don't know. And thanks. Thanks. And slam down. Okay, so just being relentless with our attacks is the best way to take them down. Well, because they are actually. They are actually pretty fragile, especially for an endgame enemy. The fact that I'm calling that then that isn't wild. The fact that they are is. Come on, and okay, we got you. Let's try not to fall off to our deaths. One, two, three, four, and okay, we managed to get you. You weren't curling up. Okay. Gotta go kill final cleric then. Oh, please, I alright. Then jump and Thanks. Take you down and crush. Here we go. All right. So that worked better than last time, but I don't know where that ring knight is because if you were in a place where I could plunge onto you, well, you're not. Great. Okay. And I hear you somewhere. Let's see if we can. 
Which hmm. are you going? All right. Oh, thanks. Dodge and dodge and okay, all right, and one, oh, two, and that just sweep didn't hit me. You know, I'm not gonna complain about that. Okay, all right, and heal, heal, and dodge. Thanks. One, two, three, four, and another. All right, goodbye. Okay, that worked much, much better. Doubtlessly. Okay. Question is, how am I gonna deal with the remainder? Hmm. Gotta use those spears for something, but more we stay away from those Herald Knights. I feel like there there's gotta be a way back somewhere and I Okay, alright, and die, 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 and Okay, thanks. Slash and oh, thank you for procking my tears of denial, I guess. And I don't see you coming over here, do I? I'm not sure. Not sure I want to find out. Okay, so let's switch to our hammers again. And take out that ring of night. It might be a shortcut back. Very much hoping it is. They don't seem to be going up that way, which is good. So we got you, and we got a good amount of souls, too. Go oh, okay, alright, and dodge. Oh, please, I okay. Okay, presumably I... I'm gonna get to a spot where I can hopefully return to this place and slam one, two, three, four. Oh, he invades here. Okay, cool. Okay, all right. And dodge, dodge. Okay, thanks. That's what goes on here. Okay, one, two, and so where is Alva, seeker of the spurned? Because if he's invading on the streets, is he hiding? I think they might have said he would hide. And it's not over... Is that something? Is this anything? This is nothing. Okay. Hmm, alright. This is back to where I was before. And he'll drop... I think he drops Wolf Ring plus three. It's possible. Now clearly there isn't really anywhere he could be other than behind this. Presumably, if he's invading around here. Oh, there he is. Hi. And he's got his crossbow. As one does, and he's guarding something. Hi there, friend. Quote unquote. Yeah, but you're not all the seeker of the spurn, you're just the seeker of the spurn. And alright, and thank you. You're not too good at dodging, are you? Okay, and okay, alright, and thank you, and spin, and okay, oh okay, alright. Oh, and you... Okay, that did proc my tears. Okay. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Mm-hmm. Oh, all right, and... Okay, thanks. I... All right, and heal, heal. This... What, 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 what? Oh, come on, I... All right. Mm hmm. Uh... I need my tears back up. And, uh, please. Okay. Can I... You are surprisingly annoying. I did not think it would be this bad. And just... Of course you're... Alright. Alright. Have it your way. Come on. I, okay. Heal, heal. Okay. We are out of Estus now, so... Once this is done, we'll be done with the rest. And... Okay. What? What? Okay. Thanks. Getting closer. Presumably. What if I... Do oh, what? Okay. Interesting. What if I... Do oh, what? Huh? That delay is... Bastardly. Go to half. Hmm. Are you including yourself in that statement? Okay. All right. I just... Mmm... The weaknesses of my build are really starting to show here. Oh, okay, okay. Mmm... Yeah, it's just... Why can't it be... Why can't it be like Dark Souls 1 where... 
get 20 S's pretty much anywhere if you knew how to use your humanity, right? Or if you knew to rush right of kindling. Understandable. Thanks. There we go, there we go. Okay. Mm-hmm. that ring knight. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Come on. And there we go. Dodge and slam, slam, and hammers, hammers again, and okay, cool. Two. One. Is your ember? Are you gonna use your ember attack? Or one, two, three, one, two, three, four, and cross the hammers. There we go. Okay. Okay. And then we got you and sleep over me. Got another one down there. Hammers, hammers. It is kind of crazy how much better those swords are against them. Okay, cool. Two, three, four, and cross the hammers. Yeah, the fire being able to break through definitely helps. Okay, cool. One, two, three, four. And we were just the right distance away to connect correctly. Hello, hello, and just one, two, three, four, and cross the hammers, thanks. Crush you, and oh my goodness, alright. Wait, what am I- there's some controller issue. My controller is- his controller has- wait, what in the goddamn? What in the- my controller just stopped working for some reason. What the hell? I- I lost that big-ass bloodstain because my controller just stopped reading inputs. I... If I could've used my mouse, I would've just closed the window. Fucking kill yourself. What in the... Controller's just not working anymore. What? Okay. I just had to hit it really, really hard. That's some fucking bullshit. It's two levels lost. I just... One day, I'm gonna fucking destroy this piece of shit controller. And to be fair, it's kind of my fault. Because it's fallen a few times, and that's definitely part of it. Just, it's gotten unaligned internally because it fell apart. But, eventually, I will buy a new controller one day. And I will do a destroying this piece of shit old controller with a sledgehammer hand game. Because seriously, fuck this bullshit. Fucking piece of shit controller. It's just... It wasn't even the game. There was no reason I should have died there. Yeah, it... Uh, if it weren't for the fact that I literally planned to beat the game this today, I would not be... I would have just quit there, frankly. That, that That's rage quit feel. If your controller stops working... And the game just fucking kills you. That's when you give up. Okay. What? What? Why does... Well, that's what I mean, is that... I literally said I would beat the game today. And that, because I need to do it to meet my schedule. And if I... What? I can't dodge that fucking bullshit? Uh, stupid. Go to hell and kill yourself. Uh, okay. okay. I just... 
But it's just... Don't worry about it. You don't have to motivate me. I'm, I'm, I, I gotta beat this regardless of whatever you say and do, so don't worry. It's funny that they keep dropping hollow gems. It feels like meta commentary. But it's just... Went out of my way to kill those fucking Herald Knights. And just... Went back through so many times and I lose all those souls because the fucking controller stops working. It's not what I said. It... Just... You don't need to say anything about that. You don't need to comment. Please. Please. Okay, just... It's just, the annoying thing is that... The PS4 controller is very reliable. For one, it has never actually fallen down. The issue is, is that it literally cannot work unless there's a wired connection. Because otherwise, the computer will not read it as a, you know, actual viable controller. Uh, but it's still... At least it's not going to malfunction like this one does, because I haven't dropped it. Uh, and that's what's really annoying, is that... Just... There isn't really a great place for me to put it. I guess. But just... Really? I died to a goddamn hollow cleric because the controller just stopped working. Yeah, and I couldn't even use the mouse for anything. Because it was still reading the controller input. What I should have done was just unplug the controller. If I had unplugged the controller, I could have just quit out or something. Or at least moved. I want to see, what would happen if I just completely unplugged the controller? Oh, come on, and of course that expired at the exact worst time. Okay. And I... It takes so long to read inputs again once I... Huh? Okay. It does lag a little, but it's just... If I did that, it probably would have broken the monitor, and then there would be no more streaming. Period. Probably ever. <laughs> but just... That has to be the most unjustified bullshit death that I've experienced in a game. So the controller stopped working. Fair. Let's just get the drop on you. Okay, cool. One, two, and dodge. Thanks. Swing the hammers and... Oh, please. I... Alright. Thanks. Dodge. Oh, stupid. Dodge. Okay. Come on. And really? Okay? Alright. And... Successfully block you off damage to prevent a death? Whatever. I just... Uh, so much bullshit. Uh, I mean, I should be able to beat this still. But it's gonna suck having lost, effectively lost two levels already. Because we're not gonna get anywhere where there's gonna be better soul gain. So it's not as if we can make up the difference later. You know, this is this is end game. But it's just uh, we need our hammers up. I don't think they can see me. I hope they can't see me. Shouldn't be able to see me. Let's just do that then. Uh. Oh, but I that's right! It was on there, stupid. Not even tossing lightning. Okay. Use that attack and dodge. Swing, swing. Take you down and cross the hammers. We only need one more attack. Thank you. All of us should be back soon. One. And thank you. Goodbye. Okay. Tight night chunk. Okay. He should come back. Presumably. Unless... 
Does he just not? Okay. Never mind. Spin and slam on. Oh, that didn't connect. That's weird. Okay. One, two, three. Slam on you and. D oh, please. Come on. Right, mittens. One, two, three. Just need to be more aggressive than I was being already. And one, two, three. Okay. Goodbye. Alright. That does not make me feel any better about myself. But at least you got to see me kill that invader. Oh, the Black Witch set. Thank you. I'll just... This is so stupid, and I don't know where the next bonfire is going to be. Ugh, so... Tom! God fucking damn it. Okay. I'm gonna kill those Herald Knights. It's gonna be plunging attacks, most likely. Figure out when and where to hit them is gonna be something else. Where are... I see you. Coming down. I think. Where is... You're down over there, so can we... Can we... There we go! Nice, nice, nice. There we go, cool. Yep, so that works very, very well if we can do it right. Cool. And then, more should be coming. Let's get that plunge off, and okay, alright, thanks. One, two, three, four, and thanks. Let's see how this works. Yeah, they do pretty well at it. Where is... Well, they're not giants, they're... They're big, but they're not giants proper, I would say. Hmm. But I just... I'm wondering where... I need to go next. Hmm. Okay. We're down there. I'm gonna make this plunge connect, and can we... Nice! There we go, there we go. Yeah. It's... Because the entire deal is that since they sunk into the dark, if anything, they would be... Oh, it's so fun. It's the only thing giving me some semblance of sanity. And, oh goodness, that... alright, okay. Hmm, interesting. Well, stay away from that, switch back to the hammers later, but... Okay. Yeah, what is... what's cursing me? That is... Yeah. It's just, the fact that... Uh, the fact that there's this whole multi-attack aspect of the plunge is even better. And wait, what? Huh? Okay. Ah, uh, stupid. I died due to curse. I died because of Curse Build Up, which is easy ignore, easy to ignore and forget about. Curse Build Up. Yeah. You have a right. Your tears. With any consolation, I'll probably get almost all those souls back. Yeah, it's a frustrating mechanic. It's not as bad as DS1 Curse. Which is... would have your max HP. And on launch, actually could get your HP down to... 1 16th of its maximum, if you just got cursed multiple times, if I recall correctly. Mm -hmm. Alright. Come on. Yeah, it's just... These guys give you curse buildup and a lot of it when you're in their proximity. It is aggravating. Go straight through tears, if I recall correctly. There's a status element in Elden Ring called Death Blight, which is basically the same thing. One, two. Except it doesn't happen nearly as much. But what is interesting is that the Basilisks that build up Curse in 
Dark Souls come back as Death Blight enemies in Elden Ring because it is just a different name given to this basically the same effect. Okay. Come on. Dodge. Swing. Swing. And what? What? Huh? Excuse me? Oh, I should have been attacking from behind, shouldn't I? Yeah, alright. One, two, three, four. Slam and one, two, three. Okay, cool. That worked. That worked decently, at least. These guys do give a decent amount of souls, but it's just mm, so much nonsense. Thank you. Thanks. The main thing about these hammers that's useful isn't really the actual poise damage so much as oh come on. The point, I mean, isn't the, just the pure strike damage oftentimes as much as the poise damage they deal. Because it ensures that things keep working. Okay, and one, two, three, four, alright, and oh goodness, alright. Thanks. Okay. Thanks for just being able to see me from a distance and kill me, I guess. And, oh well, alright, and oh please, okay, thanks. You're very, very dead. Come on. Thanks, thanks. Die. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, they dropped Trunkling Titanite? It's kinda nice, I guess. Kinda. And we didn't fall, that's good, so. Jump and come on out of my way. Two, three, four. I wonder why I was working better that time. Well, whatever. So once that ring knight gets over here, we Drop down onto him and hello there, friend. Not really friend, but you know. One, two, three, four, and oh, okay, all right. Thanks. Have mercy. Have mercy. Come on. One, two, and oh, please, I. Come on, and dodge, dodge, and swing the hammers, swing the hammers, two. And Thank you. Goodbye. Okay. Cool. So we don't need to worry about all of it anymore. We've also got... May as well check the description on that Black Witch set. Got the hat! Black Witch hat, Zoli, intended to use all of was supported her entire life, heretical magical crafts, and spoken with a deep sense of pride. Never loved, nor loved another mannerism of fortune, and found her purpose in the life. It's interestingly ambiguous whether those characters were eventually meant to be... Actually, not, I think playable might be the wrong term, but actually appear in the game versus, well, Zoli, Zoli in particular. Because you never encounter Zoli, but there are Alva encounters. You know, whether they were ever intended to be NPCs in a standard sense. Oh, but I, oh my goodness, alright. Thanks, thanks. Come on, die. And where is, of course you went over here, stupid. Dodge, 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 and thanks. Okay, what if I switch to the spears? What if I switch to the spears? Come on, come on, and dodge, dodge, and oh my goodness, dodge, dodge, and dodge, dodge, and dodge, and oh my goodness, alright. We need our flame mark up, and then, oh, please, I, how am I gonna, ugh, come on, I, okay, stupid, stupid, and I just can't... This is not where I should be fighting them. It's not a good place to be fighting them. Okay. Come on. And... They're fighting those guys, so I... Dodge! Okay, are you going back now, or... Oh my goodness, alright. Come on. Come on, I... Ugh, oh, please. What if I... Plunge down onto you... Somewhere... Okay, and, oh, wrong place. Not a good place. Terrible, terrible place for that. Come on, just... Can you come down here and... Okay, so this is... Plunge and... Okay, that was narrow. Oh, that was close. Thank you, thank you, and... Alright. Thanks. One, two, three, four. Stab and die. Thank you, enjoy death. And... Stab you and... Alright. Thanks. What if we... Get over... Dodge... Hmm. How can we lure you to a place where we can plunge you adequately? 
Oh, come on. I, don't, oh, please. I, okay. Oh, come on. Uh, uh. These guys are lunatics. And, yep. Got you in the right place, though, so... Thank you very much. Alright. One, two, three, four, and... Alright. You're not dead? Okay. Huh. Dodge. One, two, three. Dodge, 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 and... Okay. Thank you. You're gonna come up over here and we can probably Carthus you. Most likely. Just get over here. Where is that hollow cleric? And die, die! Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Alright. Thanks. And one, two, three, four. Plunge. Okay, one more, one more. Dot, dot. Oh, what? Huh? Oh, alright. Well, all those souls are back now. Okay. Through the power of getting killed. I made a bunch of souls back. Interestingly enough, it seems that those Herald Knights are just... If you can get the plunges off for a quick kill, not that bad to grind off of, frankly. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, exactly. As long as you don't get killed again before you get your blood stain back. Okay. Come on. And you're not trying to get close? Okay, I guess. Hmm. That's some nonsense. Thanks, and- oh my- okay, die. The speed of that is helpful. Just counter that dagger attack. Okay, one, two, thank you. Thanks. I am just going absolutely mad. Oh, but that one didn't run back in time? I wonder what difference was made this time. Okay. You can see our curse building up. It's not good. I think... A lock influences curse resistance at least a little. I think so. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. Alright. I do appreciate the plunging attack being specifically effective on those Herald Knights, because I just didn't know that. That made a really, really big difference in fighting them, though. And slam. Okay, dodge. And, okay. Hmm. One. Two. Thanks, thanks. Alright. Thanks. Find that chunk. You drop a good amount, too. I mean, this is... an endgame area. It's a post-game area. Still hollow. Exactly. Just need to make sure I don't go hollow. And one more, thanks. Yep. As long as you're quick with that. And just run in. Two. Thank you, alright. Got a couple more. A couple more of those. Alright then. Alright, and... One, two, three, four, and... Oh my goodness, alright. One, two, three... Of course you're turtling up and healing. Infuriating. Okay. Is that S just right there? Up down, yet again. Kill that hollow cleric. And try not to die. Thank you, and there we go. And yep, it's one down out of that ring at night. And then, yeah. So it is good that enchanting your weapon can never take away damage. I feel like the game could be a lot meaner if they gave you some kind of damage penalty for having an enchantment and some enemies could just absorb damage in a Pokemon kind of way, like water absorb or something. There we go, and one, two, three, four, we're out of the way. One, two. Can you use your Ember attack, or? Hmm. Come on, just dodge, sling, it. okay, one, two, three. Okay, cool. Alright. Real metal pipe falling noise energy there. Okay. Big thing is... 
Ninja Knights, Herald Knights, I just cannot afford to get detected and therefore killed. Oh, and right here's my blood stain. Let's get that real quick. Before any of that garbage. So, dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, thanks. Alright. Kill, kill. Thanks. Okay, cool. Which means we should run away. Oh my, what? Huh? Alright. Hmm. Get over this way and just dodge. Okay. Thank you for the lightning stick. Yeah, it works just like lightning spear until they actually transition to the next part of the attack, which is funny. Can't use that. I think... Forget where I would get Lightning Steak from, but either way, all is dead, so I don't need to worry about that crap. And dodge. Swing. One, two, three, four. Cross the hammers. Okay, cool. It's a strong attack. Okay, dodge. One, two, three, four. Cross the hammers and kill. My Nitro Unks. And then switch back to our spears. There's got to be another bonfire somewhere around here. Somewhere. Over the rainbow. So the Cell Sword Gauntlets will put us exactly at 50%, which isn't amazing, amazing, or perfectly reliable, but it's still nice. So that one is taking up residence over there. And, okay, so where are they going? I guess we could just take one out first. In the interest of making sure that our buff does not get wasted in any kind of way. Let's get back over here and kill this guy. Oh, Herald Knight. Plunge down there, and... Okay, cool. Thanks. Alright, and one, two, three, four. Thanks, and... Okay, alright. Thanks. Thank you for killing that guy. Appreciate that. And... Oh, of course there's... Herald Knight just passed there. You've got to be kidding. Two, three. Dodge, dodge, okay. But actually, we could probably... This would be perfect to plunge onto you and... Oh, well, we, that didn't work. We need to be higher up, maybe? I think we do. Okay, come on. Let's just plunge, plunge it. Oh, okay, I need to be... We need to really down with it. Two, and... Jump down there. So this might work. Might work, might work. And, oh, what? There we go. And it killed? Yeah, it did. Okay, cool. Okay. There's gonna be one more common. Might need to cart this up again, I'm not sure. Hello there, hello friend. And... Got that ready. Thank you. So good. So good. One, two, three, four. Plunge. Another dog. Oh, okay, alright. Thank you, thank you. Alright. I my chunk and we're in a good position. We could get three more quick marble ups. And then get reasonably close to where we need to go, frankly. The spears are doing good damage too, actually, so. Happy about this. Okay, cool. Wonder if Pontify would be affecting the damage of some of those. One, two, three, four, and is this? Okay, cool. And that curse buildup is going very, very quickly. Wonder if undead curse buildup and cures hollowing. So is that the same as curse, or I really don't know. Definitely have to wait here, which I don't like. Okay, getting this back up. Put on the chain helm. Okay. And oh, hello. So some of them are cursed clerics, and some of them are just regular clerics, I guess. Dodge and move in. Thanks. Oh, oh, thank you. And clearly we got hit by. Thanks. Okay. Cool. Oh my goodness, that was ridiculous. Okay. Thanks. Okay. All right. Come on, come on, I need some stuff. Okay. Now there should be a bonfire somewhere around here, but... Oh, please, I... Come on, I... Where are you even going? Okay, thanks. Dodge... Oh. Timing on that is very annoying. Hollow gem. 
Right, is that swab over there is dodge. Moss root and thank you. Lawn, finally. Okay, cool. I think over this way or there's something. I wonder if okay. One, two. Lots of curse build up. Great. One, two. The issue is that I don't want... I don't want my hollowing cured. If my hollowing was cured, I would lose a lot of the damage on hollow infusion twin spears, and... Guess who has to wait? And more knights are coming. What? Oh my goodness. Where do I... Weird? I do like that, despite these knights being very, very troublesome, they counteract a lot of that by putting you in places where you can actually get the punching attack off. It's a fun way to balance difficulty. Got you down there with more curse. Thanks. Okay, cool. One, two, and... Oh my goodness. I'm very close to dying of that curse, then. I just need to... Uh, But I just don't know where I would. Mm -hmm. This is tough. Quite tough. What if I. Oh, who's coming? And okay, that knight's coming, which means switch back to our. Oh goodness, I hear something, and that's not good. Okay, cool. Let's take this off and enchant my stuff. Again, real quick. Alright. I want no tears right now. That's annoying. Come on, Ez. Where are... Where did you go? There's somebody. God. Okay. One, two, three, four. Slam the hammers. One, two. Thank you. Wow. It's a single continual combo kill. It's impressive. Yeah, that's what we get for not having any stamina to use. I mean, not having to use any stamina for it. Okay. You're down here, clearly gonna drop down if I... Or not? I guess we'd have to get higher, maybe. Okay, cool. One, two... No, you're coming, you're coming. Thanks. There you are, you're trying to get behind me, I guess. One, two... Okay. Annoying curse build up. The Ring of Night Spear! Okay, so that... Fun Fire Spear. So the question is, would we be able to use... This as a way back to get home, or do we want it? Oh. So is that Leto, or...? Leto or Aegon? That's a question. Talking about the invaders here. Presumably. But... Is there a ladder around any of these places? Or am I just... Going crazy? Either way, I do need to put on my... Spears again, kill those knights. Okay. And drop down and kill them this way. That should be our most favored tactic for dealing with them. But there was another one that I saw. Second Herald Knight there. Also, I just... Curious as to the whereabouts of a potential bonfire. Oh, and there's something over that way. If it works, it works. What can I say? Me too. This should be the time, this should be the time, there we go, nice. Nice piercing attack, and, I mean, plunging attack, and thanks. Dodge, dodge, and, oh, alright. Dodge, dodge, and, oh, come on. Two, three, four, five, six, and run it. Stop, dodge, dodge, oh my, okay. Okay. Hmm. Alright. 
There were just too many of them in one place. But they are. Got really, really long range and really tricky attack targets too. It's part of it. back on. A second, I need to get something. I do want to check real quick. See how far through I am in the Ring City. Ring City... I'm about halfway through then. About halfway through. Yeah, you get down to the. Hmm, that part over there. The swamp. Then it's mostly. most of the way to Philly and Orton, the deer. Okay. City streets. Okay. So, we just need to surmount that bit over there and maybe not kill everything. Frankly, but it's more fun that way. Also, I need things. I need souls. Make myself stronger for the battles ahead. Okay. Come on, come on. Come on. And, oh, right, right, we... Had our shield up and said. Thank you. Thanks. One, two. Alright. One, four, and kill. Remaining guys. One, two. Thanks for the curse build up, I guess. Oh, gem. Yeah, I just. Oh, such aggravating enemies. Okay. Two. Just curse outside of Basilisk gimmicks is just wild. Is he always Basilisk or weak, weak? <clears throat> At least the Basilisk in the sewers and the depths, you only really encounter them if, quite frankly, we're stupid. But these, you, you can't avoid them, really. You have to go past them just to get through. To and dodge, dodge. Okay, alright, and oh goodness, I, okay. Two, three, and crush. Okay. Alright. Hot wagon's in a tight knot chunk, and that did not go as well as last time, but that's life. Not everything can always go well. And there we go, and. Cool, thanks. One of those clerics, I am. Yeah, okay. Thanks. Two, three, four, and crush. We need more flame arc. Okay. Uh, crush. Hit, kill. It's about spacing ourselves to basically just hit. Crush, and thank you. Alright. And oh, goodness. Oh, that. The projected heal actually got blocked somehow by. Oh, the wall? I'm not complaining, I'm just confused. Okay. Happily confused. Happy to be confused. Because it meant things worked better than I might have expected. Two, three, four, and rush. There we go. Okay. Then one more ringed knight with the spear, and... Oh, come on, come on. Okay. Okay, thanks. Thank you, rush. One, two, three, four, and dodge! Okay. Thanks. Mm -hmm. And, okay. Sweep, and one, two, three, four, and crush. Did we get you through the end of that attack? Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Take out some of those priests before the Herald Knights show up. Alright. That's play mark again. Then, lots of knights patrolling. Some other garbage, too. 
just gotta try to take out as many as we can at a given. One, two, and oh, three, but okay. One, two, and you're dead. All right, cool. Don't think they heard or saw me. Certainly hope not. Then, let's take off some of that. No, wrong thing again, wrong thing. Stupid. Stupid. May as well kill this guy if he's here. That is why I end up losing my things. I overextend myself. Okay, and just... Gonna use your... Mm, oh, what? Okay, I did not expect that. And also, that shrine in the center really got in the way of me and what I wanted to do. Okay. One, two, three, four, and... Oh, come on. Okay. Can you use your ember attack again? Do you only do that one time? I wouldn't be surprised if that was the case. Thanks, and... Oh, come on. I, all right. One, two, and... That took... Again, took more than it needed to. Okay. So we got our... Twin Spears back. That's just... No, there are more of you coming over this way. Presumably. One Herald Knight has taken up residence by Shira, so that'll be nice. Figure out how to drop down over here on a U. Oh, there, hello. And just drop, drop it. Okay, we entirely missed. We missed entirely. We've got to be getting here. Okay, cool. Right, and just... Where are you going? Are you coming up here, or are you... Hmm. No, you're not, actually. Interesting. Oh. They don't really seem to see me around here, either. Yeah, they're pleasantly stupid. That's good. Oh, never mind. Never mind, I guess. Oh, come on. How do I want to... Hmm. Dodge. Okay. Oh, come on. Dodge, dodge, oh, please. Ah. Oh. So where are you down around this way? Okay, cool. Alright. Oh, well, you know, if it's true, it's true. And, okay, we managed to get one, one, and, okay, dodge, 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 dodge. Oh, come on, come on. That was... Narrow. Dangerous. Okay, cool. Oh, please. I need those tears up. I really do. Then, who is and where? Who and where? Who and where? Okay, are you gonna... Interesting. Oh, weird. Whatever, I... Alright. Mm hmm. Just... One... One, two, and one, two. Okay, cool. Okay. All right. All right. And then we got another one coming down. Let's kill you two. Okay. And just we need to one. Okay, I couldn't make that work. Couldn't make that work. Uh, whatever. Whatever. I okay. Cool. And, oh, you're kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. And, there we, oh my goodness, I, okay. Dodge. Uh, uh. Well, first of all, I need to get my butts in back. Get this back. Come on, come on. Okay, I, dodge, and, hmm. okay. There is, did you go back to your original location? I don't think, no, you didn't. Okay. Hmm. All right then. All right. Where is? Where are you going? Where are you going? And we. Okay. Well. Didn't have our fire buff, but we did okay for ourselves. Uh, this is getting increasingly complicated. Okay. Well, all right then. Thanks. Okay. And what if we? What if we plunge down? Okay. Well, that didn't quite work. But, 
dodge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, okay. One, two, three, and dodge. What? Dodge. Oh, okay. Please, please. Okay. Dodge. Oh, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, you're dead. Finally dead. Come on. One, two, dodge. One, two, dodge. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, we, all right. Okay, cool. Well, that, that was something, I guess. Huh. And, yep, there's another one coming down. Because, of course, there is. I just, yeah, there's so many things I need to find. It's obnoxious. Okay. Those guys are really fun to fight, though, I will say. Even though they do get kind of annoying. And crush. And even when they're not doing anything, they still build up curse like a mother. Okay. Yeah. Really cool enemies to fight, undeniably. So... I guess the question is... Who do I go for next? There are a couple more Herald Knights over there, but unless I can get on that bridge, I'm definitely not getting them. Dodge, stab, stab, and okay, all right, and dodge. Thanks, cool. One, two, three, four. Thanks. Okay. Spears actually deal with them pretty well. Mm -hmm. Big thing is if I can lure you over here. And get you to chase me far enough, I can probably get a plunge off on you. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. How far are you coming? Over here, and this. Hello, hello. No, that didn't quite work. I can't go down enough there. Can't go far enough to get you that way. That's a shame. Mm hmm. Going out of Estes, too. Oh, you know, that's life, I guess. Okay. Those guys, and there's another side path that I wanted to check out. Come on, come on, and there we go. Mm -hmm. I am... This is an interesting concept, because... You can hit them from a distance with the spears, and... Stay away from some of that curse build up, but it still is... Unpleasant, deeply... What?! Huh?! What? How did I get curse build up there? That makes no sense. Monko? Hmm. I wasn't anywhere close to them. Whatever. The big thing about it is that, in theory, the best way to deal with that is using a... Uh, a purging stone. The issue is, is that I've got hull infusion on my twin spears, which means that if I use them and got rid of all my hauling, I wouldn't be getting the plus five luck bonus, which directly adds to the damage scaling of the spears. You know, eventually it doesn't matter. You know, if you got to 99 stats or to a point where the aspect of you know the increase of five luck would not make a difference in scaling, more or less. Still. Okay. I could just try running through if I really wanted to. If I wanted to. I don't want to. And of course you ran. Of course you ran. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Two, three, one. Okay. Cool. Interesting. Alright. Let's go over, take out this Carthus again, kill that Ring Knight, and try our best to get down to the streets again and probably fail, frankly. Dodge, slam the hammers, one, two, three, four, and 
Rush. Alright. Dodge. Two. Hmm. The degree to which we overextended ourselves is... Okay. Kind of scary. That's life. And we got that. Tight that chunk. It's just killing the Herald Knights in our way is gonna be something. And first split up gone, and it seems that killing one is the cure for the other to drop down. Interesting. Alright. Go over and take you out. Two, three, four, and crush. Alright. Put our flame arc back up again. The, the high duration of flame arc is probably the best thing about it. Two, three, four, thank you. Alright. Got a couple more of you over here, thanks. Alright. One, two, three, four, and crush. Thanks. Okay. Huh. Alright. And, and not being able to run through the center definitely complicates matters a bit there. One, two, three, four, and oh my goodness. Alright. Hit me for a lot more damage than I would have expected. And there you are. Crush. Double damage while you're on your belly. I mean, on your back. Curse is a little silly, to say that much. Guess that that allows you to kind of get the drop on that guy. Thanks, and crush. One, two, three, four, and cross the hammers, and just a little. A couple more hits will do it. Thank you, and allow me to... Oh, goodness. Okay. One, and run it. Slam, slam it. Okay, there we go. Nice. And that gauntlet's the tight that chunk. Need twin blades back on, and then um, I just so much to grab and nab. I'm going insane. Frankly, I should just run through and take out some. Of the, okay, and then you're coming over here. Thanks, thanks. Lightning gem. Oh, lightning gem from the Hollow Cleric. That's cool. Run through, grab those souls, and then go back and try to kill those Herald Knights or something. Or maybe just skip over them. But, I do wonder if they try to chase me from behind. And also, just... Killing them gets me a lot of souls. I like having souls. Oh, please. And then you The big chasing slash and... Okay, what? What? Okay. I wasn't expecting that much of a combo after that chase. What are you gonna do now? Ember up and dodge and one, two, three, four, and rush. One, two, rush, and interesting. One, and alright. Thank you. That wasn't horrible, horrible. Got other, other guys around here. Let's just risk it all for the biscuit. It's been a while since I had a good biscuit. Oh, okay. Thank you, and... Where is... Oh, goodness. In that case, maybe I should go over to the other one first, or not. So you're coming over this way. Thank you. Gotta drop down on a you, and... Thanks, thanks, and... Alright. Cool, cool. And then just dodge. Okay. Interesting. I'll use this bridge again and see where you go to. Thanks. Dodge, dodge. Oh, well, that didn't quite work, did it? Yeah. Makes life better. A good biscuit. And just dodge, dodge. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. I need some of that then. Okay, cool. Heal, heal, and of course the other one's coming out too. Actually, it isn't. Okay. D take and Okay, that that killed. Nice. Okay. Cool. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, which means we can Oh yeah, it was silly. 
Get over here and come on. What if we? Hmm. Come on. Get over here. What if I? Okay, you won't see me then. Means we can. No, no, not like that. Not like that. Use that then. Thanks. Thanks. And where are you? Oh, come on. Alright. Hmm. Stay away. How far do I have to stay away to get you to stop chasing me? Don't hear you moving. Hmm. I think you might have given up. Maybe. Where is... Are you? Where are you then? Okay, then you get down over here and wait, wait, okay. There we go, and can we No we that didn't work. That didn't work at all. Okay. Cool, cool. And just dodge, dodge. Oh please, come on. Okay. Hi, alright, alright. Oh. It's just getting that to work versus not is really painful. Okay. Well, we got some stuff over here. I guess we can just run through. Yeah, sure. Alright. Okay. Don't curse me to death, please. Please. Said I feel as if... Drop down the side here, there's something, so... Oh well. It's gonna be over this way, then. Oh well. Nothing in particular? Actually, there's a... At least the swamp is not a curse swamp. Yeah, I was very close to just dying from curse. I suppose so. Oh, and you're up here. Oh well. Hi. One poor girl slew her own king. And who was... Who? was embraced and fell hmm. by the abyss. It was a comfort that neither moon nor sun the sky afforded her before. Fear not the dark, mm -hmm. my friend, and let the feast begin. Oh, so maybe that would have been serious. One, let the dark with learning. The world does not fear not and So maybe that would have been Orbeck? Maybe. I don't know. Got over here. There is, does seem to be another. Ring of Night over there. Mm -hmm. And I... Did that... Was that a crystal wizard that just ran away from me? I think it was, yeah. Stupid. Hmm. There's gotta be a way... Back somewhere. This has got to be a... Detour. Shortcut. Somewhere. Okay, so there's this, and that is... That's just a drop-down. I... Hmm. Maybe I don't want to go there quite yet. I'm just... Hmm. Hi! Hello, Ring Knight Spear. And another Ring Knight over there, and I... Hmm. Seem to be approaching very deliberately. Okay. Hmm. Okay, alright. I'm just gonna... It's not. It's not. As far as I can tell, at least. It's gonna be over here, then. It's just... It's gotta be... A shortcut back to something somewhere, right? This is... Oh, Silver Knight Lado is... Thanks. Okay. And I guess I can't go home now. Presumably. That we've been invaded by Dark Spirit. He's got a big hammer. It's not great. He will drop his hammer, if I recall correctly. Oh, you're fast? I don't like that. One, two, spin, slam, thanks. What are you gonna do? One, one, two, three, slam. Be fast, but at least you're predictable. One. I only really go for one attack at once. It is cool. It is the heaviest weapon in the game, and... Oh, come on! Oh. I can't use it. <laughs> it requires 60 strength. Hmm. Alright. 
gonna be able to run through until I hopefully find a way back somewhere. I. I agree. I'm just saying, I will not be able to use that thing for anything. Mm -hmm. One, two. Alright. Stock dunk by. Thank you. One, two, three. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. One, two. I guess. Maybe. One, two. Hate, hate, curse. Hate, curse build up. Hollow jam and. <laughs> and we need to switch back to our. <sighs> Stupid. Hammers, take out our ring knight, and. Okay. Thank you, thank you. I am. just. Starting to go insane. Ring City is driving me mad. One, two, three. Cross the hammers, and whether they shield or not seems kind of hard to predict. Two, three, four, and slam! Okay, at least you're dead now. And my chunks, and oh, 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 and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Just throwing that many of those Herald Knights at you is hilarious. It's such a silly idea. Okay. Just gotta run through, get back to where we were, try not to die, and wait, what? Come on, come on. And of course you're doing that. Stupid, and... Okay, and what, what? Oh, come on. What in the... What? It's going so much worse this time for some reason. Dodge. Oh, please. And that works. Hmm. Okay. Alright. One, two, three, four. And the other one got far away because we took so long. Stupid. Okay. One, two, three, four. And oh, please. Alright. I need to flame mark up again. Just starting to uh, starting to go all. Huh. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on. And over that way is you. One, two, three, four. All right. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Thank you, thank you, and just direct hit, crush, one, two, three, four, and- Oh, well, wait. Oh. Got too close to the wall. Dodge, dodge, slam, slam on you, and what can we- Okay, thanks. Finally. Knighthood, tight knight chunk. Alright. We are just running through to go try to kill Leto. Nothing else matters right now. We just gotta figure out how to get out of the way of you and dodge! Thanks. Cool. Over we find Leto. Over through his tower or whatever. And okay, whatever. We can just barely avoid dying to curse if we just run through there. Okay. Uh Got a ladder down the side here. Oh, 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 what? Oh, you're interest, interesting. Okay. Interesting idea for an attack. And, wait, what? What? Oh, you are, what? Huh? What the hell? What the hell? Fuck this game, seriously. That didn't even make sense.
I don't even give a shit anymore. I'm not leveling up. I'm not going to level up. I'm not getting any more levels today. I'm just gonna run through, kill that fucking bastard, and stop caring. Hmm. I mean, in the end, it's not like I get that much more from another level, it's just... I could have leveled up five fucking times. <clears throat> and random bullshit has conspired to prevent that every single time. It's just... This controller is worse than useless. I should honestly... The main issue preventing you from doing a destroying my fucking piece of shit controller hand cam is not my unwillingness to lose this controller, but just I don't have a camera to use for it right now. I don't have a camera that would work that well. You know, it's just... As long as I can use this wirelessly, I'm going to use it instead of the PS4 controller. But the PS4 controller is probably better in the long run. Thanks. No, seriously, the fuck is that shit? If I just killed you instead of trying to run away, I would have gotten that fucking shit back. But fucking Leto kills me first, and then... I'm just getting increasingly sick of this game. And you're fucking with me. Okay. One, two, three. Come on, come on. God damn! Fucking hell! Well, that's one way to kill a crystal wizard. I'm just... <sighs> Get it. It might be, arguably, one of the better Souls games, but quite frankly, it's the one I've had the least fun with. And I know a lot of people will call that heresy, but it's just... I like it the least. And a lot of it is just because it's specifically, this game is specifically unsuited to the build I'm trying to run. But it still doesn't make, it doesn't make it any more fun. Okay. Oh. It's just... No, that's certainly part of it, but quite frankly... To the extent that it would be more fun if I could not do that, it would be because I just would have quit. I just would have... actually rage quit and not bothered. I would have just said, you know, that was a stupid death, I don't feel like playing this game anymore today. And then I would have just not played it. For the rest of the day. And then I would have ended the stream early. And maybe then I would feel better about the game. Because I would have actually been able to rage quit it like I would have liked. But, huh. It's just... There are a lot of people who dislike the specific design decisions that Dark Souls 3 made. In particular, it's the... It is a much faster paced game. Specifically the criticism that people make that I will 100% echo is that the enemy speed increased significantly to be on par more or less with Bloodborne, but the player character remains slow as, as slow as they were in Dark, Dark Souls 1 and 2. Uh, no I don't actually, I was gonna say that, but I think people wanna do a run-through of every single course in Mario Kart, which is why I want to get it done today. 
Fucking hell. Fucking kill yourself. Uh, okay. I know those tears back. Okay. But it's just... I haven't gotten a single goddamn level up. Maybe. We'll see. Depends on how many times people accidentally dox me on purpose or on accident. And, okay. Hmm. Interesting. And just dodge. Yeah, the main thing is I was just not expecting to see this guy here and... Okay. Oh, interesting. And it, well, I mean, is in say my name when I specifically requested, please don't do that. And... Larry has the truly obnoxious habit of just saying people's names for emphasis. Because that's how he talks. I don't know, because he's a fake Italian, I guess. I don't know, and... Oh, please. Fuck this bullshit game. Dodge. Can we... One, two... Three... Slam. Alright. Alright. One, two, and... Do what?! But it's just, I can't fucking stop him. And he never, and he always uses my real name. Maybe I just decapitate him. Maybe I just kill him. Okay. Stupid. I'm getting increasingly close to just fucking snapping. You know, maybe maybe I don't beat all the Souls games before Elden Ring. Maybe I don't even play Elden Ring. Maybe I just quit streaming entirely and work at a gas station. Okay. It's just... Yeah, I... I actually... I deeply dislike this game. It's by far the Souls game I've had the least fun with so far. There's just... Yeah, I, I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy that hopefully today... I don't have to come back, and I can just never play Dark Souls 3 in my life. Again. And a lot of it definitely is a build issue, but it's definitely going to go down as my least favorite. It's just... I have by far had the least fun playing it out of all of them. And you're... What?! Huh?! Whatever. Okay. But it just... The build's bad, and... The thing about it is... They limit your Estus even more heavily than... Because in Dark Souls 1, you could get 20 Estus anywhere pretty trivially. In Dark Souls 2, you could get up to 15. It was either 12 or... 15. I think it was 15 just through upgrades, but in this one, you get up to 15 period, but the issue is that if you want to use any kind of spell whatsoever, you're going to be using focus points, and those take a lot of stuff. And yep, I can't use those because I'm invaded. That's why I lost all that stuff from before, and oh, please, you've got to be kidding me. Stupid, I... I just... All the poison there is... What in... Really, really... I just... Can't counter a single one of this guy's attacks. Can't do anything to this guy. Two, three... Spin... 
I just... As soon as I got that blood zone back, I should have just gone and leveled up immediately. I shouldn't have risked it, but it's just... One, two, three, slam. One. One. Uh, two. One, two, three. Take you out, and I just need one more quick attack. Thank you, and finally, that's over. Okay. Well, we got his hammer. Unless we could have gotten the big ass bloodstain back, too, but that's not fucking happening. I've gotten so sick of this goddamn game. Oh. It's not even gonna be. Not even to have some kind of feeling of accomplishment whatsoever. I'm just gonna be glad it's done. Oh, you know, a lot of it is, you know, definitely just the fact that my build was deliberately stupid. But it It's been the most annoying one to do it with. Do it like this by far. Havel's ring plus three. That's uh, not useful for us, really. Hmm. Okay, alright. Those ones have not taken notice of me. Okay. That's just... I would have probably had 25 faith already. Uh, stupid, stupid, stupid. Okay. I don't need to go over there anymore. There is literally nothing for me there. Question is, what could I get if I went over this way? It's another Ring of Night 2, which, alright. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, what? 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 Oh, please, I, alright. Dodge. Hmm. 2. Of course there are two Ring of Knights over there. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Thanks. Ah. Uh. What would happen if I went over this way? Would I be able to get a shortcut back? Would I be able to get a shortcut back to where I wanted to go before the start of the area? Or dodge? Let me see. Alright, is this... Oh, it's Lap. Lap is over here. Hi, I guess. Uh, eat this game. I mean, there's gotta be... There's no bonfire around here anywhere. Okay. Oh well. Oh, covetous gold rings. That's for farming. And here we are again. Hello. How goes things? Horrible! I'm rather running in I hate it here! I can't find the okay. magic one. And I've searched high and low. It's gonna be a gimmick. No, it is. What do I know? Not really. My guts to you. Just forget it all. Like a good hollow wood. Yeah. Sorry. See, just a It's There's no bonfire. There's nothing of note around any of these places. There's just nothing to get. Uh something up over that way, but I can't find it. Mm. Whatever. I just hate this place. Oh, please. Okay. Hmm. Alright. Just gonna run through this place and not look back. I. Oh, another Judicator Giant. Great. Just what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Okay. Here is... Oh, the Preacher Locust had. Huh. It's only gonna get worse from here, isn't it? Yeah, probably. I just... Locust Preacher over there, and... Hmm. I mean, usually I like to fight things. But I'm just running now. Okay. Bonfire lit. 
This is the bonfire. Ring City Streets. Okay, cool, whatever. And Visions of Loyalty. Does not open from this side? Really? Whatever. It's an awfully boring strategy, though. I just... I know it's probably at least partially intended, but the sheer hostility of this area is aggravating. Hmm. Let's see, what can I get over here? I just... Uh, uh, and dodge and... I wonder what these guys are actually weak to. If anything. And of course, there is another Judicator Giant around there. It's a little locust. And. Hello, hello. One, two, three, four. I. I'm just losing my sanity. And those are a lot of level ups that I could have gotten. And they're just totally down the shitter now. Kill that Judicator Giant. Uh, where is he? Over there, and... Sneak up on you? Probably can. Okay. Cool. Presumably you would try summoning something, but... Dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, dodge. Thanks. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, goodness. These locusts are surprisingly tough. And what are you doing now? I, all right. Stab, stab, stab. And there we go, there we go. Nice. And what else? Hidden blessing. Presume that hammers would be good on them. And, of course, there's another one of those clerics. Stupid. Okay. Feasting branch. Come on, come on. And I... Right. And... Come on. Oh, you have a grab attack. Isn't that great? Okay. Cool. One, two. Surprisingly tough. And... Cool. Feasting branch and... Oh, goodness. I, okay. Fun. Not. I shall partake. I shall partake. That's what they mean when they talk about letting the feast begin, I guess. Thanks. Slam. Luckily, we can pretty easily take you out. That attack it. Hmm. Let's start up than I expected. Okay. Soul of a weary warrior. Okay. If I recall correctly, Nadir will show up over that way. But I... Mm -mm. We're good night, straight sword. Hi. And so, despite his wearing armor, his the delicate thing, he lived in fear. So is that Egon? The shrivel shadows not. Peace to begin. Things that nod. Such a creature. That would be. Arena, I believe. Oh. Okay. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Did I already. Oh, this is where I went. This is where I went. Well, there's two doors, and I don't know what I'd do with them. I would interact with them or what. Hi, Locust. Oh, you're running to get your dad or whatever. Okay. Thanks. Dodge and... One, two... Oh, okay. Alright. One, two, three, four. Crush. One, two, three. Cool. 
Good damage. Hmm. Locust creatures, though, are annoying. Oh, they're high. One, two, three, four. Slam. One, two. Okay. One, two, three, four. Pale Pine Resin for magic. Sometimes they drop their arms, which you can use as an item. Oh, so there's some just locust heads hiding in there. Interesting. That's funny. So there should be some other things over this way before we go over there to the church into Madeira. Oh, they're high. Oh, a hello, cleric. Stupid, stupid, and... Come on, don't heal. Don't heal me. Don't kill my enemies. No upon resin and another annoying hollow cleric. One, two, three, four. Okay, alright. These so seem a little easier to take out, I guess. Uh, stupid. Hmm. There's somebody doing something. Okay, you're over there. When are you gonna stop running from me? Alright, I guess each of you runs to the next locust creature in sequence. Guess that would make some sense. Okay. Purging Monument is somewhere, I know that much. So many of these bugs. Okay, cool. Thank you, and just peace. Two and alright. Oh, thanks. Okay. Come on, come on. Hit, 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 and dodge. Thanks. One, two, three. Dodge. My goodness. One, two. Hmm. Running two of these guys at once is unenviable. Okay, cool. I should probably cart this up again. Yeah. Not a lot of enemies other than the locusts. Okay. Come on it. Oh, right. I didn't have it clipped. Okay. Come on. Oh, come on. Thanks. And, alright, let's. Two and. Oh, I did that wrong. Okay, alright. And. Thanks, thanks. Okay, cool. At least that's not horrible. It's just. All those Herald Knights, the Ring Knights, and the Curse Enemies. There's so many things going on. Most of them were incredibly intolerable. It's over this way. Hopefully something at least somewhat worth getting. I need... Another level or something. Hi there, hello. Run it. Sunny down. Oh goodness, I'm alright. And slash kill, thanks. And who is White White Birch Bow? There's one more somewhere, and I okay, right there. Okay, one, two, three, four, and crush. White Birch Bow. What does White Birch Bow do? So, oh, and a Titanite Shock, and you over here. Two, three, four. All right. Thanks. White Birch Bow is. I think it's the longest range bow, actually. My right, Bridge Bow, Unseen Arrow, Heroic Abyss Walker, Enchilant of Sources, Light Manipulating Magic. Oh, Invisible Arrows. Well, Translucent Arrows, I suppose. And. Oh, come on. Uh, what? You can see me from there? Stupid. Come on. And. One, two, three, four, and. Slam. So is this. Familiar only had a giant. Oh, more young white branches. Interesting. I know that eventually the giant we saw earlier should die of natural causes, I believe, and that should lead to, if I recall correctly, being able to get his hawk ring, I think. Not entirely sure. So, one, two, three, four, five... Six, seven, eight, and okay, all right. Oh my, okay. What? What? Huh? Thanks, I guess. All right. I'm just glad you didn't kill me. Kill me. Oh, come on, come on. 
One, two, three, four, five. Okay, all right, and cool. Slim and one, two. Okay. So what's over here? Rubbish. Well, you know that's life. Sometimes the only reward for your trouble is rubbish. Dodge. Okay. Uh, the clang that happened was aggravating. Okay, now you're dead. Good. Hmm. Approaching monument is gonna be somewhere. It's gonna say show your humanity, and we have to use. Well, we could equip chameleon, but we don't have it right now, so it'd be better to just use a young white branch. Or a bunch until we hopefully get our humanity sprite transformation, maybe. Thanks, thanks. Die. Is this going to be the monument or somewhere maybe around here? All these guys are praying around it, so quite frankly I presume. Presume it be. Okay. Two, three, four. And no, I guess that's an option too. Group is always an option. And yep, here will it sing Church Guardian Shiv. Ah, okay. No message, so this is not the place. Church Guardian Shiv is interesting because it's basically a slightly weaker but infinite throwing knife that uses FP instead of the yeah, consumable item. What is these Herald Knights or former Herald Knights? One of you is definitely going to come back to life, right? To a random dragon slayer armor as a basic enemy. Oh, I should have taken chaos pet messages then. Dodge. One, two, and dodge. Oh, all right. Slap. Okay, all right. And okay, and okay. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, please, please. I okay. I actually forgot about this one. Okay. Cool. And, oh, alright, alright. Thanks, thanks. I mm. uh, dodge. Oh, please. Slam, and... It's good damage, but I just did not expect this of all things. One, two, three, four. And... Oh, come on, and... Alright. We could try taking this guy down. One and Do oh, all right. Okay. Two and all right. And dodge. One two dodge. Oh well, thanks. One two and three. One two three four. Dodge, dodge. What? Okay. Hmm. Stupid. Huh. Oh. So. What I need to do is just rush to the end and kill it. There are a lot of technically optional, but truly obnoxious encounters here. Hmm. Just gotta have our fire set up. Pure pyro set up. untenable. You know, every minute something new shows up and just wrecks me. Okay. Just question is, how am I gonna avoid the notice of that giant? Because it seems he does respawn. Don't like that. Hmm. Okay. Annoying locust preacher. 
It's the other way of everything. No, it's not how much I was struggling and decided to try to make things worse. I'm not particularly powerful. The only reason I survive anything at all is because I know how to target enemy weaknesses and have to do that every single time. I have nothing else going for me. Okay, here you are. Hi. And, okay, cool. Interesting. Yeah, but a rain strategy makes this a lot better. Don't really block all that much. And, oh, okay. Oh, thanks, thanks. Okay. Don't worry, even if you weren't, I wouldn't kill you. It'd be a little excessive, frankly. Dodge, dodge, okay, thanks. This is by far the best option when you're dealing with this. Just pyromancy spam and just dodge and do one more, one more. There we go, goodbye. See ya. Won't miss ya. And oh, the Iron Dragon Slayer set. So that's how we can get those items. There we go. But it really was all just about what we had equipped at the time. That made the difference every single way. Well, you know what? We're not set up for anything right now. I can at least get two quick levels here. Whatever. Vigor. Vitality. Okay. Endurance, maybe a little luck. Watch for the next level, it would be... About... Hmm. There's two more of these. Okay. And then we need about a thousand more. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's get a little more endurance. Okay. Cool. And we'll be chilling. Thank you. Uh, I'm just. I'm at wit's end. Almost. There might be some more bits left somewhere I haven't discovered. And the prisoner's chain and the... Almost, almost. Hmm. We equip our hammers, I guess. Actually, spears and hammers. And then we... It's the other hand, and it was... Okay. Hopefully. We'll see. But running into that Iron Dragon Slayer in there, unexpected, was... Talk about a nasty surprise. Go back here. Don't have any undead. Cannot kindle any further. It's interesting that it still shows that option. Okay. Uh, maybe you can. I'm not sure I can. Mm. Well, generally, I try to prepare myself by, well, maybe you wouldn't, because unlike me, you would probably be running something more resembling an actual build. Okay, so we gotta kill that giant. Go down. Pour out this swamp. See what I can get. Should be more items around. There's definitely a view over here. Oh, there. Judicator. And of course you're... Alright. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, goodness. Please, please. What? Huh? 
All right. Oh, I didn't think they could do that. I didn't think that one could use that. Oh, whatever. Okay. Well, as long as you didn't deliberately avoid building HP, you would probably end up fine. The only build I could think of that would arguably be worse than the one that I'm running right now is the same kind of build, except you don't level HP at all. Other than that, I don't think... Okay, alright. And dodge. Thanks. Hey, what? Huh? Interesting. One, two, and... Alright. This was some struggle. Two, three, four, five, and... Of course, Leto is... Alright. Come on, come on. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Do oh, please. Uh, dodge. One, two, three, four, and... Five and one more. What? Oh. I just. Killing that giant was. Hmm. Weirdly easy the first time around. Maybe it was just I waited for him to get farther away first. Possible. Okay. Hmm. Oh, whatever. In the end, the spears are all disappointing. Okay. Come on, we gotta. Gotta see if we can approach you from behind. Let's see. Now we can approach you. Oh, please. I, you've got to be kidding me. Oh. Everybody is... Okay. Sub and... Okay, there is... Wait, what? Huh? Excuse? What? I didn't know that was an option. Huh? Okay. Alright. And just... Wait, oh. Stab, stab, and there we go, finally. Okay. Maybe there's locusts. Yeah, he... He literally busted out a new attack that I'd never seen him use before. Literally, what was up with that? Dodge. Okay. One, two, three, four. Slam. One, two, and dodge. Okay. And hit. Thanks. Okay. I'm a soldier. One, two, three, four. Slam. One, two, three. Oh my goodness. One, two, and what? Excuse me. One, two, and. Okay, luckily, there isn't really tracking on that. Let's go a little bit forward. I guess the question was I don't know whether that was. I wonder who he summoned. I feel like that might have been an illusory version of Carla. It's possible. Okay. One, two, three, four. Slam. One, two, three. Oh, can we can hit you midair. That's wrong. Okay. Nice. And one, two. Oh, what? Okay, alright. Knowing locus. Two, three, and alright. And fire does. Turn it from a two hit to a three, uh, three hit to a two hit, which is 
Notable. Oh, they're high. One, two, three, four, dodge. Oh my, what? Huh? Okay. Hmm. And, oh, oh, all right, all right. One, two, three, four, dodge. What, what, what? Okay. Dodge. One, two, and, oh, all right. One, two, three, dodge. And, one, two. Ah. Uh, this is obnoxious. That, I presume, would be their grab attack. Soul the name of Soldier. Don't really think they're soldiers, though. Okay. Thanks. Okay. So we got a couple of Ringing Knights over here, and I think one of them is going to drop their great swords, I believe. Oh, they're high. One, two. Dodge. One, two. Oh, but I. Oh, I. What? Oh, no. 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 What? I can't fight three of these bastards at once. I can hardly even fight one of them. Oh. Uh, I mean, I guess the question is what are they weak to? Because I don't know. Two. Oh, come on. What? Uh. Yeah, I. One, two. Uh. One of them stepping back. One. One, two, three. Oh, uh, come on. What? Really, you're okay. Uh, okay. What? Thanks. One, two. What? What? Okay. What in the hell are Ruby Knights actually weak to, if anything? Do they have weaknesses? Do they? It's gonna be lightning, isn't it? I swear to God. The one thing we can't use worth a shit. Oh, they're weak to dark. Hmm. Interesting. In that case, maybe I... Let me see. Got a lot of those. Question would be then... Let's go back to... Firelink. This door is not to take. Twenty-five. Hmm. Okay. Question is, would Kaitha's chime or some less talisman be better? Sunless talisman versus Kaitha's chime. Uh, does get better in the end. Versus hmm. Isla's staff. And that. No, the chime's gonna get better. It's not even close. Okay. Use a medium sized soul and upgrade that thing a bit. Hmm. Uh, then, all right. Oh, we don't have the souls for a while. Okay. Okay. It's going to be in the end, or ultimately our best of dark casting option, at least for miracles, so that's good and all. Might be a little better at the moment, but 
kind of like this gets better in the end. And eyes list up, and we don't have the time that's for it yet. Would not get as high. <laughs> we could try just using Gnaw, but we could also... 25 faith, and we got a better dark miracle to just spam on Ring of Nights. That could be nice. We could try Gnaw right now. Well. Mm -hmm. I am losing my mind. Okay. Do that. Put the spears. And what did we... Something seems to be a bit off. Oh, because it's elephant instead of drain? I think. Instead of drain shoes. That'll be closer then. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Okay. The stuff's over there. Go through, kill the locusts, and then fight those Ringed Knights? I don't know, probably better. I don't know. Oh, please. I... Uh, what? Dodge, 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 and... Come on, I need some of that, and... Okay, Wado's over there, interesting. And... What? What? Huh? Hajime Mashtenji, I am... I'm in hell. I was, I've lost a bunch of big bloodstains because Ringed City is... It's got hands. How are you doing? Hmm. Your art. I had a bit of rage, to say the least. We did get Kaipa's chum up a little. I'm doing okay. The goal is to finish things out so that I'm free to do the potential Mario Kart rally on Sunday and also just other stuff. I'm also going to need some souls in order to procure a bunch of arrows for the Madeir fight. do intend to be using a bow for that. Hi, hello. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, goodness. Okay. Cool. Oh, what? Alright. Two ends. Thank you, thank you. Well, thank you for watching. I'm sure we'll live. Hmm. Can I stab and... What am I gonna... One, two... Wait, oh, wait, oh! Okay, alright. And... Uh, okay, there we go. What? Alright. Huh? Oh, his ghost stayed around. His ghost stays around even when he... Okay. Interesting. Interesting. So I went and fought Leto. Leto was also behind me leaving, losing a big bloodstain earlier. So I'm not exactly fond of him. I have a bit of my own vendetta. But... There have been a lot of deaths. Frankly, the bosses haven't been nearly as bad as the actual areas themselves. It really, it really makes you feel like you're playing Demon Souls. <clears throat> and there are those three Ringed Knights over there. And I think I'm gonna need to get... Doris is gnawing for them. Because I leveled up Kyphus Shine just to have a good... Dark option to use. But... I know... Some of them do drop useful things, so... Okay, cool. Oh, alright. One, two, three, and... Charge! One, two, three, and... Oh! Oh, you didn't hit me? Okay, interesting. Sub, and... There we go! Finally! Okay, cool. Only a couple more levels, and I can go back to... Use... Ah. Doors is gnawing, and those... 
multiple ring of knights over there, but for now I'm just poking around the swamp. I went and killed that other Dragon Slayer armor over there earlier by way of Chaos Bed Vestiges, which is, of course, usually the best way to deal with them. But as for now, I'm trying to see everything I can find in the swamp before I go and knock down the deer for the first time and then probably go fight him. Most likely. We did encounter Shira on the streets, so it'll be fun. Come on. I did mention it before, I think, but my game plan for fighting the deer is to actually use Millwood Grebo. Because I do need the racks, and it would allow me to avoid having to chase him down, which is oftentimes some of the trouble from what I've heard. Also, it's just fun to be able to actually use a bow or something in a Souls game, because they're usually not very good, as I'm sure you're aware. In particular, I... It's like that one time where I fought god skins and had to use sleep arrows for that. And that is almost definitely, undeniably, the best way, except for arguably other kinds of sleep-related strategies. But, yeah, fighting godskins without sleep is probably inadvisable. Unless you're crazy. Maybe even if you are. Depends on the kind of crazy. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. And anything over here? I did pick up a good few things, especially by the armor, but lots of other baby locusts and locust preachers who I want to eliminate before other stuff happens. That locust over there. Clearly that's gonna be... Oh, preacher's arm. Because that is a staff if we really wanted to, but I do not want to. It's not very good. It's mostly for its weapon, gimmick, and... Oh, hello. And right, talking about and so, Arena and Egon. Okay. Then we can go back around and quite a few more I want to get. 25 faith, so I can go over and spam Doris is gnawing on. Those Ring of Knights, because they're slightly weak to dark, and they've got enough HP that being able to prot and bleed would make the fight... Meaningfully easier, I think. It's the idea, at least. So, hello there, hello. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, not. There we go. Cool. Wish they were like those flies in Ariandel and they would take double damage while they were in midair. That would certainly make them a little bit more manageable. Okay, cool. Slam and a right dodge. And one, two. So the little locusts are here, the creatures are not. I wonder why. Oh, come on. Okay, die. Thanks. That over there, I presume, is going to be where I'm going to get Ringed Knight Straight Sword. I think I should try, actually. Let's just try seeing how long Gnaw works on these guys. That takes longer than I might like. Oh, and interesting. The bleed build up. Hmm. Are they bleedable? I don't even know. And, alright, so here we can dodge. Okay, oh, alright. Don't know if that was the bleed or that. Presume that was the bleed damage showing up. Okay, alright, and I, Okay, alright, and. Oh, come on, alright. Okay, so... Doris's gnawing is going to be a better option by far, but it's a fun attack. It's got a lot of personality, for sure. You can just gradually spin... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, cool. Thanks, and just out of my way, and... Oh, please. You've got to be kidding me. He shall partake. Fear not the dark, my friend. Let the feast begin. I should have focused on you first. Except, well, whatever. Come on, come on. And uh, please, please, dodge, dodge. What? What? Okay. Come on, come on. I, mm. 
Yeah, but... The, the increased bleed buildup is... Well, he did Perto. I hope I was tasty. Okay. So I cannot afford to go anywhere near those Ringed Knights, unless I knew there were no Lucas creatures around. And quite frankly, the time it takes to cast that spell was surprising. That said, the other issue was just... I wasn't as serious as I should have been in the sense that if I was really intended to take him down with Gnaw, what I should have done was use... Oh, that's right. If I've got Crystal Charm, I don't need... got Kythus Charm, I don't need Crystal. Now that makes a significant weight limit difference, but still. Put Karthus up, we kill the Judicator Giant again, hopefully. Get that big Bloodstain back, and... Doris is nine. Doris is nine. It's a very, very cool area. And... I can't decide how I feel about the earlier part of Ring City Streets. Because, on one hand, on one hand, I died a bunch. Also, I lost a huge bloodstain because my controller malfunctioned. My controller just decided to stop reading inputs for a bit. And got me continuing to go left just moving left, which is something that's actually happened to me a decent amount of times. Happened to me once when I was fighting Sanctuary Guardian, which was a lot less relevant because, you know, Sanctuary Guardian is a little bit easier to deal with, but, uh, uh just stab, do oh, okay. Stab, stab, dodge, dodge, okay. There we go, finally. Okay. Uh, time to kill more locusts. This is the fate I've consigned myself to. Okay. Karthus. Clan souls by killing locusts. Okay, enough for Doris is gnawing. Pretend that, pretend that I enjoy my life. Do oh, okay, cool. Alright. Interesting. Kill the mini locusts. It raised the question of what specifically is the relation between the big locust and the little locust. It's basically the locust dad or what? Who knows? Okay. We're getting in range of another level up. That one locust preacher over there is a couple and I need to take them out without provoking. The Ringed Knights, or at least not both of all of them. But go around the side area. Go around the side, get that item. Take one of them down with Nob, but if I'm wanting to take down three of them, I'm going to need something better. As in, Doris is gnawing. And a little bit more faint. There we go, and hello here. Thanks, and just being a soldier. Got souls, but I'm not a soldier. Hail upon resin, and where are you going? It is interesting how they seem to be hopping over to try to find another locust creature. To, I guess, give them sucker. So, we need our miracle related rings and our dark clutch ring. Take off our hammers and. yeah. Use gnaw on them. I guess we could equip a big heavy helmet. Take this nasty looking winged knight helm. Hello there, hello. Hi. And just spam gnaw on you. Oh, the damage is almost a double. It's wild. And it's. I don't presume that the shield's blocking the bleed build up. It might be, actually. Here. Yeah, I okay. Ah, interesting. All right, and dodge. Thank you. And just go and dodge. Okay, thanks. You are quite weak to dark, but ha uh ha. -huh. I honestly, I'd probably be better off just having dark blade to use then. Interesting. If I could use dark blade on them. Oh, come on. Alright. Hmm. 
life. All right. You know that did kind of work. Still worked a decent amount better. What kind of souls do I have to use? I'm not gonna be able to just brute force my way to a level up like I would like to. That's a shame. Black Witch Veil. So that's an alternate option to other Zoli hat. Hmm. Hat down over there. Nothing really. So anything here or? No. I guess not. I, mean, I guess I could have dropped down off there if I'd gone to that part of the church, but that's Calamy, presumably. So we are almost to the end of the area. That's nice. Almost. I should put on... I could try just fighting the other Wingnut Knights. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait a little. That's... Okay, I... Is there somebody getting close and I don't like that? Is there a chain and... Oh, please, you've got to be kidding me. And is that even an actual shield? I don't think so, frankly. Come on, we need to run. We need to book it. Then it's Ring of Favor, and the, oh goodness, last one was Pontiff Ring, and we run out of the way of you, and you don't know I exist anymore. You don't know I exist anymore. You can go away and not see me again. Okay, cool. Let's go back over here, and, so we can find, getting these other locusts down. Thank you. Thank you. Dodge. What was that attack? Who knows, really? Thank you, and... Oh, come on. I... Alright. And dodge. Slam, slam. Pick up the item. Okay, so those over there... Okay, there was another thing on a rock over here that I missed because I was closer to the church when I surveyed this before. Another Titanite Shark. It's so many chunks and so many scales, and the, frankly, I don't have many more things that I particularly want to upgrade anymore. I'm kind of okay when it comes to that. I have my spears, I have my hammers, I have my silksword twin blades. There's really nothing else that comes to mind in terms of, yeah, I want to use this, and I want to give it some titanite so that I can use this. Okay, there are a few items. Item right here. Titanite scale. Again, don't need this. This is where the Dragon Slayer was. Killed us once, and then we used Chaos Bad Vestiges and trivialized it because it doesn't know how to actually block, apparently. Not that I'm mad about that. Okay. So over here, and I'm glad that none of those Herald Knights are alive. It is fun to be able to plunge down and hit them that way. Kill them with a plunge. Okay. Which monument isn't here, though? Thank you. Alright. I guess these hollow clerics are a lot easier to take down. Yeah, when my controller malfunctioned and I died and lost a huge blood stain, I got killed by a hollow cleric, which was incredibly embarrassing. Because it was just. I was walking around in circles and it was just slowly swiping at me. And I, I managed to make it work again by literally smacking the darn thing. But the funny thing about it is... The only reason I was able to get... What I should have done was unplug it and try to make it work by mouse. And that might have worked. Hopefully. I don't know. But at least... I would have been able to control myself while awaiting my, I guess, inevitable demise. It was just truly infuriating, especially since, given that Doris's would be a bit of an improvement, I would be able to, hmm, I would be able to fight those Ring Knights better if I had a couple other levels of souls right now, I mean, levels of faith right now. That's life, that's life. Thank you. It is good that I'm able to take down those locust creatures with... A single combo, as long as it's fully extended. One full stamina of our takes those guys down. Thanks. And where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, just those ring knights over there. Place where I'm pretty sure Calamite starts. And Calamite is weak. Calamite's weakest to 
piercing, actually. He's not actually as weak to lightning as you would expect, which is part of why I'm using, gonna be using a bow for the actual boss fight. Oh, come on. Alright. Really? Really? Okay. Die. Oh, not, not that- Oh, I messed up. Let's, we should still have enough for enough flame marks for the rest of the area, but still. But over there, it was just Church Guardian Shiv, I'm pretty sure. I didn't see anything saying show your humanity, so I presume that's going to be all there. And, alright, okay. Thanks. Purging Monument, clearly it's, clearly I'd say it's not there. Presume it would be. Thanks, thanks. Slam. Thank you, and hit. And, alright, thanks. One, two, three, four, and a little bit. Oh no, we messed that up. Set up two and dodge. No, you won't. You won't partake. Sorry. Down here is. Is that. Baby? Yeah, sorry. Oh well, that's live. This is where we got some rubbish before. Thank you, and. Oh, okay. Luckily, if we just. If we just stay under him, actually, instead of trying to dodge back, he can't get me at all. As long as they don't panic, there's not much he can actually do to me. Interesting, so... Getting back to where we were before, the swamp isn't actually all that big. There's a big giant and also a... Is there something behind me? There's something skittering. Giant, and at least on the first go, Dragon Slayer armor as a mini boss. Which is still wild. I respect it, but it's wild. This is where. Surround where Waiter's Tower was. There we go, we got another one of you, and I think it was just a soul over here. Oh my goodness. Die. Come on, come on, and. These guys are honestly. I kind of wish. That, that weird sort of heal yourself and hurt people around you spell is something the player actually had access to. Because the idea behind it is honestly unmatched. I wonder if that deals magic damage or physical damage, right? Because I know that Emit Force and Wrath of the Gods in this game do physical damage. That is the funniest thing about Miracles and Souls, frankly. The primary damage type of miracles just kept changing from game to game. So in the original, most damaging miracles don't magic... Well, actually, most relevant ones don't magic damage. But even if you did have Lightning Spear and... Okay, thanks. Well, actually, that's not true, because you had... Emit Force and Wrath of the Gods dealt magic damage. And then you had three Lightning Miracles. But it was basically somewhat evenly divided. But then in Dark Souls 2, every offensive miracle dealt lightning damage. Even Emit Force and Wrath of the Gods, if I recall correctly. And then in Dark Souls 3, it's lightning damage in some cases of physical damage, unless your name is Dark Moon Blade, I suppose. Because Emit Force and Wrath of the Gods were changed to deal physical damage. And, okay, so there are more locusts over there. Oh, they call me the locust killer. The exterminator. And, alright. Thanks, and die. Okay. Oh, interesting. Thanks. Okay. Yeah, I just want to kill all these locusts. I should have enough souls to get what I need in way of... Oh, goodness. Okay, dodge. I managed to dodge that pretty narrowly, frankly. One, two, three. And then we can level up her faith a bit so we can use Doris' gnawing on various... Oh, goodness. Okay. Various ring knights around the city. And use the spears and... Some kind of enchantment on the herald knights. Actually, in that case, I would probably be best off using... Oh. Lightning Blade, because once I got to 25 Faith, I'd be able to use Lightning Blade if I had Priestess Ring equipped. And that would be a good thing to use against 
Herald Knights, Lightning Grain Spears, Grain Twin Spears with Zerita Piercing and a Lightning. And then you get the Plunge, and that might actually one-tap on a Plunge. The issue has been that I get the Plunge, the special Plunge on the Herald Knights is, because you may or may not know this, but when you kill a Herald Knight, I mean, but when you do a Plunging Attack on a Herald Knight from high up enough, get stuck in it like you would with, say, a Taurus Demon, or maybe more relevantly for Dark Souls 3, the Ancient Wyvern. And, hello, sorry. Sorry. And where are... All these little locust heads just chilling out. Sorry. Not really. Just gotta go for a few more bonfires over that way, other creatures that way, and this is the start of the area, back where that old night was. Yeah, but we are close to getting what I need in terms of... Hollow mm -hmm. Clerics, another item over there, and... Oh, hello, and... Wait, what? Wait, what? Can I... Wait, I hear somebody coming. Oh, thanks! Oh, because you... You crawled out of... You crawled out of here! I forgot about that. You crawl out of this place. Right, stupid. Okay. So, I didn't see them because I wasn't close enough to see them. Great. How far are you gonna go? Heat these guys with a fiery passion and you are just too fast. Come on. Thank you, Locust, and wait. Did you run away? Did they just flee? Did they go back to their starting position at least, or what? Okay. Thanks. Feasting Branch is funny. I don't have an intelligence build, and no real reason to use it. But I feel like it could be fun to show off the weapon art at least once. It's silly enough. People actually do get good use out of it in PvP. Interestingly enough. Another Locust. Okay, we're close to the level up we need then, and... And I want to go over, kill some remaining Ring of Knights. Try out my lightning on the Herald Knights, and okay, cool. Maybe unlock that purging monument if it's around here for good old Mr. Lap. We're close. Oh goodness, I have, hold on. Come on, just. It's a good thing that those Herald Knights don't seem to be too observant. Yeah, and if only we could do that attack too. Why do all these cool, weird, holy miracles get limited to these really annoying and stupid holo players? And... okay, then you just keep doing that, I guess. Okay, cool. Die, die. So what's on here? What's on here? Thanks. Yeah, because that's basically an offensive version of projected heal, but it's just not something the player can ever use. Anything here? No, no. Alright. It's Herald Knights. I will take you out one day, inshallah. Yeah, I do have enough now to get a couple level ups. Let's go back to Firelink. And then we can just rush through the area after. Now we've killed everything and don't need to feel like we've missed anything. Okay. Quite frankly, I think 25 is as far as I need to go stats-wise. The funniest idea would be get to 27 so I could just barely wield the Ring of Night pair of great swords, but no. That's excessive. Then we can get a bit of faith, and there we go. Finally, with Priestess's Ring, we will have enough to wield. Lightning Blade. Cast Lightning Blade. I'll need to put my spears back on and... Our stated error will be 314, but due to the Luxian and Holland fusion, it's actually 324, which isn't all that much higher, but it's meaningful. And then Tring Hammers, though, it would be 330, only a little bit higher. And to be fair, Dring <sighs> Sharp Infusion would technically do a bit more damage, but at maximum level, Hollow actually does do best. And maybe one day, I would like to do that. So, the idea would be, we go back to Ringed City Streets, 
I equip lightning, bl uh, lightning blade and doors is nine. Then I take out those ringed knights, some herald knights, and clear out the initial street area. Then we go over to Madir, fight him. Yeah, we can slowly upgrade our things, and we need 30 for that, but we can just use that with the Priestess's Charm, and now we can just use that straight up. No complications. And big, big. I believe this is... The one that just summons one little... little sort of swirly spiral of insects. Didn't really get an equivalent in Elden Ring, but this one got its equivalent in... Swarm of Flies. That's gonna be interesting. Doesn't cost a lot, too. Just wanna see how much faster it casts with. It seems to be faster, too. Sage is written. How fast will this cast? The Dex, we got the faster it will cast on its own, so. It's a little bit, but we're already approaching sort of fall off point. So we'll be alright. But, so if we're fighting the Herald Knights, we want. Okay, Priestess's Ring, and this is. This is gonna be good for us right now. Just gotta make sure we have. I guess we could keep Priestess Lot in the other. Chime the other spot just for. Oh, we should try out and see which chime is going to be best for buffing. Right now, AR is at 324. Is that. Now it's at 453. Wow. 453. 453 with priest time. 455. Very slightly better. And with crystal. Which in theory should be worse. Should be the worst. So Kythus is good, but that is 467. So wait. So is the faith scaling just better at this point? I think that's part of it. The faith scaling just better, or is... Mm -hmm. The wiki wrong when it says that only the faith part of the spell buff applies to a weapon buff. So in that case, at least right now, I'm getting a lot out of Lightning Blade. Okay, what I want to see, actually, in that case is... Whether Crystal Chime or the other one is going to do better with... Doors is 9. That's 453 versus... I think that bled. 477, so it... Oh, and it insta-procs bleed, too. That's insane. Wow! Now that... That's quite good. Kind of wish I'd had this in order to... Use on Nameless King or something. That might have been better than... Fireball, maybe. Well, alright. This is going to be better for casting Dark Miracles, and the Crystal Chime will be better for using Lightning Blade. So... Well, we'll be alright. Big thing is we need Tears, and then... We get up... The Over by the Herald Knights, eventually, but first we should... Oh, but... Well, Doris is Nine doesn't actually cost a lot. It costs a lot, and also bleed might be good against that one hog cleric who's going to be annoyingly guarding the ladder for me. Okay, well. Dodge. Oh, interesting. Yeah, that it is good. It is good against him. And okay, cool. Let's do that again. And cool. Dodge. Wait, what? Huh? Okay. What? Okay, cool. Interesting. Okay, never mind, I guess. Let's go back to the bonfire. Oh, I need to have Drang Hammer's temporarily equipped just to wreck this guy, and then it's spam Dark Miracles on the very, very annoying Ring of Knights in various areas, and... I like that I've been able to get decent use out of the Twin Spears. It, unlike Cell Swords and Cell Sword Twin Blades and Ring Hammers, 
if I'm only doing the first hit of the combo, only one of the two hits is actually going to be piercing thrust damage, thrust damage. Which is a little annoying, but even in spite of that. Okay, there the Herald Knights are, so. Mark the Herald Knights seeing. Oh, okay. Cool. And oh thanks. Great! That really makes my day. Great. Hold on. Take that guy out first. And then I can get the Herald Knights in position, I believe. Presumably. Hmm. Only I wonder if those plunging attacks count as critical attacks and would be boosted by Hornet Ring. It could be worth a try. It's definitely worth a try, but I'm not exactly expecting that. Well, actually, in that case, I may as well lightening up the hammer in order to just take out that one cleric a bit faster, but given the AR is pretty much the same as the spears... Hmm. Alright. Shouldn't make that much of a difference. We can make the knights show up and we can kill the knights. It's just... Feel a profound desire to have killed every enemy at least once. Oh, come on. And of course you're doing your own things. Come on, just die, die, and slam, slam, and die, and... Please. Are the knights coming? Well, they're here at least. They're alive, but I don't think they're here. There we go. Good stuff. I wonder what that actually does for my AR. If I want to be really funny, what I could do is I could actively re-equip and unequip Priestess's Ring just to cast the spell and then change to something else. It's an idea. Probably not a good idea, given that the buff will stay active, regardless of what I'm using. Okay, cool. I can definitely land a plunge from here. Definitely land a plunge from here. So... Hmm. Wait until we get to a point. I can cast my buff. Thank you. Then we'll... Take our spears up and- oh, thanks, alright, and... Thank you, thank you, and... Oh, oh, wait, wait, what? Huh? Huh? I- interesting, I was not expecting... Wait, wait... Is it not as much of an AR increase as... Karthus Waymark? I guess it's possible. Still, it's just not doing as much as I expected. Well, whatever. We'll be able to spam Dark Miracles on Ring of Knights in the area, and that's the important thing. Okay, so we just do this repeatedly until I get sick of it. Hello there. Question is... Hmm? You're down there. Can I get this guy with a plunging attack, or... Roll and plunge, plunge. There we go! We actually managed to lock on. That's good. And did we... Oh, the buff's gone. Whatever. Alright. Thanks, thanks, and... Okay. Oh, please. Alright. Mm -hmm. Well, alright then. Maybe I should have tested some of this out a bit more. One, two, and... That didn't hit. Okay. Five, six... Seven and okay, cool. That's just oh, come on. She can't hit me here, and I'll just be able to drop straight down the ladder eventually. Hopefully, don't presume you'd have any kind of other abilities with. Oh goodness, what if I? Oh no! Oh no! Okay, come on. You gotta be. Uh, uh, oh. Leaves more than a little bit to be desired. And can I just dip off the ladder or what? Don't go, don't go. Oh no. Okay. This buff also just does not last as long as I would like it to. 
Okay. Come on, come on. Get back in a place where I can kill you adequately. Then, where are you going? Where are you coming? Coming around here and just... Thank you! Thank you! And... Alright. Thanks. One, two, three, four, five. And... Okay, alright. I... Okay, and roll. Roll. Thanks. Mm. These guys are tough. I think that's pretty undeniable. Okay, and... Oh, wait, I already got most of you. That's good. Okay, so there are three Herald Knights left in that area over there. I would like to kill a few more of them. Just so that I can say I've done it. Okay. Also, some Ring Knights over here by a lap. So in that case, I should probably switch to the full Dark Miracle setup. Maximize damage, but I'd like to keep Serpent Ring equipped, which would probably mean don't need that. Probably prefer. No, I don't need Sage's Ring, do I? I guess the question is, would I get more damage from a little bit more faith or a little bit more? Hmm. Let's do some mental math. Right now, the spell buff on the Kaifa is 152. If I take that off, it's 137. So that's a 8% increase versus a more than 10% increase, so we want that ring back. Okay. We do want to take off something. Oh, okay, we can take the spears off. Okay, cool. And over up here we've got some ringed knights. Over here, I don't see anything. Over that way, hmm, I'm going to get to the Purging Monument. Okay, and, huh, alright, go ahead, do your thing. Thanks, and, oh, goodness. And thank you, okay, alright, and, oh, come on, okay. You're in a position where you're not using your shield, which is good for me. Dodge, dodge, uh -huh. All right, then. Out of my way. Hmm. Let's just do that and... Hmm. What if I... Good damage. Good bleed. This is indeed very... What? Okay. That was really good on them, though. That was really good on them. Okay. The big question is, what deals more damage? I think Lightning Bite's still good to have, but... Hmm. Let's kill those Ring of Knights again, just to see if anything comes out of it. Probably won't, but I want to kill those guys anyway. We did kill those Herald Knights. So those two Ring of Knights over there are the only enemies I haven't actually yet. Slain, and then it would be just the Ring of Knights over on that church, and then we go and beat up Madeira, I guess. Sure. Got that. And ooh, ooh ah. Cold. And oh, right, because we don't have priestesses really equipped. Right! Well, we could. Let's get tears at least. And then. Guess right, instead of pontiffs, we get our priestess ring. Last hour. Lightning Blade, go back through. Avoid the stupid Herald Knights, kill those couple Ring of Knights. Anything else over there is something I've already dealt with, I'm pretty sure. There might be a ladder up somewhere, I'm not sure. The big thing is, eventually, we're gonna find a way to the Purging Monument. I'm gonna have to show my humanity, but I'm not sure what, exactly which. There's something about a church, and I'm not precisely sure. Oh, thanks. Okay, come on. And one, two, three, four, and... Oh, come on. I, oh, what? What? Okay, I don't like that. That was almost another big bloodstain loss. One, two, and... Oh, come on. I, okay. One, two, three, four, and... Oh, no. Oh, no. Not fun. Okay. One, two, three, four, and... Slam the hammer. Okay. Finding two of these guys at once is 
A special kind of hell. Okay. Thanks. Then we just gotta switch back to dark stuff. And then we have our Sun's first born ring. And take off our hammers and spam Kaifas. I mean Doris, Doris with Kaifas Chime. Uh, uh, May the Lord have mercy on my soul. It's getting increasingly difficult. Okay. So two of those guys are going to attack me at the same time. It's going to be hard to separate them two. But that over there, that up that way, is going to be a special kind of tough to get to. Oh, there, hello. Thanks, thanks. I'm just going to start doing this until you feel like no longer doing that. And, okay. Mm -hmm. Too close. Alright, and just dodge out of the way that ends. Come on, and... Thanks, thanks, and... Oh, goodness, I... Okay. Oh, what? No! Oh, come on. That was really silly. Just... There are two knights over there. There might be something behind them. I don't think there is. But... Is also the purging monument. Let me see. Purging monument. Any hollows? Streets, bonfire, hum show your humanity. Puzzle, swamp area, humanity, wall of the inscription. Wall of the inscription by the Ring City Streets bonfire. The hammers are good. But finding them two at once is kind of not really an option. Which is why, and the buoy does really good damage. The buoy does really, really good damage, but I just need it to actually proc. And I need to not fall off the edge, because that would have been, that was a pretty good go. I just fell off the edge, that was the primary issue. <laughs> Without that, I would have been... I, w I was going pretty well. It was going pretty well. But then I fell off the edge, and, well, you know, it stopped going well. Okay, so, well, let me void it up. Thank you. Take out those hollow clerics. And then go up, fight those knights again, and just need to find that show your humanity puzzle. You know where it is. Find that, and of course, the idea would just be there's a young white branch, I presume, but huh? some wall around somewhere. Show your humanity. Gotta do that before. Oh, this ends. Hello there, hi. And thank you. That should make things easier. I shouldn't have to heal the others now this way. So we just go up. The others don't see me here, that's good. I'm just will leave you behind this time. And then switch out to... It's interesting that I can't change my thing in my hand, but I can switch these out freely while I'm on a ladder. Okay, cool. Back to Doris's, and... Where is... There you are. Cool. Mm-hmm. Alright. So just... Boom and... Oh, my... Mm. Is it going close? Thanks, thanks. Alright, good job, and this is about where I'd like to be. Thank you, and get that bleed build up up. Thanks, and boom, boom, and alright. Alright, and hit. And oh, what? what? Really? Really? Never mind. Maybe the best way to do it might be actually getting in close and running around that big monument in the middle, or it would be actually, let me just see how much faster Sage's Ring actually makes it. Because hmm. the bleed is doing more damage than the rest. Yeah, that, that is a meaningful difference. Yeah, so we'll, we'll do Sage's instead of Dark Watch, especially since Dark Watch is also increasing the damage I take. Favor, Prisoner's Chain, and then 
Hammer's back and say my prayers, I guess. Hammers are fun. Like I said, yeah, they can't actually poise lock. I mean, poise break and therefore stun lock. The knight's pretty well, the issue is just... When I'm fighting two of them at once, it becomes much harder to do that. Especially since the chances of smacking off one of their shields becomes exponentially higher. And it does seem as if the bleed does a good amount of poise damage too. So if I can proc a bleed on them, I can keep them still, which is good. And it also just increases the damage dealt very significantly. Come on. If only that was in fact the player could actually use, then this game would be perfect. Maybe. So then we just put on Sage's Ring for speed and Miracle Boost Ring, take off. No, not that. Pythas. Pythas plus five. Dorses, and they don't see me. They don't see me. Interestingly enough, in beta, apparently, the name Doris was spelled D-O-R-R-I-S, which is more conventional, at the very least. Okay. And here we go. This should be a lot more doable now that we have some degree of alacrity with our casts. And there we go. That's good. Said we're also... Uh, boom, and... Yep, very, very nice damage. Cool, and just take that and... Oh, please, I... All right. Thanks, thanks, and... Mm. Thank you, and... Take that and... All right! We got a bleed proc successfully. Nice, and... Oh, goodness, I... Okay. Please, please, and... Mm. Okay, d oh, all right, and... Take that and... Oh, never mind. I guess, and... Let me... Thanks, thanks, and... Thanks. Rock that, and... Thank you, flies. Take you, and... Nice! Okay, we got you out of that, and there we go. Couple of chunks. Finally! It only took forever. Okay. That was fun. Once it actually worked. But the question is... How I'm going to get up there. That's the Persian Monument, and there... Show your humanity wall. Which presumably would be around if you're somewhere, maybe. And, oh, thanks. And you know what? Got this. Let's use it. Dodge it. Dodge it. Thank you. Oh, goodness. Okay. So I think the show your humanity wall should be somewhere around here. Could use Young Might Branches, but we should also have the Chameleon spell, I think. Let me see. Is this... No, it's not. Is it? Is it? Or is this Show Your Humanity Wall? Well, you know, I'll come back and find it at some later day. For now, I just need... Kill the other guys by that other segment. Back to the last resident bonfire. Cool. And it isn't costing me that much, which is nice. It's not an incredibly expensive miracle. With the setup I have, it isn't taking long to cast either. The question is just... Where do I go in order to use... The branch, it's somewhere in Ringed City Streets. I will simply Google the location because I am... Starting to lose grip on my sanity. Okay, cool. Let's just go around here and- Oh, thanks! I- alright. Just walk that that way. And of course Silver Knight Lado's over there. Okay. Cool. And how do we want to do this, then? Thanks. Okay. And all these other Ring Knights over this way, and just... All this bleed build up and mm, mm, oh my goodness. Oh and I forgot to I forgot to use tears, that's right. Okay, whatever. Okay, fine. And another cast and death. Thanks. But why does Lado show up over here too? Whatever. 
And interesting. Praise the dragon. So that would be. Oh, there's Madeir. Hi. See me four around from there. So that will be soon. Get up here. We could have gone that way too, but mm -hmm. on that side as well. And oh, hello. Hi. Just. Mm, oh well. All right. Thanks. Thanks. Boom. 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 And thanks. Boom. And wow. Okay. But wait. That didn't kill. Wait. What? Okay. Interesting. Conceptually. Okay. There we go. Another Titanite scale, and... So to get to Madeira over there, and also there should be... Something over this way now, too. Oh, we had to go... We had to do that in order to get up here in the first place. And I presume this will be a... Door I can unlock? Or is this the Show Your Humanity? This is Show Your Humanity. Time for Mimicry and then try Swamp. Okay. There we go. Okay. Hmm. So we can open that up, and that will be to right that bonfire over there. So we can open up the purging monument by just casting chameleon. Then, okay. So I will return here eventually. What is this? Visions of jumping off. Oh, this reminds me of Darkroot actually. And tight nut scale. And what are you doing? What is your deal? Oh, what? Okay. Huh. Just lots of knights, and I want to... Wait, what? Huh? Okay. Bleed rock. Bleed rock. Bleed rock again, and... One more, one more, and... Boom. Nice. That's so strong. You know, I don't... A few more levels would have been nice, but I am doing a good job anyway. Oh, hi, Kozu. We are about to knock a big dragon off of a ledge, hopefully. But before that, I'm taking down a few knights by way of literally sending swarms of flies at them, which is maybe not the nicest way to be doing things, but if it works, it works. It's what happens when you use dark miracles, I suppose. Like, like evil Jesus, I guess. I don't know. Okay. They did accuse... Talk about the Lord... I'm the Lord of the Flies, I guess. Exactly, I'm the Lord of the Flies. Okay. Come on, come on. I... Mm -hmm. And... Can we... Can we can block that successfully, which is good. And... Oh, I don't like this guy. This... Locust creature being here is... Not incredibly good for me. Let's we'll see how many procs we get. Oh, come on. Procs of weed we get on both of you. Is the Sometimes I believe we can actually get multiple weed instances and therefore deal more damage to an enemy. There's nothing over here, but I do want to kill the one remaining guy. Also, some other things. Then it would be. Okay, and you can't go over that wall, which is good for me. Hi there, hello. We and get that and get you and one more, one more will do it. One more should do it. And then another. And then good night. Hello, hello. And boom, boom. Okay, alright. We don't have tears up, so we need to make sure they don't kill us. Hello there, hello. And there we go. Nice damage from bleeding you to death. Let's pick up your items and we can open up the way to the purging monument, which should complete. Lapse quest line. We can also just get another quick level up, and I'm wondering what I want to level up then. Tron Bonfire. I might actually like to level up. No, I'll be leveling up dexterity. It's dexterity for sure. Leveled up luck, I'd get a little bit of damage on the Drange Wind Spears, but I would get more damage from just leveling up dexterity, so let's do that. Right now, they're at 314 attack rating, so let's lower dexterity a little. Thank you. 114, and now... 118, so that's not amazing, but it's not meaningless. So the big thing is... We're gonna have to go to the swamp and cast our... Cast a spell a number of times, and that spell is going to be... Chameleon. 
What happened to your Wi-Fi? Are you okay? Is it just going badly? Bad connection? Fair. Okay. Oh, but... Right. So we gotta switch out one of our spells in favor. Chameleon, which is a disguise spell, and it'll turn us into a humanity sprite, which is essentially humanity, I would like to say, is essentially a shard of the dark soul. And do we have to get in the swamp? Yeah, we have to get in the swamp proper to actually do that. That's whatever. Oh, so in theory I would need to probably kill this locust first and okay, thanks. Don't do that. Thanks. And okay, so you're a bit more resistant to bleed than the Ringonites, actually. And one more, one more, and thanks. Okay, cool. So now that I'm in here, I can actually use Chameleon again with my Crystal Charm, and there we have it. I am a Humanity Sprite. Oh, but I'm... I have to move very slowly. Well, that's fun. But it's obviously a bit more graphically cohesive, but... These little guys were actually enemies in the DLC of Dark Souls 1. In Dark Souls 1, they had a system called Humanity, which you may or may not be familiar with, that allowed you to... It was the resource that let you summon other players that, to an extent, increase your HP and your item drop chance. And... There we go! We successfully showed our humanity. Let's the ladder drop down, and then we may as well switch this out. We don't need it anymore. Tune and a tune. I guess we'll take Lightning Blade. Cool. Then we'll go back up and... Uh, I guess until we run to something that we really want to take down, the Bleed will equip a more melee-oriented rings for now. Go up here and... See what we can find, and we gotta tell a lap about the monument, but once we get to Calamite, we can fight Calamite, the last few bosses, and then just beat the game, I guess? The thing about Calamite is that I will need to buy a bunch of arrows, and I hear fire! Isn't that great? What kind of Metal Gear Solid 3 kind of ladder is this? Okay. Oh, there. Okay, there we go. So this is the way to the Purgent Monument. I guess the question would be, is there going to be a bonfire I can use, or... I hear somebody. I don't like that. Okay, there are... Hello there, hi. Hmm, interesting. Alright. So we want Sage's Ring, I suppose. I just don't want to die here. And, okay, come on. And, oh, another Judicator Giant. You've got to be kidding me. Before that, let's switch out the Sun Princess Ring and take down the Ring at night. It's great to be stuck here with you. It really makes my day. And cool, and oh my goodness, my goodness, I, okay. Come on, come on, and thank you for using Dark Blade. That really, really makes my day. Cool, and okay, alright, and oh, come on, die. Hit, and thanks. Dodge another one, another one real quick, and thank you. Cool. Well, this is going to be interesting for sure. And dodge, jump away that spell. Use another, or what? Thanks, then. Thanks. We've been close, and oh my, oh, what? No! You're kidding. Okay, so that giant is going to be really, really aggravating, then. Okay, so now you're just. Thanks, thanks, oh, come on. Got to be kidding me. Okay. Well, the big thing is, now I know... Two Ringed Knights, I should burst them down with Dark Miracles as soon as I can. Then... Okay. It's not gonna be fun to have to go up that ladder again, but that's life. Then we... Take down the Judicator Giant, and yeah. Hmm. You know, maybe if it would be funny, I could have farmed Dark Moon Ears in order to get 
Darkman Blade, and that would have been pretty useful, but be a better magic buff, but can't use it yet. I mean, I would be able to use it. Be about as good as Crystal Magic Weapon. Really mostly okay. Then the Judicator Giants are... I think Fire is actually good against them. It might be Dark. Not entirely sure. Let me just check. Uh, Half Light, Spear of the Church. Then the Giants or Judicators are weak to... Actually pretty resistant to Dark, and they're immune to Bleed. They're weak to Lightning, but they're... Mm, okay. Cool. And just get that going. Just trying to get too close. And one more, one more, and just... Okay, alright. Thanks. And boom. Alright, thanks. Okay, heal, heal, heal. One, two. Get that, get that, get that. Get that. Mm -hmm. A few souls. It's not... Nothing. And what? 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 Okay. Thanks, I guess. Huh. I just dodge. Okay. Come on. Oh, please. What? Huh? Whatever that guy dropped, I'll never know. Hmm. Okay. Priestess' ring is quite good. For the damage. And we got sages for speed. Pushing those guys down is a good idea. Maybe if I want to be really funny, I could try using Dark Blade on the hammers, but maybe, maybe. If this doesn't work, that's what I'll do. Just cast Dark Blade, because now I've got I've got enough to actually cast it without. So I've got 25 now. I'll use Dark Blade on my hammers and then use that to take them down. I guess the real question would be. For the final fight, what rings would I use? Probably, I'd be using Drang Hammers, presumably. Probably of using... Ring of Favor, maybe in Wu Prisoner's Chain, actually. So that I could use Princess's Ring for... other stuff, and see how well... Mm. Alright, and... yep! We rock, and there we go. Oh, they're high. Hmm. So where is the other ring and I gonna come from? Oh, they're high, and just do that and dodge, dodge. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, nice. That's cool. What was the grab gift? Okay, that was really ludicrous. Really ludicrous. Okay, interesting. Ah, oh, and what store is that? If you, if it's not too private. Hmm. I'm gonna try that one more time. Ah, oh, interesting. I, my mom is an employment consultant, and I know that she was helping some people get jobs at various places. And one of the places she was trying to help people get jobs was Five Below. So there's one of the big shopping complex nearby my house. So I've seen it before. I guess it's kind of like Zoomer or Hot Topic, I guess, arguably, because it's not really edgy, but that said, Zoomers don't tend to really be edgy in the same way that I guess Millennials used to be when they were younger, or I guess maybe younger Zoomers versus older Zoomers. I mean, at this point, Hot Topic just says, just says anime merch. Oh, hello. Yeah, we should be fighting Madeir soon, so... Dragon for you, dragon for you. There you go. Wait, does... Wait, are Five Below and Hot Topic connected? No. I do not. The, the, the adjective I would use to describe Spencer's gifts is Reddit. And, oh goodness, and, oh, Lado, Lado, oh no, oh no, not Lado. Come on, what are you gonna do then? When are you gonna, come on, get in position, let me bleed you down. Come on, come on, oh, how far does that go? That's fair. I just want, I mean, I know what Spencer's is, I just personally find them cringe. And, let me heal up. 
Come on, another Estus, another Estus. Come on, come on, and uh, please, please, and I can't spam. Okay, that worked. That actually finally worked. Big thing is, I need to switch to my spears in order to take down the guy. Okay. Come on, come on. Let's equip. Don't need any spell-related rings. Just let me... Oh, and you're doing so much damage to me. Oh, come on. Die, 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 die. Okay. Well, I'm glad to hear that you didn't get concussed. That would definitely be a kind of a day ruiner. Okay, well, we... Mm. Alright, what's this? Oh, Leto, oh, Leto. Let me put on favor again and... Oh, maybe. Chain again. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Well, if so, that, that's kind of scary, but... Yo, know, as, as, as long as you're doing well. As long as you're doing well. Okay. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, and... Oh, my goodness. Of course there are ruined sentinel archers there. You've got to be kidding me. Really, really? At, what? What? No. Over there? All the way over that way? What? Oh, my goodness. This guy is ridiculous. Okay, and... One, two, three, and finally dead! Finally dead! Oh my, okay. Yeah, well... As long as it all works out for you, I guess it's for the better in the end. Got a Titanite Chunk, and... Pick up our Titanite Chunks, and... Anything else over this way? Just more Ring Knight stuff in the streets. Bridging Monuments over there. You don't need to apologize. I would think that... Pets you have a responsibility to take care of would take priority over me. Okay. So lap's actually right down there, and so is... Oh, something I can drop down to and get there, too. But well, I... Hmm, I purge mining it's over there, and so is... Oh. Uh, purging monuments. Find that thing. Over here. This is somewhere we couldn't get to previously. And, oh, another... Drop down, I guess. And wait, what? No, no, we went the wrong way. We went the wrong way. Oh my goodness, I'm an imbecile. Okay. Die, 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 and... Okay, cool. Guess who has to run through the streets of the Ring City again? It's me. Don't, don't! Okay, please. Uh, uh. I dropped down the wrong way because I thought the stuff with nothing would be more relevant, and it wasn't. Dodge, dodge. Oh, I hate these guys. Okay, and they're coming up. They're crawling up from the swamp, but... Okay, just dodge and... Run back through, climb up the ladder again. We have everything we need now, which is good. And frankly, I could spend this... Spend the souls I got on a level up, or I could also spend them on... About... Millwood arrows are about... I could buy about 100 millwood arrows. Which, the millwood arrows are the strongest rainbow arrows, and those are the ones I want to use against Madeir. So that's probably what I'm going to do. We'll see what happens. Because... I guess I could get another level up and put it in maybe strength in the interest of doing more damage with the Millwood Bow. Or if I wanted to do that, I could simply equip the Knight's Ring. Or maybe the Hunter's Ring. Now that might be what I do. Just Knight's Ring, Hunter's Ring, and the Hawk Ring, which I need to go back and get from the Giant from Undead Settlement, who I believe will have died of natural causes by now. Then we'll be... More or less showing. Okay, so yeah, this down here. That's the actual way to the purging monument. So over here we've got some other objects. And, uh, huh? Something over here. Oh, thanks. Just go ahead, do your thing, I guess. Thanks. And what? Do do not. Okay, good. Dragon head shield. Dragon head shield. Dragon head great shield. I think those are different. Multiple fire, but right, because one of them was the one that the lance ones used, and one of them was the one that the spear one used. Okay. Large silver crystal in that. That's okay. So, this here is the purging monument, which it's not like we really need to do anything here. We can tell Lap about it, and he should complete his quest line now. Pray to the purging monument, absolution, dissolution. No, I don't need that. I don't want that. And you have not sinned, and that would cost a truly. Crazy amount of souls anyway, so it's good that we have it. 
Quest River's Hauling. We but we found it, which means we can let Lap reverses Hauling now. So let's take this off. There are a couple of Oh, Ring Knight's down there, who I'd like to take out real quick, so let's put our Miracle Ring back on. And then obliterate. Those Ringed Knights. Thank you, thank you. And we don't have enough for Doris's. Well, we're completing somebody's quest line for one. Because the guy down here, he was looking for something called the Purging Monument, which we just found. I don't think those Ring Knights see me. Okay. Hello, hello. I found it. What did I come here in search of? Damn. Stop it. I'm unbreakable. Unbreakable. Exactly. He's unbreakable because he's patches. I'm certain of that. Yes. No. Sorry. I, I know you'd never lie to me. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Unlike someone. Thank you, Connie. I'll speed right on over. Okay. I'll be long now before I know everything. You Who told me everything. The funny thing is that Lap actually means patch in Danish. Thank you. Which was a hint to his name. I swear upon my birth name oh? that I am your friend. Uh oh. No matter what. And apparently he gives another ten minutes no at the end of this. If you would do me true friend honor, always. Allow me to be a true friend. Always. Sure. It won't be long now before I know everything. Who I want and I. And you to think for it all. It will be who I was. Okay. Let's go back to the shrine real quickly. I need... I gotta pick up some arrows in order to shoot at Madeir when he goes down. Get that from the shrine handmaiden. There was another door at the start. Service, purchase item, and... The answer would be Millwood Great Arrows. Or we could actually give her Grey Rat's Ashes. Well, it was about a week ago since we took this. Actually, about half a week. I'm sure an ashen one such as thee would never indulge such base. Oh, because assuming that we killed him ourselves, but no, he just he died. But he, she makes the worst assumption because she's obnoxious. So now we could get. You got a lot of things for one. Lots of related items. Knight's crossbow. Not sure how we have that. Either way, we'll be okay. We'll be fine. So the big thing is we got our Millwood Great Arrows somewhere around here. Actually, we should just go to ammunition. Arrows bolts, strengths or lightning arrows are not as these are actually not as good. Held and we can only get so many Millwood arrows. Millwood, Millwood, and are they Millwood Great Arrow? Black Oak, heavy damage, living range, fired using a great bow. Face their sworn enemy, the Abyss Dragon, and guess who's going to be doing the exact the exact same thing? That's we can only hold 30 of those at once, so. Let's get 60 or so, and then. Should be decent, maybe 70. Those are gonna be our first order of choice, and then. 70 of those. Okay, cool. So, we bought a lot of arrows to use on the deer. Let's change out what we've got equipped. Got our Millwoods, got our Dragon Slayer Great Arrows, and when we fight him on the bridge, I think I'll just be using the spears with the Lightning Blade. Well, maybe more accurately, the Lightning Spear. But. Hmm, interesting. Switch out to Ring of Favor and Prisoner's Chain again, and then return to Ringed City Streets to take the guy on. Good old Madeir. He will plunge far, far below. So I wonder... Well, for one, I wonder if that Judicator Giant respawns, the one up there. All the others have respawned, so I presume it would, but I don't know. Should actually probably wait a bit, given that I wouldn't like the buff expiring at an inopportune time. And Madeir is actually weaker to thrust than lightning, but in terms of elements, he is weakest to thrust. Oh, but actually, I might like to compare. 
How much Karthus is... Yeah, exactly. Let's actually attune Karthus here briefly. Let's see. Which gives more AR? So that's 471. Flame Art gives... Four, oh, they're about the same. That is profoundly amusing. So it's about the same, it's just, is it going to be lightning or is it going to be fire? To be fair, the ring makes the difference between what we can equip. Mm -hmm. Interesting. So it does seem to me like there is some truth in only, or at least some sort of scaling penalty when you use a mixed scaling catalyst to do a weapon buff. But either way, this is so good. Oh, and I forgot what I said, I guess. Okay, so Madeir is going to be around this way. Is he? He's already back. There he is. Hello. Hi, go ahead now. We are going to fight you on the bridge. And what are you doing? Oh, I, oh! Okay. Interesting. So you swept over, and where are you now? Is that just a one-time thing? And I'm glad I survived, but... Oh my... Okay. That didn't deal as much damage. We actually managed to dodge through it. Silver Weary Warrior and... Oh my goodness. Okay. Dodge and... Actually, Flash Sweat would be the best thing to have here. Most likely. Lightning Gem and... Rubbish and... Dropping down here would be smart. Let's roll in... See if we can roll through. Oh no, never mind. We got close. We got very, very close. Okay, so we can't actually fight him there. We need to. Oh, he's crazy. In that case, maybe instead of tears, I'd be better off with. Maybe. Well, it's good to know that I can actually roll through. Because, among other things, tears and flash sweat simply do not stack. I thought about using Flash Sweat, which is a pyromancy that gives you a lot of fire resistance, but mm, if it's a one-tap, I think it might be a one-tap even with Flash Sweat. As in, keep on rolling, rolling, rolling. Don't stop. Keep those doggies rolling. Okay, cool. Alright. Okay. Mm -hmm. I could just use Tears a bunch of times, actually. Then we just roll. Oh, well, never mind. So we just heal up. One, two, and then we cast tears again, sure. Then we even do that, and. Alright, and just dodge! Thank you! So, well time dodge is actually very, very useful there. Works just fine. Then we. Do oh, alright, and. Interesting, so we can. Get our tears up again, and... Oh, right, we need more of that then. Okay, cool. Let's actually just drop down over here. Where we're not going to get hit. Thank you, thank you. We need a bit of Ash and Essence for that then, and... Tears of the Night. We're actually somewhat close. Somewhat close to having two casts for, for FP bar. Oh, come on. Let's take you down. One, two, three, four. Right, right. That would have been annoying. It's not like this blood stain is crazy big, but it's still not one I'd like to lose. So... Oh, hello there, and thank you for your lightning stick. Two, and stab over there, and... What are you doing now? Thanks. So the drop down was what we had to do. Now that we're in here... Well, I do... S oh, this is where... I think Lap pushes you down over here eventually. Okay. Like a classic- oh, great. Okay. Cool. Oh, and this is- are these the catacombs from Dark Souls 1? I- okay. Interesting, and- oh, that's Aegon of Kareem. I don't like that. Let's see. And just dodge, dodge. Classic, classic. Okay. Let's lightning void that up and kill that guy. Okay. So what is going to be my- one, two, oh, what, okay, all right, dodge, dodge, uh, well, okay, interesting, huh, oh, we're just back where we came from, wait, is he just gonna fall to his death, 
I guess he did. We take those. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay. You know, I am not the type to look a gift horse in the mouth. Oh, ah, and yep, he's gonna tell me about treasure. He's gonna kick me down the hole because he's patches. The broken staircase, find treasure sitting there all alone. Okay, watch. Yeah, it'll kill me. He sounds a lot more like his old self. Broken staircase. Yeah, see, and... Oh, look. You know, as soon as I leave the room, even. Yeah, go ahead, kick me down. See how much I care. Take your hat off. Hi, Patches. Made it to the end of the world. <laughs> Truly unbreakable. I don't know. Just well, we did. I didn't get to see him kick me down. Dark soul. In here because I didn't re reload Cathedral of the Deep in time and just moved on to Firelink on his own. But he does kick you down Cathedral of the Deep too. Okay, cool. All right. Anything else in here? It's not. So getting back up is gonna be... I mean, in the end, it's just... Not much difference was really made, was there? I guess we got a blessed gem. And then over this way is... Well, I just don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I could just... teleport out with... a bone or with my quilt sword dragon, but... Yeah, that's no fun. Mob enemy ahead. Is this a mimic? Yeah, it is! It's... Another mimic! Hello! Hi! Good to see you! Okay. Yeah, always. Happens more often than I might like to admit. And just... One, two... So what's in here? And this was... Ring of the Evil Eye plus three. So is that what he was supposed to be giving us? Or... Who knows, really? And in here we have... I guess maybe we should try putting on Lightning Void again. There's that one Crystal Wizard, and I'm not sure how I'm supposed to get to it. Maybe I just throw a big enough projectile and kill it that way. Try above. Two, three, alright. Thanks. And what's this way? Another skeleton. Thanks. Then we can just take you down and- Wait, what? Huh? Oh, the classic parried by the skeleton. Great, great. Really is just Dark Souls 1 all over again. Yeah, but these really do look like the Dark Souls 1 catacombs. Okay. So what way would I have to go to get back to the initial Crystal Wizard? Oh, it would have been over this way. Okay, cool. Oh. Oh, did this... Where did this lead me? Dark Souls... Dark Souls 1, but... Different in a way that gives me complicated feelings about it. I think that's more fair. And is this where... There was... No, no. We had to go the other way. I'm getting all kinds of turned around at this point. This is... Can't get through there. It was only hatred when I lost my bloodstain because my controller broke. And that was really more my fault. I mean, no, it wasn't the game sold. And then there was the time where I died at the projected heal, and though I might not have liked it, that was that was my fault. It wasn't even the game's fault. I still didn't like it, though. Oh, and okay, cool. Help me. So, we got another bonfire here. Then what if we jump back the other way? There's also that down there, and... So how do I get up? How do I get even farther up? Let's try above. And I... Is there a ladder there? Or? There's gotta be some way to get over that way. Maybe it's it's probably just from outside. Probably just from outside, so... 
go back to that bonfire over that way. Chill out. And we just jump. What if we just jump for it? Okay, we can make that jump. And go over this way again. Should be some item. And this was... Oh, this is where he was. Wap set. Let me check out the description of his armor then. What I might have to say about our friend. That would be... Wapset. set. And Ruin Helm. Company Knights Ring sitting in Old King's Orders. Dark Souls Crush throw themselves to the Giant. Dark Fable, certain golems in whom their name lived on. Oh, so these were the original Ruin Sentinels. The Ruin Sentinels in Dark Souls 2 retroactively are based off. They were originally knights, and golems were based on them. Amnesiac, slight gaps, heavy defense, hollow body ones, very identity. And what would the other piece be? Waps armor. Torso, hollow body, and one's identity. Okay. Let's go back to that one and kill that crystal wizard. I would also like to buy a few more arrows, most likely. Jump spells and some enemies. Yeah, I would say... But I do have far better spells now. So not really as much. It's actually... Let's put on Kaitha's and, I mean, Doris's. With Kaitha's chime. I wonder how much bleed resist, if any, crystal wizards have. And. Wait, are they bleed immune? Jump it. Oh, thanks. Alright. I guess maybe lightning might be my best choice. Just. I don't need to chase them down physically, I just need to kill them from however far away it takes. So, I'm just going to put on Lightning Spear and toss a little bit of lightning at them, and presumably that should work. We'll see. We will max out our lightning damage. Let's 100% max it out, and... Okay. Lightning Spear on you with Crystal Chime. Thank you, and oh my, okay. Interesting, and just jump, and oh, I messed that up too. Oh, that, all right. Oh, that was actually pretty good, but I jumped and fell. Exact wrong time. Okay. Yeah, but the only things left would be Nadir, and then get you and jump. Oh, I. The funny thing about it is that. Instead of pressing on the stick, I press the roll button again. Because I forget. It is interesting, because in the first, in Dark Souls, you, the only way you jump is by pressing A or your run button while you're already running. In Dark Souls 2, you can do that, or you can press on the joystick. In Dark Souls 3, the only way to do it is by pressing on the joystick. And wait, what? Oh, come on. Okay. Maybe. Okay, so it wasn't moving that much. So if I just get close enough to the ledge to. It's ridiculous. I am making an absolute fool of myself. And over there, and thanks, thanks, and one more, one more, and just, there we go, okay, finally. Twinkling Titan at a Titan at scale, and there is... Okay, I actually have enough to level up Isolith Catalyst. Well, I would if I really felt like it, and I don't. Shared Grey, what's it tune? Guess we could take Karthus. No, let's take Karthus. Then we'll put relevant things back on and switch to what we had before, which is Favor and Favor Chain and Pontify. This is what we go with, as usual. But what I, I just want to make sure. What else am I? There is another item down there. But to get over that way, I presume we'll have to exit through a different direction. So another door in another place that I also want to make work, but we'll see what happens. Okay. So let's put... Oh, right, we need... That's right, what we needed was... Priestess's Ring, because we can't cast that right now. Okay. Cast Lightning Blade. 
and then we can get our FP back very quickly and then proceed onward. Okay. Thank you very much. And oh, oh, this is... It's more Madeira over here, that's right. So we get farther we share gray, there's going to be something else entirely. So there you are, there you are. And so it doesn't go through here, which is good. That means we need our Twin Spears back on. Okay. Let's lighten you up. Rest again. Might run out in an opportune time, but just gotta take him out. Okay. Hello. You're still right here. Hello, then. Let's cling, cling to the wall and run through a little bit of damage. That's life. Now we're over this way and sweep is fine. Okay, cool. Nice. And what if we one, two, and okay, interesting. Let's go for the head. Stab and stab and okay, interesting. And what if we interesting. All right. Oh, you can do that instead. Interesting. Okay. So, one, two, or not. Oh, please. Uh, all right. All right. Hmm. That is a new concept for me. It's still lasting a decent amount of time. But wait, what? You can go, you can go right through that? Okay. Oh, it wasn't far down enough. That's what was going on. Okay, so once we get the deer out of the way here... We can, oh goodness, come on and go for the head, presumably. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, going for a foot would probably be better. So, thank you, thank you. Oh, and oh, dark laser, too. Well, that's interesting. One, two, three, four, and dodge. Okay, thanks. Dodge. Oh, what? Alright. Interesting. You are tough even here. Okay. Alright. Then will you laser over there? Thanks. And one, two, three, four. Knock you down here and more stuff will happen. The big thing is, is that I'm not quite sure how best to hit the head and dodge. Then hit. And roll. Let's use this before that dark laser comes out, and just... Oh, no dark laser. Okay, cool. Dodge. Oh, goodness. Alright. And... Oh, okay. Cool. Hmm. And... Wait, what? What? Huh? Okay. Interesting. Well, that was conceptually new to me. Wow. You are tough, even, even outside the actual boss fight. I you know, should have expected as much, but still. Okay, hi. Maybe I could have tried actually using. Uh, and is that. Oh! Critical? Thank you, and. Goodbye! Is that gonna send you down to. Down to the pit below? So that's where we'll find you eventually. Other part is sure grave, but. Big thing is, there was another part of an item. Got to figure out how to get there. Eh, it'll be whatever. Figure that out at some point. And item on the bridge. Time that scale, and what else? Hmm. Keep on going through this way. Oh, well. Hmm. That is, okay, that's Church of Filionor, and... Well, here's something or somebody. There's a crystal wizard over there. Wizard wall head right, that's right. All a cleric right here, and one, two, and right, right, that's true. Thanks. And just oh please. One, two. Oh, so it's better at actually bypassing the shell since it goes straight on. If I recall correctly, there are multiple. Our soul of a weary warrior and hidden path. Find here is Lightning Arrow. There we go. So that's what Shira uses, if I recall correctly. But the big thing is. Ah, well, that's through. I'm wondering if I can find a way back to another 
shortcut elevator or something. Let's just stab. Interesting. Stab. Oh, come on. Stab and... What? Alright. Stab and... There we go. It only took that much. Time net skill and over here is... Oh, we're gonna have to find a way to drop down on the bat. So... Presumably maybe one is an illusory wall. Okay, so there's a drop down and something else in shared grave. Try. Yeah, exactly. Double jump with someone. Oh, and a duo for to the pair of great swords, which unfortunately I don't think I can use at all, period. Let's go over. It would be fun to try using them with Gale, but I think it'd take, take a different ring. Strength I have, that'd give me. Actually, even if two handing wouldn't normally give me. Normally, even multiply the ring stuff, I'd still be able to get there because 24, 36, and then the ring would put me over the edge. Wiki does not say for sure whether. <sighs> Something like Knight's Ring actually gets increased by 50% when two handing for the sake of meeting requirements for, for damage. The thing is, let's take down that guy. Chris's ring. Use our Sun's Firstborn ring and our Sage's ring and just spam. Doris is gnawing on that guy and I, I'm not sure whether he responds, but I do know that first time you kill him, he does draw the pair of great swords and only that time. Put in Green Blossom and. Hello there, hello. Thanks, and oh goodness, I. Alright. Thanks, cool. And only the most busted weapon in the game. Arguably. Maybe. And of course, we can just bleed you to death. Fun. Tie Knight Chunk and the Ring Knight Pair of Great Swords. Accompanying the sword, which we picked up as a root drop, and the spear, which we also picked up as a root drop. What was nothing down here? Was that drop down over there and should be a shortcut elevator somewhere around here. There's gotta be a way to get to Medir then. Shortcut lift. Ritual spear fragment, which is an item you can only use while you're in that Philidor Covenant. This is I guess we could fight halfway. Twinkling Titanite. We will need to so it'd be halfway. Medir, Gale, and then Soul of Cinder. Interesting. But I... Hmm, shared Ring, even. It does! It really does. And this... Judicator Argo. The fourth giant will encounter. That still see it pretty far too. Well, I... Hmm. There's gotta be a way through. Let me just check the illusory walls in Ringed City. Illusory walls did not mean to do that. Ringed City. Shared Grave. Lightning Arrow. Ringed Inner Wall Elevator, but... Huh. Okay, and... Drag heap was. Oh, come on, Firefox. I closed Firefox too quickly and now it's not loading again. Whatever. What? What? Okay. The big thing is there's gotta be a way. This is clearly right under where we were before. Well, you know, if that's what you gotta do, that's what you gotta do. Oh, it was literally right back here. Never mind. And then anything over there or. Mm -hmm. Let's see. This is just that one door. And halfway through, I believe, should be the shortcut lift to Nadir. Would that also take me to the part of Shared Grave that I want to get to? Not sure. Oh, goodness. This Firefox. This Firefox. Then Illusory Wall. There was one in the drag heap I needed to find. Let me see. Drag heap, soul drags, and okay. Staircase, workmen, 
already got that, but maybe I'm getting confused. Probably. So I will simply let me just see if I can even equip the Ring Knight pair of great swords. I presume I should. Dragon Head Shield, Great Boulder, Ascendant of an Arch Dragon's Head, Ring Set of a Slay, never want it, because they were Abyssal Humans, Dragon Breath, Perish is not. Exhalation of Dragon Breath. Then the Great Shield. Dragon Roar, sending Rose Flying. Grin had Great Shield, so that's what the Spear ones used and the other one was used by. The Sword ones. Try these pure Great Swords and. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, well, Great Swords, those who possess them. Present Attributes. So let's actually equip. Knight's Ring. That should be usable. Can we... Presumably this should work. Yeah, I think we can wield this. Okay, this is a really good PvP weapon. It's a good chance I use this for half-light. Because it's gonna be... It's not gonna be half-light, it's gonna be another player. So... See what happens. These are good. These things are very, very good. And right now, oh, it's not giving me the right description of AR, but it should be telling me I can wield these things. I should be able to. I mean, I'm overloaded right now by a country mile, but and oh, I literally need to take off all my clothes to wear these. That's insane. Alright, and oh, but I need... If I use prisoners, I'll probably be able to at least wear something. Let's try that, and I can at least wear pants. Still sort of trousers. Wearer of pants. So, let's see. Hmm, okay, alright. One, two, and... Three and oh, good boys too. And okay, dodge, dodge. Come on. Well, they killed me. Okay. So I do want to upgrade these things. I want to unlock the way to Madeira. I might actually try killing Madeira first, possibly. I do need to take a very quick bathroom break. I'll be right back. Also, let me get that bullet soon. These would need a decent amount of. Upgrading to work, so I will simply go back to Firelink real quickly. What is annoying is that I can get to 30 faith using Priestess Ray. But to actually use Great Lightning Spear, I would literally need to grind 30 Sunlight Metals, which is simply not happening. That said, it is a bit less efficient than using... It is fun to be able to actually use these things. There's a tiny bit of fire damage, and they get a lot of... a lot from upgrading. Then, oh, but we don't have enough. But they be careful. You know what? I could actually... Just to be funny, I need... eight of those. I could blow a soul on upgrading these things. Why not? I have very little to lose at this point. In about an hour and a half, I should hopefully be done. Okay. Hopefully. So we need five of these. So, cool. Let's level this up. Thank you. Reinforce this with a little bit more. And then... Yep, there we go. Can't be infused, but we're chilling. Then that hey, be careful. should be a very strong weapon for us. Check out my equip load right now. It's just below load. Hmm. That is a weird level attack, though. Yeah, yeah. Double swords. Double swords. We should get a few more arrows first, but I will be yeah, taking a quick bathroom break. Held and we need more. Yeah, so we'll get a few more of these. Yeah! They're the only pair of greatsword in the game. 
Well, actually, there are no paired great swords in the game. There are only paired ultra great swords, and these are that. So we gotta drop down, get to that statue, and there's also a bit of. But the fact that they're incredibly slow means that they're not really good for most things. They're incredibly heavy, too, but they're decent for PvP. So let me just see how much damage I'll deal taking you out, this, and... Well, I could stuff I have is... Oh, nice! Okay. Interesting. Yeah, it's not nearly as fast as I'm on my anchor but... And the catch is really, really good. Okay. Hello there, hello. I'm down. I just want to. I just want to talk to you. Actually, what I want to do is run over and talk to Shira real quick because she, she raw. Shira might say something now that we've actually gotten some stuff related to here. Again, that push is really good. Okay. This is a strong weapon, undeniably so. And oh, what? Huh? What? Okay. The funniest part is that they're able to do a little bit of damage. Oh, it's already dying from curves. Okay, but yeah, I... This weapon is cheesy enough that I should be able to use it to beat Half-Life. That is going to be my one PvP match, I suppose. Half-Life. Well, the one that I hope we win. We'll see. Oh, we... Mmm, we can't really use it chime right now. That's funny. Thanks. One, two. That's aggravating. Then we just... One. Oh! The running attack's good, too, but... Yeah, that charge is... kind of crazy. One, two. They don't really cling off of walls, which is also nice. Okay. You're right there, and thanks. One, two. Oh, but never mind, never mind. Hmm. It's still a good attack, but the wind up on that paired attack, though, is more than a little excessive. So we'll talk to Shira. Hopefully, we take out the deer and. One, two. Charge and. Nice! Okay, that worked pretty well, but. One, two, and. Oh, well, we, oh, we ran out of stamina, so we couldn't use the weapon skill. Okay. Wow. Okay. You know, this was a weapon that I really wanted to try out, and I'm glad that and it might take some rings and a bit of associated cheese, but I'm glad that I was able to use it at least once before the end of the game, even on the very last day of gaming with about an hour left. So... Yeah, yeah. It's a really good weapon. Undeniably. Undoubtedly. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's a gem. It's a good weapon. And, okay. Yeah, we finally have something resembling poise. Great stuff. So, we just go in and charge you, and... Thanks, and... Nice! Okay, cool. That combo might take a bit more than I might like, but it's still good. So, jump and... Oh yeah, it it's definitely one of the most anime weapons in Dark Souls. It's hard to deny. Okay. So, oh, we could have gotten a plunge off. Well, whatever. That's fine. Plunge, spin, and jump and slam and... Oh my goodness. And no weapon art or anything needed. It's just... that's all. That said, as good as it is for milling down trash mobs, it is definitely going to not be as good against, say, Gale. Because Gale, I won't be able to stagger him as much, which means I'll need speed. So, Medea hath into the chasm fallen. In fact... Still his voice I hear. The dark, leave it here. Yep. I pray thee. Privy? Put him to rest. Okay. Before the dark consumeth him, and his vows are forgot. Mm -hmm. Just before the church of the princess Ancient knights. standeth the tower. Hope that herald knight doesn't see me. Oh no. 
Goodness, guess who needs to take you down, I guess. Dodge, dodge, and, and thanks. Slash and spin and oh good. Good, good oh goodness, alright. I wonder how much Herald Knight would take poise damage one is one. We gotta get you in a state where we can actually get an attack off. One, two, three, four. And thanks. One, two, and three, and slam, and oh, that successfully. You can stagger lock them? What? That's not right. Okay. No. Okay, that's stupid. I'm not complaining, but really? Just before the church of okay. the princess, stand in the tower, honoring ancient and That would be what Madeir is. Sculpted knight, which appeared with no arms. Knight, so I get to Madeir. No a wizardry statue. There, has him of darkness. Okay. I prithee, put the great dragon to rest. Okay. I know. I have asked of thee a thing most terrible. Sounds fun. Forgive me. I work with mine only hope. Okay. Just before the church of the princess, stand at the tap is a small high critical. Okay. Cool. I just want to see how much damage would I deal if I got that special herald punch on those guys. Nice. Wild. That's actually disgusting. Well, there we go, I guess. Finally, a workable weapon. And, oh, goodness. Okay. Yeah, but to equip tears on this build would be really inconvenient. So just to get down here, we slam it. Oh, I barely missed. You've got to be kidding me. And two, three, four, and it's jump, charge it. One, two, three, and four. All right. Thanks. If we're not to get back. But if we charge in it, we can just stun you out of your attack entirely. Who, who thought this was fair? Okay. I mean, just go ahead. You know, with a single normal combo, go ahead and trivialize the entire game. Why not? I just want to see how well this punching attack works on that Herald Knight. But before that, I guess we'll kill you. Hi there, hello. Dodge it. Stab it. Okay, yep. We can just not worry about anything you do, because, well, there we go. Two ends. I... Wow. Okay. Yeah, just go ahead. Give us a really overpowered weapon for some reason. You know, I guess I guess it was the time. Okay, and there we go. And how much damage are we gonna? No infusion required. Using a ring to be able to wield it at all. And okay, go ahead. All right. Thanks. Well, you know that works too. Hmm. Okay. I guess I need to go back and get that blood stain, so I get to kill things with this ridiculous set of great swords again. Yeah, exactly. You know, never mind. I don't hate Dark Souls Three anymore. It's got the Ring Knight pair great swords, and that's all that matters. Okay. So I should probably cast Tears. It's just one good weapon. One good weapon can redeem an entire game. Seriously, it, it's all of this game needed. One really, really cool sword. I mean, one really, really cool pair of great swords. It's all the game needed. Yeah, but I, I have to use these on halfway. Otherwise, I'm definitely dead, dead. Yeah, I. 
I, I finally unhollowed. And wait, what? Really? 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 What? You're kidding. I didn't know you did a monkey bat grab attack. Okay. Fair, I guess. Not really. Okay, but the thing about it is that as cool as that charging attack is, it's not the only attack I have. And pretty much everything else comes out faster. But chaining into that combo is very good of an idea. And we can get rid of your amber. How does that feel? Uh huh. And it's still not an instant kill with a single combo, but it's pretty close to one. That is excessive. Slam it. Okay. Vile. This is... And it's so funny that I just have to take off pretty much all of my armor to wear this. Just wearing crappy pants like a... Absolute lunatic. But in that case, if I'm still going to be wearing these... No, no, it's important to have shoes. It's one thing to wear no shirt and be ugly and shriveled. It's another thing to wear no shoes, frankly. Wearing no shoes is worse. It's more of a fashion front. Okay. And then we need our... Mm -hmm, and... Wow. And it's just... The fact that it's a low sweep means that I don't have to worry about clanging off of their shells. Because it just hits their body no matter what. Oh my goodness. Why is... I made one weapon to just... Trivialize everything. Every crazy struggle in this DLC. Except for the bosses, I guess. Is just completely trivialized by these ridiculous swords. I'm not complaining, but it's crazy. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh. Yeah, we. Come on. And. Okay. Dodge, and. Wait! Wait! We dodged that thrust by just being low enough to the ground that it went over our head. You're kidding. You're kidding. Okay. That was Zhao. Zhao. Okay, we go back to the shrine then. And... Okay. Come on, come on. I... Okay. Gotta go back to the shrine as soon as we can. Okay. Alright. Squido mm -hmm. and Italian moment? You know? At least you admit it. At least you know. So let's level up real quick. And we can get. Why not get one more level of strength? That would help with. Oh, right, if we're gonna go and take down the deer. Well, first, I should, I should probably do half light first. Let's see. Italian's a... You know, I think that, that that's probably a good thing, to be frank. Okay. Or made to be someone other than Frank. Sheer gray. There's the statue. Ah! Sheer gray. Wave, statue... Okay, just taking note of what I need to find. Mm -hmm. Let's see. So we go up the elevator here, and then halfway, we have to drop out of a little hole. Should be a way... Okay, it's over there. That's where it is. That would lead to Madeir, as well as to presumably whatever that is over that way. Thank you, thank you, and... So clearly people have died here. So that is... One of the sword illusion ahead, nice. Now this is where Medir would be. Ladder ahead, and then... Hmm. Filling or spear ornament, so one of those for the covenant, spears of the church. An ember to use for more HP in the boss fight, and then I drop down to whatever this is over here. 
which would be on top of that statue. And what is over on the statue? Let's see what we can get. Let's be very, very careful and precise. And this is ah, oh, Corinthian ring plus three. Oh wow. Okay. You know, I want to see how well I can fight this ringed knight with his own swords. Oh, there. Hi. And boom, boom. And ridiculous. Okay. Once we got full stamina, we could... Oh, and we won the trade. Really? Okay. Alright. I'm fine with that. Okay, so Corinthy plus three is very, very nice to have. Be really good for stamina regeneration. So, let's go back up to where we were before. See what's down that ladder right before Madeir. Like I said, I do want to fight Half-Light before Madeir, because that would mean probably having another level, probably Vigor or Endurance. Madeir is really, really hard, probably harder than Gale, but I want to fight him before Gale. Because Shira, I believe, some different dialogue. I want to see what the difference with Filianor is when you... Oh, goodness. Keep messing things up in the elevator. Maybe I should be shot. Okay. Not that way. The other way. To the illusory statue that we went through. And then a ladder down here will lead to something. And there's a ornament and a drop down to the abyss. Through here. And then death. Visions of you. Let there be help me. Antiquated plain garb and violet wrappings. Okay, so there that is. Visions of... Oh, and that's that ritual sword. Let me see what the description of those are. They were specific. Violet cloth, gold thread, everyday use. Many a battle. Arms of one who would go on to embrace the sword. And that would be... No, no. Ritual end. Is that Vanguard, Land of Sorcery, Never Intended for Battle, Mission Visiting City? Missionaries like to stay behind, Spear of the Church. Oh, so that would be Half Light set. Oh, so that's why they say Visions of You. Wait for it. Oh, they say Visions of You because it looks ugly. They're just going for low hanging comedy fruit. Okay, classic. Ritual Spears, Namesake of the Spears of the Church, On One Play Item, and oh, it scales very highly with every offensive stat. Interesting. Well, in that case, I guess I'll fight Half-Light now. Then Madeir after that, and then, as long as we don't touch the egg, Shiro won't get mad at us, but it is kind of funny that basically all three bosses are right next to each other. We've got Madeir and Filianor, and all of them right here. What were the lightest... It all puts us right above. Mm -hmm. Oh, these are... Okay. Do we have any lighter pants? What is the... Faller boots, actually. Okay. So we'll go shirtless, then. It'll be a bit silly. Check that up and see who we can take out. Just spamming... Spamming these goofy swords. Sounds good to me. Gotta go back up the elevator. So it's Half-Light, Medir, Gale, Soul of Cinder, and that's the end of the game. We'll see how quickly we can do this. This kiln is not that long. Kiln is basically just a boss run over to Soul of Cinder. Should be good. And we can literally just charge this imbecile. Should be more stuff in Shared Grave, but it might be past the church. I'm not sure. Okay, and oh my goodness, dodge. Oh, come on, let me charge you, spin, and nice, and oh, okay. So that fall up actually requires a bit more. Interesting. And spin, slam, and another, and we need a little bit more then. 
Oh, well, alright. Thanks, 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 thanks. Okay. Charge up, and mm, we have a bit of assets missing, but see how this works. Chuck and Amber, we'll see how frightening whoever we end up fighting in here actually is. Berserk King's Decree. Well, too bad. Time to go keep on searching for the Dark Soul. And oh, and the fog wall right past here. Interesting, convenient. Then Covenantor, and then it'll happen to you too. Guts. They're joking that you have to. Let's take you down. I don't know. It seemed pretty trifling to me. Either Argo shall deliver the justice. Bad chance, really. Da oh, all right. The church. Sworn defender of our... What? Okay, never mind. Make haste. All that summons me. Okay. I should have waited a bit longer. And there we go. Cool. So you're dead. Dead. Let's cast that. Oh, and a... That's just a painting guardian. Okay, cool. So we can just get that. Thanks. Slam and spin. Okay, so that's not a true combo, though. Okay. Cool. And spin. Thank you. Cool. So who's coming? I hope they go easy on me. Try stabbing in the back. Half white. Oh, it's actually just half white? That's funny. No, they're they're actually ridiculous. I I'm excited. Wait, so I guess nobody was invading right now? That you know, I take I'm gonna take that. In that case, I really hope this one works. Cause if not, the chances of someone actually showing up become somewhat higher. And I don't like those odds. Okay, cool. Thanks. Alright, and okay, of course there's another painted guardian. That's the only a couple of them will show up any given time. I just Funding Half White is nice, but oh not mm -hmm. Okay. And okay, we got you. Just get in somewhat close. Come on, Half White. And uh please like uh, charge, charge, spin, and Jump and slam, nice. One, two, three, four damage. Nice. That's it. So we can charge in it. Okay, nice. And we interrupted his jump attack, which is crazy. Okay, nice. And just. Oh, thanks. And out of the way of that. Thank you for a blade. And is that a green blossom or. You're just using that attack. I think you use white birch ball? I'm not sure. Okay, and spin and slam and there we go. First try. Okay, cool. Bye, Halfway. Giant slab and a spear ornament. Okay. Ember restored. There we go. That wasn't that bad. Okay. And Filionor is going to be around here, but before any of that, before we touch the egg and end things, I need to go to the bathroom. I have been making things last long enough. Okay. Also, we got enough for a couple of level ups. Maybe. But anything under there? No. Maybe I might look kind of like it. No. Really, really good PvP weapon. But I think it's going to be the fire hammers for Gale. Filionor's in there, but no, not yet. Don't need to end the world. Don't need to end the world yet. And praise the sun and then try and light. Okay, so in that case, what should do then is go back to the shrine bonfire. And I will return shortly. Okay. Level up and how much more do we need? We need what do we want to level? I guess we could take... For this fight? Maybe some intelligence could be nice for Carthus Flame Mark or something, but... We can do that after Medir. 
get some vigor. Vigor is good, and then maybe a bit of vitality. Vigor and peace discover. And how much do we need for index level up? About twenty-five thousand. Okay. Large soul of a crestfall knight, and then a this. Sure. That's decent. Up, up, and take a bit more vitality for a bit more equip load. Okay. Thank you. Helmet, be of service. We have a little bit more, so let's just buy a couple more arrows in the interest of not letting anything go to waste. Open store, 75 of those, and get 5 of those. Okay. Good amount of arrows for the fight. I just want to see what Millwood would actually do. Millwood would. Oh, but right before we use Millwood, we need. Millwood has Pierce Earth, shakes its target and explodes on impact. Could be good. So strength, Hawk Ring, and maybe. That's the question is how much would Dexterity increase the damage? Because that's a. 453. If I took. Hmm, let's see. Hunter's Ring. 453 versus. 457. So whittle. Whittle it all. 453. 211 versus. That doesn't make a, much of a difference, actually. Which means, besides Hawk Ring, it would be good to focus on rings that give me more bulk. But we will need to go back and get Hawk Ring from the corpse of the friendly giant and undead settlement real quick, so we'll do that. Back to... No, back to Road of Sacrifices. No, not Road of Sacrifices? No, I think it's the start over here, but... Since we got all the pale white branches, the giant should have died at this point and dropped his personal effects. Assumedly. What do we need for... What do we need? How do we switch our arrows? We press to switch arrows. No, not like that. I did not mean to do that. Not like that. I... Hmm. Well, either way, we can go up the ladder, I mean the elevator, and I can figure out how I'm going to switch out my arrows. The big thing is, it's a big old great bow. It's the strongest great bow I've got available, and I need to use it to kill Madeir. Because otherwise, Madeir is going to tear me to pieces. Rock ring is good. It'll increase or damage by increasing our range and thereby decreasing. I mean, increasing the range at which arrows can deal their maximum damage because there is a fall off. But I... That said, as long as Millwood's in the first slot, assumedly, I might be able to... Well, if it automatically switches, I'm good. If it doesn't, I'm not. He should be dead now, I'm pretty sure. So we can go up and loot the ring off his corpse. And if it isn't, you know... It would be tragic, but we're trying to face down the Abyss Dragon, and sometimes sacrifices have to be made. So he should be top over here, and let's see. Oh, how sad. The dragon died. Okay. I mean, the giant died. Well, the dragon will die, too. So there we go. We have our Hawk Ring. And Hawk Ring, Hawkeye Goff, who we met in Dark Souls 1. No, I didn't I didn't kill him. He was he was perfect. Blinded Climb and Astragon with this great bow, that was Calamy. Match with the great sword, this one is crap. Vicious mockery. Like Dungeons and Dragons? Can't crit, right? I think. No, no, it can't crit because it's a it's a wisdom save, which means it can't crit. And a critical fail on a save doesn't mean it does double damage. Only woman. Swift death to any all enemies of the throne. Ornstein. First knight of Nameless King. Pure skills made of stone. 
So we can get that Hawk Ring, and this should be good. This should be good for us. Steel Protection might be okay. I might like better armor. Maybe. Well, it an elephant never forgets. It has been a long time since I last played D&D. &D. Take our Sunset Armor, I guess. But Actually, that's decent fire and dark resistance, so... Sunset and Hodric's Solar Realm, since it's used, fade wrap contained in rags, crazy rule, lashing out at friend and foe alike. Let's just see. Soul Sword Gauntlet, or Follower Gloves are closer. So, as hollowed as we are, this is how we're gonna do this. Yeah, exactly. Who dislikes an elephant? But okay, it. I really need to go to the bathroom. I, need, I gotta empty the tank. You know, the meteor fight is bad enough. I don't need to have to hold my bladder the entire time. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Ah. Alright. It's just... I cannot decide how I feel about this game. I feel like it's had the highest highs and the lowest lows of all the Souls games I've played. Well, at least in terms of... Maybe the most frustrating thing was actually... That one time where... Oh, but actually one thing is... I need to equip... Oh yeah, definitely. Absolute emotional roller coaster. Hmm. I would want to actually equip the drain. No, what I'm specifically going to do, I need to go to my bottomless box. Is the idea is that Medeer gets opened up for criticals when you hit his head enough. And we're gonna be able to do that decently often by way of our Oh of our bow shots just going straight for the head. So, the big thing is, I need to clear everything out except the Twin Spears, so that I can very easily switch to the Twin Spears, and then to the Hornet Ring for stronger Rapaz. And this is going to be interesting. That said, 
Hornet Ring and Hawk Ring are very, very close to each other. They're right next to each other, so that shouldn't really be a problem. But this wing is 9, and the Twin Spears weigh 8, so that should be okay. What's my interesting equip? Yeah, once we, when we get a head break for a critical opportunity, we just need to run and switch, which means I gotta move over every weapon except for the Twin Spears right now. Just to make that switch more possible. The more I can just take advantage of the opportunity I get, the better. And thrust damage is what Madeira's weakest to. In theory, I could be funny and maybe use the Crow Quills. I want to check to see what their critical modifier might be. Or maybe just another. Well, I just like paired weapons way too much. Let's go over and switch to the box. Let's check out the Crow Quills. And they do have a higher critical modifier, but... Mm, the Twin Spears have good AR right now, so we're just going to try the fight like this and see if it works. What is interesting is that Half-Light doesn't have his own bonfire, it's just Church of Filionor, which is interesting for a number of reasons, and one of those is that it's almost certain because Filionor is the only boss you can actually re- I mean, Half-Light is the only boss you can actually refight. So that purging monument I found, you can actually revive Judicator Argo, that giant from the start, which allows him to resummon, resummon a guy. It might be good to. Tears is good. It might be good to keep some extra Estus to use Tears again. We'll see. Either way, we are going to take on the deer. We've got a bow, and apparently that makes the fight meaningfully easier. That said, it's not like his attacks are particularly easy to dodge. Good amount of health and relatively good armor. So we'll see what happens. <clears throat> I just want to see. Let's go up there. What it would take to actually switch my arrow type. I'm not sure what I have to press. Not that. Oh, keep missing that. So from the top, it's just down to the left. Left and then left again, and the right would be to coin the ring, so let's drop down and find my stuff. Oh, I could actually, if I want to be really funny, I think I could actually use lightning arrow takes, oh no, I can't reach that. It takes 35. Let me see, DS3 switch ammo. So ammo takes for your bow. Arrow slots. Oh, R1 fires what's in slot 1, R2 fires what's in slot 2. There's no direct switching, that's just, that's how it works. Okay. We have Shield of Want for more souls from this fight, not that it will really matter all that much. And here we go. There are some people who believe that the area we're going down to is actually the cave from the intro of Dark Souls 1, where the souls of lords were found. Not sure how much stock I take in that. Alright, cool. Let's move in close and thank you, thank you. And shoot and boom boom and okay, that is interesting. Okay, I oh baby. Okay, alright, and dodge and oh please. Interesting. Oh my goodness! Okay, we need to stay in front of him, among other things. And dodge. Dodge. Uh, oh, okay. Dodge. Shoot. Okay, no, that's really, really good damage, actually. And dodge. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Now this... I'm gonna... Being able to stay at range at least a little bit is very, very useful for this fine. Okay, what are you going to... Okay. All right, and... Huh. All right, we have to get close enough that the drop-off won't do all that much to me. And, oh, okay. Huh. You have a good supply of arrows, but even in spite of that, I... Oh, come on. Come on. Okay. And... Shoot, and... Shoot. Thanks. Good damage. Damage, and... Oh, please. Oh, yeah. 
He's really cool. There are a lot of people who say he's probably the best fight in the game. He is a fan favorite for a number of reasons. Okay, but... Oh, what? Okay. Thanks. Okay, alright. And... Dodge! Oh, what? Not do oh, please. Come on, come on. It's the arrows in his head. It's fun. But I... Oh, gotta learn his attacks better. Oh, but I, I miss. Dodge. Oh, please. Alright. You know, I definitely don't need... Oh, come on. Don't need more Ash and Estes for this fight. And... Okay. Alright. Hmm. Interesting. And dodge. Okay. Hit and... Shoot the head. And what? What? Okay. Alright. And... Okay. Or maybe I'll just try this one again. I uh, okay. Well, so we can hold this down, getting close. Gonna charge me or okay. Interesting. Can we It's great music too. It is like I said, people love this guy. He's generally considered to be both one of the best and hardest bosses in the game. Doubtlessly. But I, mm, I, I need to go back to Firelink and change out my Estus. Well, you know, that does it too. Okay. So he's 12, so I have 63 Millwood arrows left. And they do a bit more damage, but... Uh, the question is... Oh, yeah. Fighting him with a bow is definitely... Well, to be fair, there's an argument to be made that you're meant to fight the boss with a bow to a certain extent. Because Millwood Greybow literally says it was used to face the Abyss Dragon. Well, the big question would be what would. Ah, okay. So in the stance, I can. Interesting. Burst of strength and a plant prayer shakes and explodes on impact. If I could get the special ones off, I bet I could deal even more damage. The question is how much it would take. I'm gonna leave one how much damage it would deal and whether it would be worth it. I'm gonna leave one right there. But I think honestly, we'd be better off using steel protection in place of in place of well, Prisoner's Chain allows more armor. That's the thing. Probably gonna go with that because he does have a lot of fire. We'll see. Back to Ringed Inner Wall. Okay. Let's do this thing. Got enough strength to wield this thing. A Hawk Ring to use it even better. To be fair. I've got Millwood Arrows for more damage at close range, though it's actually kind of marginal. Also, I need to cast Tears. That's right. More damage at close range, though it's kind of marginal. I've also got... got a lot of Embers. Got 13 Embers to use, and... nothing else to use them for. Which means that using them for more health for a boss fight is more or less the only worthwhile thing I can do with it now. But... Got melee arrows for high damage at close range. Dragon Slayer arrows for farther away. So the Millwood arrows have less storage capacity and you have to be closer to use them. Well, less range, less range, so. See, and it should be up around this way, thank you. And then a left again. Left, a left, a left. Okay. Go down the ladder and then we take a run. And then we try to fight the dragon again. And probably die again. And now there's a... Oh, there's never a fog wall. Interesting. So this is kind of like... Champion's Grave Tender and Grave Tender Grey Wolf in a weird kind of way then. And where is... My Bloodstain? Oh, no, I just left. That's right. I didn't die, I left. Okay. So we... 
All right. Okay, cool. And all right, just shoot ends. Okay, that exploded. Interesting. All right. And shoot ends. Boom. Okay, nice. That was really what? Okay, cool. Really good damage, though. Aw. Uh -huh. I didn't think you'd do that. Quite frankly, I did not expect you to do that. Dodge. Okay. Mm -hmm. And lots of people supposedly eaten, I presume. Then we dodge all the way that ends. Just charge and shoot and. Okay. Aw, oh, come on. Gotta be kidding me. Kidding me. And, okay. Cool. And, oh, goodness. That's tough. Okay, well, we can charge up. Really? Okay. Yeah, but that, that's good damage. Deal about double the damage we otherwise would that way. And boom! Thanks. And, okay, all right. And dodge. And then go. Sweep. Thanks. Sweep the leg. And charge up. And boom. And oh my. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. And, oh, goodness. All right. Okay. Okay. It's a thing, is that arrow and hit oh we hit the body, but that's not what we wanted and oh we timed that wrong. Okay, cool. Makes a lot of things fall down, that's funny. So we can dodge out of the way of that and you don't really sweep. And hit and okay. Good damage, okay. Hit and Face the Abyss Dragon! Okay. It basically doubles the damage, which is really, really good, but... Uh, the S's it takes is... kind of tough. Okay. Hit and shoot it! Okay. Uh, it's just... what are you going to do now? I... Uh, but frankly, even if it deals more damage, it... Uh, and we do have to just worm his attacks to. That is the thing. I feel like some kind of regeneration would be good here. We'll see. And, oh, please. Huh? We're just fighting him. Fighting him up close is kind of a non-starter right now. That's the thing. And if I recall correctly, his viscerals are not... They're health breakpoints rather than... What? Okay. Huh? Health breakpoints rather than pure instances of. Oh goodness, alright. Thanks. What? Okay. Huh. Okay, so using Pure Earth on him is a fun idea. But it makes. It makes it take so much longer. It's kind of a non starter. And frankly. I mean, I could use a bit of it, but when I've got an opportunity, but I'm going to need every single flask I've got for this fight. It might actually be a good idea to use the Estus Ring proper. Uh, we need Hawk and we need... We need these as well. It said, the thing about Prisoner's Chain is that... that is what need. It arguably decreases our maximum... Like decreases the value of our Estus, need. so... It's okay, one-shot protection, but I might actually be better off with Ring of Steel protection and make the SSI half go farther. And we can get rid of that and equip slightly lighter armor. But it's got good anti-dark protection, too. Power gloves will still probably be our way. Other tiers, we got... Or arrows, it's time to go back, take on good old Calamy. Hmm. He's definitely roadblock number one. Hmm. Got a cast our tears, that's right. Uh, I wonder how much one more level of a tomb would get, whether that would give us two casts of tears or whether it would make a difference because even if we don't have any FP flask equipped, we've gotten enough for one cast of 
we've got enough for some cast of tears. That is not meaningless. But this should hopefully poison chain with steel protection should give us more longevity, even if it might not have mean as much initial defense because it would mean more. Ah. Ability to make stuff work with oh and that missed I suppose and oh goodness I oh, oh. all right and dodge it. what are you gonna do now and oh goodness thanks for going around I guess thanks suit and take and dodge one two ah. Okay, and okay, that hit the body, which is not what I wanted, and okay. And you'll sweep. Thanks. And take that and shoot. Okay, okay, ish damage. But not amazing. Now we just go in and shoot and dodge up. Okay. Ah. Huh. That's okay, but Okay, alright, and uh oh, please, okay. See we got a good amount of Steel protection down it. Okay, cool. A bit of times in the fight where we can. Oh, goodness. Alright. Okay, so when he does that, he's rear enough to do a bunch. And... Alright then, alright. Thanks. Feels so good. Okay. So in that case, let's just wait till the head's kind of still and. Uh, of course, it hit that. Stupid. And just dodge and around that way, thanks, and going for the head, and, oh goodness, alright, come on, got to be kidding me, dodge, 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 oh, thanks, huh, what if we shot the head over there and, oh, stupid, okay, and, can we, shoot, and, okay, oh, we didn't get, Really, really, we didn't get the head. Okay, so that, just like an Elden Ring, you dodge a left when that happens. Okay. And he's a little, not a sitting dog, but definitely a bit more manageable then. Then, sweet. And, okay, cool. Then we can. Mm, this. Okay, dodge. Uh, took all my stamina. Okay. The amount of stamina it takes to get a single rainbow shot off is truly annoying. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe I don't do it like this. Maybe I don't do it like this. Maybe I just use a normal bow. Maybe. The idea of using a gray bow for the spine bow is so fundamentally enticing. But the main big annoying thing is that I definitely cannot Kinda. But that is a good attack to try to punish. Then we dodge, getting closer actually, and then we can shoot there and... Aha! So this is going to be painstaking and kind of slow, but... We have to see what we can actually punish it. Okay. So when he stays still, that is not an opportunity to shoot the head. Yep, and that just hit the body. Okay. That is what we need to do. Go for your far end. Okay. Thanks. Come on, come on. Come on, it's What are you doing? I okay. Well, you know, go ahead, I guess. Turn around to points where I could miss, I guess. Oh, come on. I dodge. What if I aim and hit the head? Nice. And then we dodge. Dodge. Interesting. And out of the way of that. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, just... When he stays still, that is not an opportunity to shoot his head at all. That is interesting. Do it. Uh -huh. Okay, never mind. And is he gonna charge? Yeah, definitely. Oh, no, no, no. This is an opportunity for big headshots and dodge. Sweep and roll in. Oh, what? No. Okay. 
When he does the sweep, maybe. Dodge. Okay. It's tough. It's a tough fight. Okay, so, just move that way at. Thanks, thanks, and. Let's dodge over there and. Wow. Okay. This is not happening. This is definitely not happening. You know, there's no real point to doing it like this, but... Okay, cool. Yeah. Wait, did... Oh! Right, the charge didn't kill us. Okay, so just... Thanks, thanks. Yeah, just kill me. Kill me. Okay. I do have a good amount of Millwood arrows. Though I might actually want to save those for phase 2. Because I have fewer of them, they do more damage. So for phase 1, I should save the good things for the second phase when I have to take him down faster. Yeah, I can tell. Thank you, though. Are there any quick tips that you might have? Okay. Come on, come on. What do I want to... Hmm. We'll see. Bow is fun. Bow is nice to use. It definitely takes a lot of silliness away from it, but I'm just it's about keeping my distance at the right time, knowing when to actually go for a punish and what I can punish. But there was something else I thought about doing, and I can't remember what it was now. Oh right, amber, right. Got a bunch of embers, we may as well do this. It won't mm. I feel like Estus Ring could have been a good idea too, but it'd be nice if you could just have more than 15 Estus. Like if it was Dark Souls 1, you could have 20 of them. Especially since Estus and Dark Souls 1 also restores more equivalent of your health bar. Whatever, it's okay. It's nice how it was definitely done for balance reasons, but it was nice how in Dark Souls 1, humanity increased your defenses instead of your health. Oh, goodness, I... Okay. Two, three, four, and... Okay, all right. Two, and... Oh! Oh! Interesting. And... Okay, that actually doesn't deal that much more damage than... Lots of damage than Gullwood. And... Dodge, dodge. Okay. What if I... Shot you there, then? Oh, well, we were close. Dodge. Okay. What if we shot that there and... Ah! Uh, the flight speed is just... obnoxiously slow. That's... crazy. Okay. Boom. And hit and... What? Okay. Oh, come on. Alright. Oh, please. Please. Okay. Dodge. Dodge. What are you... Okay. And... Oh, never mind. Right. Okay. Really, really, okay. Okay. Heal and... This one is... Nice. Shoot and... Do okay. Nice, and then we dodge around and... Oh, never mind. We, we were in the wrong spot. So sometimes we're just in the wrong place. Okay. Cool. And then we just do that and roll. Cool. Yeah, that, that actually worked really well. Thank you for that. Which, if I focus on punishing... Yeah. And it still worked. The main issue is that I dodged the wrong way. Well, I thought I had dodged out of the way of the horizontal beam, or more accurately, sort of the circle sweep beam, and I just simply hadn't. Hmm. I should just, in general, probably... Clear out a lot of superfluous things in my bottomless, in my inventory right now. I'm putting them in the box because if, and this would be silly min max territory, if I took off the shield, I would be able to equip slightly more armor. And that could make the difference. So next time I'll try that. Just in general, it's a hard fight. Now, some people consider free to be the hardest fight in the game. Some people consider Medea to be the hardest fight in the game. It's complicated. I wonder what Frida would have been like if I'd used Ring Nightmare Grades or something. That would have been funny. 
Okay, so what are you doing now? Let's just charge over there and thanks. Nice and that was good. It's actually really good. Oh, okay. Cool. Dodge. Hmm, interesting. So what do you want to do next? Oh, you don't have eyes. That's interesting. Okay, so now you're gonna do that and dodge. Okay, cool. Oh, that didn't even touch me. Okay. So what now? Dodge. Oh, we dodged that too late. Annoying. Annoying. So is this gonna be? No. Okay. Oh. Okay. Just. Oh. And there we go. And just. Dodge all the way that end. Just sweep and dodge all the way that end. Can we? Nice. Thanks. Thank you. And dodge all the way that end. Oh, okay. Cool. Thanks. Okay, heal end. Thanks again. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. This. Okay. I can't be behind him. I want to be in front of him. It's about the right time. I has to be at the right time. And, okay. Let's shoot and see if we can... Do oh, come on. Damage was good, though. Dodge. 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 Get to the side of that would be pretty good. Oh, wow. Okay. Didn't think that would happen. Yeah, but... Definitely want to be in front of him. Hit and just dodge. Thanks. Oh, all right. And then we, thanks. And then we could actually pierce earth. Oh, nice. Okay. So this is not gonna be it though, for sure. Yeah. But we did pretty well. We got a third of his health bar down. Guess. The big thing is, there would be no better time to use Pierce Earth than when he... Well, for one, I should put most of these things in my bottomless box. There's no better time to use Pierce Earth than when he's doing his big fire laser dark breath attack. So shields would be... Oh, this counts as a shield. Which is interesting because... Let's see. Interesting, because the Followers Torch, I believe, counts as a weapon. It's interesting how they decide which is which. Shield of one is right there, and we can't put it in because it's... Yep. Oh, it doesn't just skip over it. It'd be kind of nice if it did, maybe. Then let's put in our Catalyst as well, except for Shine and, I guess, our Power Plane. Everything must go. Everything must go. The only weapons that are in inventory right now are, and this this feels like calumny. I mean, I had to condense so many things in the interest of saving space. That is cool. I can wear slightly heavier armor now. Sit armor and I guess a helmet to hide my hideous head. It's decent. Would actually, actually, my conjurator hood might be. It's better against fire and lightning. I mean, fire and dark, which. It's an idea. True Manchats have very little resistance there, but. Katarina still. But anything that puts me right on the edge. Without putting me over. Hawthorne Knight armor puts me right over. What if I took this off? Or what if I put this on and change forward boots to something maybe even lighter? And lighter fair. Hillshade trousers, shadow trousers. This could be getting very, very maxi here. Right it okay. Right at exactly 50 equip weight. This is going to be ridiculous. Lothric Knight armor with Sorcerer Pants and Pyromancer Gloves in the phone. I guess the real question is, once we beat Medir, what will Gale and Soul of Cinder feel like in comparison? The Soul of Cinder is 
Main boss of the base game. Arguably not as hard as Nameless King, even. Maybe even Champion Gundir. And then you have the DLC with things that are comparably crazy. Let's go forward. Okay. Back to fun. Oh, but we forgot tears. You know what I... Yeah. I can't let that stand. Okay. Gotta use tears and then use my... Ember. Every little bit of health, every little bit of defense is gonna help us here. We have to survive. We have to survive this. Just keep that on there and then exactly... Right when we kill, we will... Switch to Shield of One to get more souls. Not that it really matters at this point. Okay. Maybe if I really wanted to, I could actually take off Covetous Silver Serpent and switch that around too. But at that point, I don't know, that might be excessive. In the end, it's just... I don't really know what other rings I might want to be wearing. Aside maybe also Prisoner's Chain. Prisoner's Chain, even if it let me equip heavier equipment, would, like I said... Since it decreases absorptions, it would probably it would decrease the value of the Estus I have. A little, maybe. We'll see. Okay, so we know what to punish. I guess. Come on, Nadir. We should have punished that. Thanks, thanks, thanks. And dodge, and dodge, and thanks. Oh, okay, alright. Cool, heal. Then what's next? Dodge! Uh, wait till you use her. Pierce Earth. Or not, or not. And shoot ends. Dodge! Oh, come on. It did hit the body, though. Wait until you use her. Okay. Do oh, alright. Thanks. And just dodge and shoot the head and. Nice, nice. That worked. Great, great stuff. And dodge. Okay. Cool. How many hits do we need on the head? To... Is this? No. Okay. Ah. Until I actively see him starting to breathe fire, I need to know what I'm doing and run in it. Dodge to the left. Oh, I need to run to the left. Okay. Cool. All right, and just shoot that and. Heal and okay, that didn't even hit the body. That was annoying. Heal and okay. Thanks. Funny tail sweep, and what are you going to do now? Okay, nice! Hit ends. Dodge ends. Oh, alright, thanks. And then we hit ends. Go over ends. Heal and really, really okay, dodge. Okay. Huh? Not sure how much better what I had was. By the way, we need tears. I. It's a tough one, and okay, I was far away enough that it actually didn't hit. Interesting. Well, now I run over there. Okay, you just run to the left. That's how you do it. Okay. Then we shoot and thanks dodge. Okay. Mm -hmm. Could have and should have done that earlier. Okay. Dodge and... Oh, come on. Alright. Should have run behind him. Okay. This is... It's an interesting fight. Dodge and... Mm, I need some kind of melee sidearm to use for the ball, but... Dodge and... Do oh, thanks. Alright. Damage was good, though. Okay, cool. And pierce earth and... Heal. And dodge... Dodge it. No more pure sword. Okay. Do okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. I just... What? 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 And... So getting under him when that happens is actually pretty decent, but... Ah. Uh, Alright. Thanks. Then... What now? Just gonna... Okay, there we go, and shoot, and we dodge, and away that, and 
charge up another bow shot. Thanks. Okay. So now I know what to do. More or less. And I, mm, all right. Thanks. Never mind. So I know what to punish and I know what I can, more or less, but I... Oh, I did an ember. Okay. Thanks, thanks. Hmm. The big thing is, is... I'm not sure what I would try in a lieu of... what I've got on right now. That it's really good at punishing him when he uses that breath attack, but not much else. And, okay, I should... Uh, let's... Put more stuff in the box. Put this in there. Put my rings in. Yeah, I'm gonna do the ring switch like I said it would. Maybe Sun Princess could be okay. Slow enough. And we... Right, we gotta get Prisoner's Chain out, and then we... Everything up in this... Just put in... Yeah. Alright. Cool. Oh, and then right Hornet's Ring is needed too. Hornet's Ring. Hollow Knight. Then we put all this in, and then these are the rings we need for the fight. I am starting to go mad. Okay. This is Steel Protection. Steel Protection should go here, and. Prisoner's Chain. No, no. A hawk. Right there, because both of them are going to be right next to the rings I need to switch to. Silver and Hornet Ring. Okay, cool. This. I really am min maxing this one. In our absorption, we could equip something a bit heavier now. Sunset Armor. Oh, actually. How much lighter? This is... Hmm, Katarina Armor's got... Better against Dark, or worse against Fire. Oh, yeah, we can get the Funny Onion Armor, I guess. Then, what else could we pick up? It's worse against... But it's better against Physical. We'll see. Question is, now I've got... Hmm. More defenses. Took the ring off. My defense is beyond. Yeah, meaningfully less. Defenses, I believe, are more important than absorptions, so. Here we go! We got our funny onion archer. Okay. It's gonna be great when we start running out of arrows. I can always just buy more from the shrine handmade, but I have to get into my stock of souls. Do you want to do this before I find Gale? Okay. Come on, come on. Let's go down here and take out some of you guys. Onion Archer for the win. Or for the... Hopefully for the win. At the very least for survival. We'll see. Then we'll go back and drop back down again. And right, we needed to use our Ember. That's right. Ember up right here. That said, it might actually have been better to use the Ember as a heal. Oh, but okay. That's still, even with Hawkbrain, too far to hit. Interesting. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Hmm. What if I did that? Okay, cool. Oh, do we... The arrow proc, but we didn't hit anything? That is profoundly strange. Okay. See all the way until we. Oh, come on. Dot. Oh, stupid. This has already gone very, very badly. Not a single hit on anything. But of course, use that now. After hitting me a bunch of times. Okay. But this is going to be slow and painstaking. I just have to wait for him to do his most punchable attack and punish that attack. And then when he goes for a critical, I mean, when I can get a critical off on him, I can go for that critical, switching to Twin Spears and Hornet Ring for maximal damage. But until that happens, I am 
waiting for him to give me opportunities to hit him, which I can hopefully take advantage of. Probably actually, if I'm being as conservative, I might want to use the millwood arrows instead to make every little bit of damage count. Okay. Over here. All right. You have got to be kidding me. Okay. Uh, uh. Got 80 shots in total. We gotta make them count. Should be enough in theory. Or if I want to be really funny, I could try Pestilent Mist Cheese. I think I could. I think I might be able to get barely enough intelligence for that. Mm -hmm. And out of the way, and dodge. Oh, please. Gotta be kidding me. Gotta roll out of the way of that, and maybe I might actually be better off going for some melee? Maybe. Alright, dodge. Let's shoot and hit. Thanks. Nice. Dodge. Okay. Dodge. Ah. And we spin out of the way and shoot until we get you relatively still and then. Thank you. And oh, we. He speeds up. He accelerates enough that we have to. Okay, so that means we shoot and then we dodge and then we sweep and. Okay. Wow. Okay. Huh. That was different than expected. But, okay. So we have to. Right before the fire hits, then we roll out of the way. Then, okay, cool. Hit ends. So actually staying somewhat close might actually be a better idea. But, oh, come on. I, alright. Hmm. I like being more aggressive is actually the way. There we go, and just dodge and. Oh, never mind. Alka? Huh. Alright. Exactly. If I really wanted to, that's the thing, is that I rolled too early. Thought it was easier than it would be. Took that off, and if I wanted to be truly ridiculous, I could use these for heals. I could simply use embers for healing. It would be a really silly way to do this. Yeah, I'll just do that. I'll start taking some damage. I'll ember up after I take damage. Oh my goodness. This is gonna get really silly. But, this is the most significant challenge after Surmount. There are three bosses left in the game Calamite, Gale, and Soul of Cinder. After that, it's all done. But before that, well, also, I do have to take down. Ring finger Leonard. <laughs> that shouldn't be nearly as bad. Okay. Let's see something. Let's go for the tears. I mean, not the tears, but we had the tears up. Go for the amber once we. Let's run in. And this should be a place where we can hit and shoot. There we go. Go for a shot and. Alright. So it offers a decent amount of damage, and I guess the big question is how many shots do I actually have to get in to win the fight? Headshots, ideally. But we'll see. Come on, come on. Alright, thanks. Shoot and shoot and. Oh, and it missed. It missed again. Come on, come on, and. There we go, and shoot. And we. Dodge! Thanks, and then we. Charge. Okay, there we go. And shoot. And there we are. Nice. Now we roll and before roll and okay, we still took damage, but this is going to be ember time. Cool. That takes damage, more damage than I would like, but we're okay. And then we shoot and oh well, all right. I thought that would have been more. Oh please, we're kidding. Heal and what? Oh, come on. Okay. One, two, and... 
dodge, dodge. Okay, thanks. What if we shoot you there, Ents? Okay. Dodge, dodge. Oh, thanks, I guess. Thanks. And then we shoot the head, Ents. Kill, kill. Then we dodge. Okay. Let's get out of the way of that, which is good. And then we just do not. Thank you. Do not do your tail attack on me. Please. One, two. Dodge. Dodge. And, oh, come on. Dodge. But this is. Headshot. Point blank. Thank you. Oh, what? Oh, you have a. You have a grab attack? Okay. Alright then. Thanks. Okay, cool. Heal. And it's just. Do oh, come on. Alright. I was expecting that and. Dodge, dodge, okay, cool. Hit and shoot and thank you. That was good, actually. A roar is something not to be traveled with. Okay. Then we out of the way of you and okay, cool. Nice. Oh, alright. Thanks. And of course the tail is annoying in that case. In a charge mirror. Dodge. Okay, cool. Up and right, and then we dodge. Okay, and then we what? Okay, then cool. Not expecting that. Okay, come on, you know, charge me and okay. Rolling basically as soon as that shows up is a good idea. And okay, come on and dodge. Oh, we went the wrong way, entirely the wrong way. Oh, oh all right, thanks. Okay, heal and just dodge. Dodge, thanks, and... Okay, cool, and shoot! Nice dodge! Ah, oh, come on. Come on! Okay. Using embers as healing is a funny idea, but it would be pretty clumsy. Dodge, dodge! Mm. Thanks. Heal. Uh-huh. I... Got a good amount of his health down, but still, I. Hmm. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna. Oh, please. Oh, Alright. We need to try that again. Let's rest it at him. Thank you. The annoying thing was that. I guess I should have gone for two dodges. Two rolls, the left or right, because I got hit by the first beam explosion when I went for the first sweep, and that was not fun. Okay. Do you have... Let me just see what my arrows are like. Equipment is... Oh, goodness. We are starting to run a little low. Which means that every fight is going to have to count. 80 arrows. 80 arrows. Assuming that we hit with... Assuming that half of the arrows we fire would be headshots. We deal about... 5,000 damage, 500 damage. Like either in the deer. The deer has... Well, that would be... 30 or so arrows, which actually isn't horrible. Hmm. Well, we'll see. This is, without a doubt, the greatest challenge in the game. Well, Frida, Frida can be bad, too. Yes, it, it depends on the build. Maybe I could just be funny and try using Drank Twin Spears on him. That could be an interesting option. Okay, that's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. And, uh, uh, thank you. And just dodge. Thanks. Dodge. Huh. Okay. Stay locked. See what attacks you're gonna use. Dodge. And thanks. That's interesting. And dodge! Okay, now you're hittable. Should be. Thanks. Good damage. Dodge! Okay, cool. Then we can. What are you gonna do? Uh, okay. Take this slow and steady. Nice and slow and steady. Okay, cool. That's it. And then we shoot, and then we dodge on the way of that, and then we dodge. Okay, cool. Then we shoot you again. 
and hit the body instead because nothing good can last. And hit. Oh, never mind. Okay, we needed to. Hmm, that was tough. Dodge. Okay. So we need to dodge real early when we see that attack come out. Interesting. And we dodge. And what if we shoot you here? Thanks. Nice! That shot. Dodge. Dodge and dodge. Okay, well. That could have been an opportunity if I'd been smarter. The big thing is. Okay. What if I shoot and. Oh, never mind. Now, of course, you're doing that, so. You have to uh, dodge! Nice, that worked actually. So that means. Shoot the head. And there we go. Cool. And there we are. Shoot and. Oh, never mind. Okay. Cool. And what? Really? Okay, so we need to dodge instinctually. What? Okay. Big thing is, when he uses that fire breath, when he charges up fire breath, we need to dodge instinctually. Because I won't know whether he's doing the big beam attack or the forward fire breath until it's happened. And by the time it's happened, if he does forward fire breath, it'll be too late for me to dodge it. Okay. And okay, we are actually starting to run low on arrows. What kind of bloodborne thing is this? It's a shame there's no dungeon for that. No farming dungeon. Have mercy on me. Okay. Thank you very much. Let's just keep on going. And then just pick up where we left off. Remember to use a bit of an ember for healing. Yeah, we have put all of our stock into just surviving and dealing out ranged damage to him. We're gonna have to hmm, stick with that. And yep, there's Gale, and there's... That's all, really. So, what is... We hit their end. Get a hit on the body. If we'd been a bit faster, we could have maybe got a hit on the head. It's possible, it's an idea, and under, and just, uh, going around like that was not pleasant for me, and dodge, and then we shoot you in the head, thank you, and things we can, okay, cool, nice, dodge, nice, dodge, and out of the way, that, and thanks, we need to dodge again, okay, cool, so let's ember up, got time for that. Then we dodge. Thanks. Okay. Good damage. Good damage. We just gotta see what we can actually punish. And there we go. Cool. Shoot and just dodge. Out of the way that thing. Then we dodge. Move and shoot and. Ah, uh, that was a body shot. Going. And oh well, never mind. And yep, see exactly after what. Oh, wow. Please, please don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself, please. I, I don't know what I can do. I'm sorry. Okay, well. Then we... Oh, come on. Come on. You gotta stand the way the tail. And we... Mm, tail sweep and... There we go. What are we doing now? What are you doing now? Charge me... Oh. I... Mm, what? Please. Alright. Then we dodge in the way of that and shoot it. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, then we dodge out of the way of that and charge another millwood arrow and hit the body. Dodge. Oh, what? We can dodge to wait for that too. We've got to be kidding. Okay. Really? Really? Okay. What are we gonna do? And cool. Thanks, and just dodge, dodge. Back and cool. Shoot and thank you. Another body shot. You've got to be kidding me. What? It's a very cool battle, undeniably. Quite frankly, I should just be using the spears for this. As fun as the idea of using the bow for this was, it was not really an option. Dodge and okay, cool. Come on and hit. Yeah, see, it just 
Unless I framed it, even then. The amount of ones that just miss. The amount of the attacks that simply miss is ludicrous. Okay, and then we dodge and run behind it, sweep and the it. He's cool. The definition of cool. And then we can shoot again at thanks, I guess. Okay. Second, I should have known he would have gone for a second. Okay. Huh? This, what can I do? Just run around behind you, and I guess. Just don't go for a tail attack, I guess. But dodge! As soon as I see the charge start, that's when I need to go, but... The eye! As fun as the idea of using a gray bow was, the fantasy did not live up to the reality. Okay. And cool. Thanks. Shoot. Nice. Then we dodge. Ah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Sitting the head is what I gotta do. And I'm, yeah, I'm starting to run out of arrows. That's the reason this just isn't gonna work. Then we thanks, thanks, and dodge, and out of the way of that. And then we sweep and charge up another bow shot, and it just misses. Great, great, and then you'll do another one. Or not, or not, you'll just do that instead. Okay. Come on, and hit. Or not, or I guess it kind of works. Huh. This is pretty good, but it's not amazing. Dodge. Okay, cool. Close to the head, and just... What are you gonna do, do, and... Ah, oh, please. Like, Alright. Gotta move as far away as soon as possible so you don't do your tail swing or you do that. Okay, cool. Thanks. Nice. What if we manage to make this work and dodge up? Okay, cool. We'll do another one or what? Come on, dodge it. Okay. Huh? This is tough. Dodge. Oh, thanks. I. It's an idea. We have got, have got him down to half health now. That is really, really good. But, and just dodge, dodge, and oh, I didn't think he'd go straight. That was annoying. Okay, I. It's an idea. It's an idea. God, oh, what? You kidding? Okay, tears. Uh, you can try one more time with the bow, but uh, I just, yeah. One more time with the bow, but then I would start running out of the arrows. And I don't want to have to pay for that, so I'm just going to end up using spears for this because he's weak to thrust damage. The spears deal thrust damage. Probably be using most of these same rings, most likely. We'll see. Yeah, tears and then maybe a lightning boy or two. But it's a cool fight, but it's undoubtedly a hard fight. And as cool as the bow is, it isn't always exactly hacking it. One more go like this, and then we use Ring Twin Spears and see if that carries the day. And then, after that... Oh, Soul of Cinder and... Gale are both relatively weak to bludgeoning in terms of physical damage, so that would be a good thing to try to use against them. Other than that, who knows. It would be, fire's good on Gale, Lightning is good on Soul of Cinder, but you know... The joke lights itself, kind of. Okay, cool ends. Hit, uh, that did not, that hit the body. Just very, very, barely. But dodge. Thanks. Oh, please. All right. Thanks. Thanks. It's ever up. What are you going to do now that you're underneath? And, oh, that's when you use that fire attack. Okay, cool. Well, all right. Thanks. Shoot ends. Hit the body, I guess. 
Oh, but you can't use embers while you're already amber. This is healing instance once, but it's not really a great idea. Okay. Cool. Go for something I can actually punish. Don't- oh! What? Okay. Come on, come on, it's... Go for a fire attack or something, please. Dodge. Dodge. Oh, please. I thought that would be a good opportunity. Almost was. Almost. Shoot it. Thanks. Dodge. Bite. Oh. Should've known to bite immediately there. Well, whatever. Okay, cool. Then we just... Over there, and... We charge me, clearly. Let's get out of the way of that, and... Come on, come on. Please, please, and obviously, obviously. Okay. Assume that charge isn't something I can try to interrupt. And we. Hmm. Depends if he leaves his stuff there, that's good to know. I messed that up. And then I tried way too hard to make that work, and shoot, and. Good damage, and out of the way. Gonna go for another, yeah, you kind of are. Okay, cool, so, shoot and thanks. That damage is actually really, really good. Now, what are you doing? Clearly and, oh, thanks. Dodge, dodge, and then, gotta be a little riskier with that then. Cool, shoot and, nice headshot. Great stuff, and just... Thanks! One now. More fire, and... Shoot, and... Thanks. Right for the head. Nine. No, no, okay. Not fun, not fun. And then we... Run out of the way and jump. Thanks. Okay, cool. Then we... Charge up the bow on you. Then we shoot, and see what happens. Thanks, and then... Oh, goodness. Dodge, and sweet, and charge up a shot, thank you, and good stuff, and we, hmm, we're doing better with ourselves this time, but uh, it's not perfect, and what if we shoot, thanks, that, we have to be aggressive with our use of fire, some arrows, and thanks, and then we, down around that way and immediately charge one up to shoot and there we go. Cool. Yeah. A great bow doesn't make this fight easy, but it does help. It's a lot of fun too. So then what if we shoot you over here? And nice, okay. Uh question is when we use our twin spears, what are we gonna get? And we dodge it, okay? Sweep around that way, and thanks, and uh, only a body shot that time. Dodge, and you know, yep, and okay, cool. What if we shoot you? Try to shoot you. Nice, and finally another one of those charges. Let's see what happens. Come on, come on. Oh, okay. Huh? Well, you're being kind of nice to me. Let's not jinx this. What are you doing now? And just... Oh, please. I... Dodge. Could have gone a second hit, but... Oh, and that was too close to me. Alright, thanks. Dodge. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Oh, I... Dodge. What did I... Oh, please. I... Okay, and shoot and hit the head. Hmm, we're almost... Almost gone down to half health, which is really, really nice. One more and swing. Thanks. Shoot. Lovely. Almost out of these ones right here, so I... Oh, right, it's time for phase two. Yay. Okay, cool. Is that there and... Nice. Do it now. You're gonna dodge out of the way. Okay, cool. Wow, why is the fire so much stronger? Okay, cool. Thanks. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, wow. Okay. Cool, never mind. I. Interesting. Dodge. Okay. And what if I shoot you in? Oh, goodness. I. Okay, cool. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay. Thanks. 
Dodge! Okay, thanks. Oh, please. Okay. Shoot and right in the head and... Do oh, thank you. What? Alright, and... Thanks. Just stay out of the way of that and kill you. Oh, goodness. You know, I should have expected Phase 2 to kind of whoop me, but... Not to this extent, really. Well, as in, I wasn't expecting to whoop me to this extent, but maybe I should have. Alright, and what if I shoot you there and dodge, dodge. Okay, alright, thanks. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, thanks. Alright. What are you doing now? This is tough. Oh, uh, well, we can shoot you. Oh, or not. Or, well, alright. Thanks. Should have expected that, frankly. Cool. And we shoot and miss entirely. Okay. What are you doing now? Yeah, we're running out of S's and out of arrows. This is painful. And now we jump. Thanks, and charge up a shot on you. Thanks, and shoot. Thanks. There we go, and dodge. And shoot again. Cool. What do we dodge? Okay. Thanks, and oh goodness. We need to run out of the way of that, and Dodge, dodge. Oh, please. Dodge. Thanks. Thanks. And still, if we can... Oh, no, never mind. Okay. We are in a real position now. And what are you gonna... Do okay, dodge. Thanks. What are you gonna do? Come on, I... Oh, no, I... Dodge. 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 Oh, wow. Okay. So, and then we... One more with... Right... What? Okay. All right. Okay. Phase two is... Certainly a phase. I think... I'm just going to pop a bunch of souls, buy a bunch more arrows, try that again, because... The bow strategy actually worked pretty well. I don't think I can discount that. It's just... I didn't expect him to go for another forward beam when he did his frenzy beam attack. And we got him... We caught him most of the way down. We did very well for ourselves. But... Hmm, gotta buy more souls. I mean, more arrows. That would be... A few more Merwoods. Arrows. Merwood arrows. Could get. What do we have? We have none. So we need three of those and then. Hmm. 30 and then. Spy Bunch. Actually, we could get 20 of those, and then I guess we could buy... Okay, cool. Okay. Alright, so... We're going all in on the arrow strategy. But if it works, it works. Fair. And to be fair, Gale is pretty cool too. I'll go I'll go try to kill Gale right after this. Gale shouldn't be as bad. Medir is generally considered to be harder than Gale by pretty much ever pretty much everyone, so. I don't think I should have too much to fear, but we'll see. Okay, cool. Big thing is, is I'm wondering. It's possible to actually break his head for an early visceral, if I recall correctly. Well, Medir is not an end boss so much as an extra boss. Which is a meaningful distinction. Tears, recasting, casting tears. I feel like going for a quick early hit. And the dragon should be the way to go. We'll see. Oh, hello. Hold on. Hold on this way. Shoot the dragon. 
get a quick shot off on you from over here, I believe. Should be fine. Then we do that and shoot it. Okay, that actually hit the body. That, because of the insomnia, there's no such thing as being truly asleep for you. Okay. Come on, come on. Dodge. Go for another. There we go. And, cool. And then we shoot the Millwood arrow. Nice. Good damage. And another one. And, cool. Hit and boom. Well, that missed. Alright. So what now? Try to stay a little bit close because that attack is really annoying. It's actually probably the least punishable attack he has. So just out of the way of that, and can we shoot the head? Nice. Okay. Dodge. And what if we shoot you? And another hit. And oh, okay. Right, right. Rather be having fun. Fair enough. And so. Shoot and oh another mess. Another mess. God be kidding me. And, okay, cool. And then we wonder if being on the right or left of him determines the attacks he uses. You can see that. Okay, so just hit and shoot the head and so now we shoot the head again and thanks. And just dodge out the way Oh alright. Thanks. So actually this would be the perfect time to use an amber. Kill up all the way. Perfect. Okay, Amber restored. Huh. We used too much Estus, so... Then we shoot and... Okay, alright. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Dodge and... Thank you, and shoot. Thanks. Well, we... Okay. Thanks, I guess. Huh. Dodge. Out of the way of that. And, okay, thanks. Huh, interesting. That could be punishable if I was a bit more aggressive. Two ends. We're gonna go for another sweep. Oh, goodness. Okay. It's not expecting fire. Okay. And then we over there and shoot. Got that ready so we can... Oh, wow. Okay, I... Interesting. Dodge. Okay. This one might not be... Perfect, like I want it to be. Dodge. Oh, stupid. I need to be. I need to stay close. Even if I'm using a bow and arrow, I need to stay close to this guy, actually. Seems we don't have to chase him as much, so. Shoot and. Dodge, dodge. Oh, thanks. Dodge. Okay, cool. And. Shoot the head and. Heal. And we. Interesting idea, but uh, so getting behind him right at the end could be okay. Conceptually and oh thanks. Didn't get that at all. Dodge it. Okay. Cool. Shoot the head. And we're going and now you're just doing that. Let's jump in. Thank you. Back down here, so. Thanks and shoot. Nice. We're about halfway, so. Oh great. And Okay, alright. Thanks. Dodge. More Estus. Yeah, that's the thing, is that I can't actually... Uh, do what I might like in the sense of... I need to be more cautious in regard to that attack. Specifically... Do oh, come on. Thought it was close enough. Whatever, I... Okay. Dodge. But, okay, please, please. So I do need to run behind, or at the very least, he starts from that side, which is not great, not great for me. Then we go around to the side like that, and then wait till you go over, and cool. Dodge. Okay. So actually, I should stay far away enough, and if he does that attack, I can, you know, counter it. Okay. Cool, and that hit. Cool. So what now? What now? Uh, uh, so when you do that, you get to dodge and then round behind and then you'll go around over there. Cool, cool. Then we just shoot and... What? What? Huh? Okay. Interesting. 
That's certainly curious and different. Okay, shoot and... Huh? I don't want to do this. Well, now. Now you're... Okay. Beam and... Run. Roll. Roll and... Beam. Beam and... Okay. What? Oh, you have to roll kind of the left then. Or... What? Okay. So the issue there is that the speed is inconsistent. They lie to you. Okay. One more go. I don't feel like refreshing my souls with... He's a lot more melee-oriented than I expected. And the reach of the Twin Spirit should help, too. It was cool trying to get this guy with a great bow, but quite frankly, I don't think that's going to happen. There are... Lots of factors getting in my way. But as cool as it is to try to punish his breath attack by getting two arrows off, I actually have to wait. Because if I go for multiple, and he does the one where he just breathes straight ahead, I just take the full brunt of that attack, and it's not good. I do also like that you kind of have to jump out of the way of his flying fire breath attack. Definitely makes things more interesting and different. Okay, well... Alright. Alright. Uh -huh. Okay. Gonna go down. We got our tears up. We got our other stuff up. We can just shoot things. Oh, look. Someone's joined us. Not really. Go over here about midway and charge that down and shoot and That did not hit the head. Oh, alright. Two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and cool. And nice. Wait, what? We couldn't change our direction fast enough? That's some nonsense. And what are you doing now? Thanks. Okay, cool. Shoot and oh well. And it didn't even hit him. It went too low and it just went over his body. This is a very, very bad run. Yeah, I... I'm gonna consign this one to the Hellfire. That went really badly. Okay. So I didn't waste an ember. One more go with the bow and arrow, and then I... use the spears. It'd be funny if the first time I used the spears, I got it. Don't predict that'll happen, though. Hmm. Okay. Cool. Because there's not actually a huge difference made by the bow... He's using that beam attack because he moves too fast to actually use it all that well. And then you just get hit. You want to stay away so you can actually dodge the things, regardless of where he is. Maybe if I was if I was really fun, I could try to get behind him. I don't know. I'm sure he would do something worse. He would just channel all the dark energy he was using his breath for into some kind of multi-hitting melee dark attack. Probably. So actually, we'd probably be better off with... Oh, but I don't have to have stone plate right now. Steel protection plus three is arguably better. It sounds that it goes to plus three. Okay. Come on, come on. Thanks. Continue your rampage. And dodge. And do oh, alright. Thanks. Then we can just shoot you in the head. Thanks. Okay, alright. Then we can dodge. This will use our ember here. Cool, cool. And okay, oh, okay, alright. That's what happens. You go under him, so let's not do that. Oh, come on. Okay. Just, what's next? And, thank you, see? Exactly. Does a attack to try to punish that, so that's in a position where we can shoot you and... Nice. Dodge. Okay. Mm -hmm. Come on, one, two, and dodge. Okay. And what? Alright. We did get a hit off. 
Let's go. Dodge. Dodge. Oh, all right. And what? Huh? Did that hit me? Excuse me? Okay. All right. Let's just leave again. Bullets for Fragment is way too far away. You know, because it's... It'd be nice to have it on Hotbar, but... And to get in the way of the other stuff. That's stupid. It's tough. Okay, so... I don't have that ember to use right now, so... Maybe I could try Estus Ring, but... Eh, whatever. It's still probably going to be better than... Dark Stone Play. If this doesn't work, I switch to the Drain Twin Spears and see how well that works. It's close enough and strong enough. And I'll probably stay with more or less this melee setup. Maybe I could put Dark Stone Plate on there with it. Because I don't think I'm going to get enough attacks in enough of a short duration to actually get any meaningful damage out of Pontiff Eye. Alright. Okay, cool. Let's do it like this. Then... Nope, you want to start the fight off with that, I guess. Three, four, and dodge, dodge, around, thank you, cool. Shoot and hit, nice. The damage, dodge, and cool, hit, nice, and did that hit too? Okay, oh, but I, oh, okay, cool. And hit over there. Okay, I need to have... Um, some, some in the web's health. I can't. Oh, this is really, really bad. Not horribly. Thanks. Well, we didn't use a lot of arrows, so. Once I'm out of Millwoods, that's going to be the end of that. End of that attempt, I am going to give up on the arrow strategy and just go for Twin Spears. I made those Twin Spears specifically to deal thrust damage to things where thrust damage is effective. So you better believe that I'm going to try to use them against Medir. What I will say is... They aren't going to be especially... It's a long enough boss run that I can't just use a Lightning Blade on them. Actually, maybe I could use Lingering Dragon Crest instead of... No, Darkstone Plate would probably still be better. Maybe Firestone Plate for the first part of the fly. Dark Stone Plate for succeeding parts. Once it gets to phase two and Dark becomes more relevant. That could be an idea. Then we switch to Hornets or something to do the critical if I manage to actually stance break them. That's an idea. Okay, okay. Thanks. Go ahead. Your fire attack. Two and three. Dodge. 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 There you are. Thanks. Cool. Shoot. And oh, it hit the back. Ray. Ray. Okay. It's a good thing we didn't go for the other thing there, so let's just shoot the head and dodge. On. Oh. No, that's not something I should really try to punish. Dodge. Okay. Thanks, and... Okay, cool. What if I shoot over there, and... Cool. If I'm in melee, actually. Sort of melee punish for the bow, but at that point, I may as well just be using the Twin Spears anyway. I guess. One, and... Shoot, and... Oh, we didn't hit anything at all. It's nonsense. Oh, please. Okay. Cool, and... What if I... Oh, no. Never mind. I, okay. That did not hit a single thing. Okay. Cool. And shoot it. Dodge, dodge. Oh. What? No! Really? Really? This one went horribly. Okay. Cool. Then we should probably... And... Before we do that, we can... Tears up. Thanks. Cool. And... Dodge. Dodge. Now that you're there, we can shoot the head and... Hmm. 
It's not impossible, it's just gone very, very badly. It's gone poorly. Dodge! If you can rest your head there for a little bit, we can shoot you in. Obviously, we're gonna do that. Okay, cool. Come on, come on, let's not miss with our arrows. That's the big thing. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, cool. Thanks. Oh, alright. Thanks. I just. Ugh, oh, but. Timing. You agree that I have to time my attacks here. And the fact that you can't just. Come oh. on. Really? Really? Okay, okay, and just sweep, and there we go, and shoot the head, and really it missed entirely. God to be kidding me. And really? That it too? What? What? Okay. Cool, I guess. And oh, because we're out of arrows. We're out of those arrows. That was what was going on. Right, right, okay. Cool, 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 and, and then we Hit you and that's the really annoying thing is that you can't change direction. If you move, you just have to knock the arrow again because it has to be rooted in the ground. That's not nearly. It's not nearly strong enough to make up for such a deficit. Detriment. I mean, dodge. Uh, and, and thanks. Cool. Shoot and. And that just didn't hit anything. Great. And dodge. Really, really. God damn you. Yeah, the bow and arrow is a fun idea, but it's entirely a game. I just... The damage that I have is not nearly enough to make it worth it. Dodge. Oh, what? What? This attempt is... Just screwed. I can't... Hope to actually win this fight at this period. Okay, so there are limits to how much you can swivel. Very strict limits. Dodge. Go around, and then we. Okay, cool. And, okay, and make sure we go in the right place. And of course, it completely missed. Completely missed. Stupid, stupid fight. Then you... okay. Yep, exactly. Can't do that. I have to go over there. What? Well, maybe I just let you kill me. Just kill me already. Yeah. It was, it was stupid of me to even think that this would have worked. Bows have sucked in every Dark Souls game, except Dark Souls 2. And even there, they're not good. I'm just going to use the Drain Twin Spears. There's nothing else I can do at this point. <sighs> okay. That'd be a Stormer, but actually, would. Havel! Havel! Uh huh. Okay. Going Havel mode. Okay, so this we can use. Put Fire and Dark Stone Plate back. Anonymous Box, get our rings back. Get our. Fire and dark stone point rules. Okay. Cool. First half we will equip fire stone point. Second half we will equip dark stone point. Uh, and then we'll switch. Oh, right, but we also have. Mm, Hornet ring. Alright, well, I can switch to that. To Hornet ring for the final visceral or whatever. Okay. Mm. Got our tears, we can have a couple of casts of lightning blade, I guess, but it'll definitely expire by the time we reach the place. Alright, cool. Dodging, dodging, dodging. I'm gonna use these funny spears to take a dragon down. Ideally. Took a lot of souls, but and to be fair. That wasn't even half of a level up at this point. And arrows and stuff, and we did get very, very close near the end. Maybe could have clinched it if I knew how to deal with, deal with his attacks a bit better, but that's life. Okay. Well, alright. 
Should be pretty good. We can just lightning blade it up, maybe. Once, two, three, and then we all dodge in, and then we dodge, and then there we go. We can. Wait, what? How did? Huh? Oh, because I don't have priestess ring equipped. That's right. I'm an imbecile. Dodge, and then we go around. Dodge! Oh, well, okay. We were too close. It was an idea. Okay, what if we... Yeah, we... We do a good damage this way. This is more than satisfactory. Let me... Okay, we can't... We can't try doing that, can we? No. So the Ambers are interesting. Dodge. Thanks. Thanks. And we... Play... Kit Chase with Nadir is... Not horrible, but... And we can't use Lightning Blade, really. Not really. We're already out DPSing this. This is very tolerable. Very, very useful. Very good. And dodge. Okay, cool. What if we rush in and stab you in the head? Okay. Cool. Alright. This is honestly quite saddening. I expected more. As in more performance out of my other options and in comparison. So let's just rush in, stab it. Okay, alright, thanks. Ah. Okay, cool. So Lightning Blade is an interesting idea, but I need a bit more. Maybe I could try Carthus. No, but he definitely was just fine. I... We're gonna have to just do this. Is the blades straight up? No buffs, no nothing. Just going for it. Maybe I could try Pyroflame, Carthus Flame Arc for a bit of extra damage, but... Like I said, he resists pretty much everything. Everything except Lightning, and I guess kind of Magic maybe, and... I don't have Dark Moon Blade. Don't even have the stats for it even if I did. Or if I want to be really fun, I could try Karthus. Or I could be really, really funny and go for Ring Knight Paired Swords, but the fire will definitely do things for me. Come on, come on. Uh, I am losing my grip. Get one cast of Tears of Denial. Additional cast beyond what I already have. Everything else is just going to be Dancing with the Devil. Don't have my bow, and I don't have any real good use cases for it. Now the have armor on though, which is nice. One, two, three, and dodge, dodge, dodge. Thanks, 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 and then go. You can rush it and hit you. Thanks, and oh, never mind. Time that babbling, and okay, thanks. Okay, cool. What if we one, two, three, and what? Oh, please, I, okay. Come on. Okay, alright. Uh, this is actually even worse. Interesting, and I... Okay, cool, what if I... Stab and... Okay, so that actually goes from being one of his most annoying attacks, one of his most punishable. Interesting. So let's run it. Stab and... Not one off, but... I, okay, cool. And really, really, okay. Dodge it. Okay. Run in. Stab you. Two and... Reach is actually very useful here. Dodge it. Come on. Come on. Get up. Thanks. One, two, three, four. And dodge. Dodge. What else are you going to do? You're going to do that. Do oh, thanks. Okay. Cool. And we... Really? Really? Okay. I can't tell whether I'm doing better or worse. I really can. The standard, at least, isn't really resisted. So that should be okay-ish. Oh. You know, it's just kind of like a... You know, maybe if I killed Gale first, the small amount of additional durability I might have from that could help, but... You know, strong, maybe. 
Okay. Come on, but I... Oh, I forgot to... I'm stupid. I'm so stupid. I forgot to... I forgot to replenish my FP after getting tears. Stupid. Literally, there are only four things left in the game, and one of them is a tiny NPC quest. It's Medir, it's Gale, it's Soul of Cinder. And after that, it's... Well, actually, before that, I suppose, it's... Leonard's quest, but got Firestone played on, got Ring of Steel protection, got everything oriented towards survivability, got an Ember to pop whenever I get to low enough health to give me more HP as well, and I've got a weapon which in theory should be pretty good at beating him, or at the very least has good reach, as he does like to stay off the ground. I think I can manage this if I play it as cautiously as I did with the ball. I've been a bit riskier on the this. That's definitely part of my problems. One, two, three, four, five. Come on, and then go around this way, and then we can run in and charge you, and get a couple of hits, and that couple of times should be. Come on, and run in and strafe, and play catch up. One, two, and dodge. Dodge it. Okay. What are we gonna do? And. Okay. No, I was too late. Come on, come on, and. Please. Oh, thanks. Great. And we. Dodge, and then we. Roll, 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 and. Thank you, and there's your dad. So that went. became a very good opportunity for me. Well, kinda. Debatably. And we run it. Stab you, get another hit in. Really, this is just dodge. Okay, run in. This running attack is probably my best bet for a number of things. Thanks, and roll one, two. Okay, well, alright, alright, and it's cool. And we amber up, and cool, thanks, cool, alright, and amber. Thank you, and uh, that hit the body rather than the head, and that is not good for me. What if I run in and stab your head? It's a little, a little, and one, two, and oh, come on, I, all right. Run through the fire, and one, two, and this, this is slow and painstaking, but I'm doing much better in terms of just dodge. One, two, three, and okay, that didn't quite work. Get two hits off, which is better than one, but you have to be very, very. Oh, dodge. Smart about this. Just come down, and oh, you're that far away. You mongrel, you imbecile. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Thanks, thanks. Out of the way of that, and then you spin around, and we can just maybe get a couple hits on you. Okay. It's like big arrows piercing through your flesh. And just dodge. And right. One, two, three. And no, no, we didn't. Decent enough, but... Okay, this... This is so much better, it's not even fun. Dodge. Dodge. Okay. Dodge. Gonna, oh, nothing more. And I can't afford to start waiting this out. And just dodge, and then we... Dodge, and... Okay, cool. Then you, you're right here. One, two, three, four. And that miss? What? Huh? How'd that miss? Whatever, okay. Then we just roll out of the way of that, and you're almost at half. Fun. Okay. Charge, and... Okay, cool. That's a good chance to hit you for okay-ish damage, and then we, okay, and it's down there, and just dodge, and now you've spun around, so cool, and that doesn't hit anything. What if we dodge, and dodge out of the way of you, thank you, cool, cool, thank you, Vidir, and what, oh, alright, thanks, just go for your crazy berserk combo, I guess, and... Thanks, out of the way of that, and, okay. 
I know that phase transition should be soon, and we're not dealing with as much of a dodge. Oh, what? What? Huh? Huh? You're kidding. Okay, cool. Thanks, I guess. Thought it'd be far away enough for that. Maybe I should dodge towards and then towards the body. It's an idea. Thanks, and alright, so we rush in and stab, stab the head a bunch, and there we go, and just dodge all the way that before you explode. Thank you, cool. Eventually, we should get a repost of some sort, so dodge, dodge, and then we dodge, oh, alright, and then we classic, okay, cool, and then we rush in, no, nothing, nothing, dodge, dodge, oh, please, let me heal, and and you're over there, so what if we... What are you doing now? Stab and dodge. Dodge. Mm, thanks. Thanks. Then we just roll out of the way of that. And, oh, right, since it's phase two, we should probably switch to dark stone point. Oh, well, all right, thanks. Cool, cool. Should have done that some time ago. Then we... Dodge. And then we... Dodge, and then we dodge, then we do two more, and then we dodge, quick, exactly, there we go, nice fast dodge, and what happens when we, can we get close enough to you, no we can't, okay, so in that case, let's switch to dodge, some point, dodge, oh, okay, alright, thanks, cool, I should have used my time better, I should have used my time better, thanks, at least that didn't hit me, okay, cool, Come on, come on. I just... What am I going to do? Really? Dodge and... Okay. Thanks. The only thing I can really counter are melee attacks. And then if you... Do oh, what? Okay. I didn't know that was a thing you could do. Wow. All right. And dodge. Dodge. Okay. Cool. And we're under you, which means we should turn around soon and become normal for one quick hit, hopefully, and we're not. You are. Maybe I just need to hit the body? Go for body shots? I really don't know. Okay. One, two. And we dodge. Dodge. If we can manage to hit you in a melee, we can... Okay. That is much, much better. Come on, come on. I... Alright. Cool. And we dodge all the way to that, and uh, I just don't have a good way to actually hit you now. Dodge and chuck it, cool. So what if we... One, two, three, four. Actually, if we just hit the body, we could jump. Oh, thanks. Might have to go for his legs. That's really aggravating, but it's what I gotta do. It's what I gotta do. Guess I can't always rely on hitting the head. Then, what are you doing now? Oh, thanks. Dodge, and then dodge, and thanks. Dodge, another, and then quick. Okay, cool, and the what? Okay, interesting. So, gotta run in. We're close enough that hopefully we should be able to get a couple of quick hits in before more crap happens. Then we, okay, cool. Dodge, mm. okay. Then, all right, you're right here, so hit. We're not, we're not, dodge. Of course you go for multiple of those, you've got to be kidding me. Dodge, dodge, mm. Really, it's just, there's no good way for me to hit this guy now. That's the thing. And go, dodge, okay, cool. Fun attack, interesting idea, conceptually. Dodge, okay, what if I want to, oh, what? Okay, rolling for the visceral and... What, what can we... Okay, what can I... Okay, there we go, I had to be farther? Okay. Oh, excuse me, wait, what? Put on our shield and... It's... Can't see him disappear and... Oh, no, no, he's not dead? Okay. One more hit, one more hit. And stop, stop. No, we need... Is that all? Did we... It's over. Thank you. Okay, let's get that shield back on. Spears of the Church, Soul, Dark Intermediate. The craziest thing 
It wasn't that the visceral... It wasn't that the critical didn't kill. It's that it didn't kill and made him two hits away from death. Well, you know, there's nothing left to do other than fight Gale, fight Soul of Cinder, and quit ourselves of this place forever. Alright. So there's the hardest thing in the game most likely done. Thank you very much. I... I feel like kind of a dunce for trying the bow out for so long, but it almost did work. But... That was... I was dancing with the devil. That was insane. I'm glad that... Everyone could be here to see that. Uh, I guess... Endurance would be good. This will be... And the only thing left... Well, we actually have... We should talk to Shira first. We do have Church Guardian Shiv, that's funny. Oh, we don't... We haven't even done Rosaria. Rosaria's Fingers. Sea Warrior Sunlight, Spears of the Church, Spears of the Church Covenant, Young Raz, Quest of Filionor, Slumber, Trespasser, Loyal Spirits, Blessing Protection, and we could either make Old Moonlight or we could make Frayed Blade out of Meteor Soul, which is, suffice it to say, exceptionally dark. Let's take a look. Peter Medeer looks kind of like Manus's, kind of, well, Gale's looks even more like Manus's. The Sin of our Dragons, raised by the gods only to visit mortality, duty eternally, brought of the dark, forget even after the gods perished. So let's get our... at least some of our items back. We don't need a lot of items, but we should take our spell stuff at least, and then all of our other paired weapons, and frankly, I should have done this a long time ago, just gotten rid of everything I don't actually use regularly. Because now everything I have in here is stuff I actually use. Then we can take our... Don't need that. Normal Flame. I guess Priest Chum would be okay. Kaitha's... I have Crystal in there. I guess we could take a couple of staffs, even though... I never... I always end up just not using normal magic. It's just never really something that fits in my build in a good way. So what else should I take in? I guess I could get this. I think I'd have to do a lot of changing out. Right, I could be okay, but for Gale, I think. Steel protection, dark. Protection, I could probably keep silver on. That might bite me in the butt. Funny ring. Anything else? I guess relevant rings. Sage ring, and the Belling Dragon Crest. Lingering. Sage's ring is good too. These are and rank these in case we need to use another kind of buff. That's just strictly worse than what I already had. Corinth they could be okay. That might be good for that fight. Okay, so this. Then we need flame arc. Oh goodness. Carthus, flame arc. Points of that, I suppose. And other than that, yeah, we're just gonna be. Well, for now, actually, we take these back on and find Shira. But, mm hmm. Okay, there we go. That's nice. A little bit more equipment now. Go back to Ringed City Streets. I gotta figure out what's there in Shira Grave. Now that, that was actually incredible. I think, I think our Italian friend is probably asleep. She may be stirring. It's a shame she missed it, but... They're always VODs. But it is really funny that the Madeira Critical did not kill. If I had switched to Hornet Ring, it probably would have. Well, that's live. So the only thing left is going to be going back down to... Where the... No, not here. Not to Ring City Streets. Or actually, I guess we could go that way. Maybe. No. It'd still be better to go to Ring at Inner Wall. We don't have to fight as many things at once, that way. Okay. But. Max out our defense, and then we kill Gale, and then we kill well, a number of things. We should probably put our Chime on to briefly cast Tears for us. Just in case we die on the way, because that is an Ember. That is an Ember to use. Yeah. 
Drain Twin Spears did the trick. It might be slow, but it was never, I was never going to get a bunch of hits off on the deer. It doesn't give a lot of openings. And the... Huh. Oh, but I... Wait. Oh, but I'm not... Wait, am I... Oh, right, I need... The other ring. I need Knight's Ring. That's right. That's why I was... Clanging off everything. That's right. Okay, cool. There we go. Goodbye. Enjoy death. Those things are still ridiculous. Yeah, exactly, you know. I die a bunch in Ring City itself. I'm swearing and yelling. Then the bosses itself, I die to them and it's okay. It's not even as bad. That's love. So, we take you down. We just... It's crazy how much damage output that has. One, two, and... Jump and slam, and... Okay, we need a little bit more. And, oh, we need one more then. Thank you. Because I don't predict I'll be using any kind of... I'll probably actually want to use lightning. Lightning blade for Soul of Cinder, frankly. Oh, there, hello. And, oh, well, we missed that. Okay, cool. Thank you, and... Certainly took you time for that, huh? Then we spin that around, and there we go. I bet... You could make a full combo, a one hit. I mean, you could make it a one hit, one combo kill. In New Game Plus, at least, if you really juice your strength. Take a bit, though. And, okay, cool. Nice. Got them close enough to hit another. And yeah, we really made the most out of the souls we got from the deer. Thank you, and. There we go. Cool. Feels good being able to just destroy those hollow clerics. Despise those guys so much. The fact that they killed me. The two worst deaths I got in Ring City were both of these guys, which is quite frankly as hilarious as it sounds. So go over here, we take you down, and oh well, we fall. That's what happens. Alright, cool. Guess we go back up. We could try. No, because they just keep doing their evil distant heal on me. That really should be a player available ability. It's just, it's honestly really cool conceptually. Because in a certain way, it's basically the equivalent of something like a D&D harm spell. And okay, cool. Get over here, we need to plunge onto you and die, 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 and crush. Thanks. Thanks. Spin and oh, we're, we don't have enough. Dodge. And run in and it's just so much poise damage. It's way too much. Okay. Guess we could kill a couple of herald knights, depending on how long it takes. So what are you gonna give me now, Shira? Oh well. My most humble thanks. Yep. Because thanks to thee, the dragon had not from his back. Oh yeah. Please. Take this. The final gift of thanks. And what is this? Oh, a tiny nut slab. Wake not the slumbering the princess. But wake not the slumbering princess. I wonder what would happen if we went back as after Philidor. All for the sake of man. Okay. Cool, okay, thanks. And alright, one, two, three, and slam and so that one doesn't even know I'm here. That's nice. And if we got a plunge, we could literally one-tap these guys, which is crazy. Then we jump up, slam, and one more. Enjoy death. Oh, but... Oh, okay. Cool. Slam it. Oh, my goodness. I just want to kill. A couple more of these guys just for fun. Okay. Thanks. That did it. That certainly did it. Spin. Alright, and okay, cool. What end up? Alright. Thanks. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Get a couple more plunges. It... It's a shame it took so long for them to give me this ridiculous toy. Okay, and I. What? Okay. How did I. Oh, I should have gone for a plunge. I could have gone for. Could have gone for a plunge. 
That didn't kill me? Okay, cool. Alright. Interesting. So, just... Oh, what? And, of course, that killed. Thank you. Let's just go for the butt. Booty cheeks. And slam. Thank you. And there's nothing up there. I don't think. Actually, I think I went up there. That one winged knight. It's possible. Two, three, slam, and one more. It, it, it's very close. Very close to a one hit kill, but not quite. I mean, two combo kill, but not quite. Okay. Lightning gem is. Yeah, exactly. If I really wanted to, I could farm Titan from them. Just get a few more. Plunges on these imbeciles. And. You're coming through here. I see you. I hear you. When are you gonna. Oh, goodness. Alright. Mm hmm. Once you come closer, back over here, we'll get one last plunge on you. Kill a few more guys, get one last level up, I guess, before we gang all, which I guess we could maybe put in a tomb in. It's either that or lock, and presume that a tomb would actually do more for my defenses. Oh, there, hello. Then we just slam, okay, nice. Sub, and there we go. That easy. One huge plunge and they die. You know, it's still ridiculous. I'm not complaining. Okay, nothing, nothing could ever, even in theory, make that balance. And just, oh, before you kill me, I need to get out of the way of you. Be funny to die of curse right here. Not fun though. Don't want to use a purging stone and die. Okay. No, it's in the cur curse build up is gone now that that guy is dead. Okay, so... Couple more silly knights. Oh, but actually, never mind. Not actually. So we just run in, stab you, and run in, slam it. Thank you, nice. Oh, never mind. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Come on, just run in, thanks. Okay. And... After this, I suppose, we'll... Hmm. Have to lure them to a place where I can easily plunge on them. Ideally. Or I could simply just not do that and go up here and... Okay, thanks. Thanks, thanks, thanks. There's that Hall Cleric who we should take down. Oh, there, hello, and dodge, thanks. One, two. I just... They're way too good. The fact that they actually deal slash damage instead of just standard makes them even better. Okay. So it's Gale, Leonard, and I still honestly cannot believe I actually beat Medeer. I really, really... It's crazy to me, and oh, you were too far away, and all right, thanks. Okay. Great, great, get over here. Thanks to you very much, and slam down. All right, cool. One. What are we gonna do now? We just go in, slam, slam. Okay, cool. Then is this... It's almost enough for a level up. We can just... One more quick level just to make sure we get rid of all of our souls. And then we move in. Hit you. Cool. Dodge. Alright. This should be good. Alright. Now we... Oh, we need one more thing to add. Let's kill... Eh, we can just use a standard soul. Let's go back there and then go back to Philly North Church. And yeah, guess we'll get everything to 25 or higher by the end. That's cool. Was, or we could use eight fading souls. That would be fun. It's two of those. Cool. And this should basically be just enough for a level up, so let's level up. And then. 
attunement, and that, that, eight, that. It'd basically be the same thing. You know what? Why not? Let's put in a lock. Thanks. So in that case, we switch back to refined ring hammers and just go for it. Just gotta go for it. Then maybe dark, but actually a ring of favor, favor, and this is what we want to stick with. And then we can equip all sorts of armor. You know, that looks so stupid that I can't tolerate it. It's intolerably stupid. Chain legging, sure. This is... Oh, no, that's also intolerably hideous. Trousers, Mira, no. The wall. Brigand trousers, this... It's not pretty, but it'll do. We need to put our pyro flame in, and... Should have what we need to take Gale down, but... Oh, right. Once we interact with Philly and Or, we'll need to take out Shura first. You know, no reason to go down there other than the scenic nature of the place, I guess. So, we take down Gale, we do a Leonard's quest real quick. Kill Soul of Cinder, and that should be the end of the game. So, there will be a nothing down there. It'd be funny if that was an alternate way to get into Medeer's Arena. There's nothing down there. So let's just go up. Thanks. Don't need tears or anything, but there should be a bonfire or something there. Right, a little more, a little something more in shared grave too, but that can wait. So over here should be Philionor and finally the seal of time on this place will come to an end. Yeah. Being able to just trivialize those Herald Legion Knights is ridiculous. Not really, no. Not really, no. Touch the message. Oh, just that. Touch the embraced shell. This is a reference to Angel's Egg. Maybe I could just try hitting. I wonder what would happen if we attacked. One of the things is that I just might try attacking in my own New Game Plus playthrough. And yep, it shatters. What's interesting is that some people theorize that the inside of that egg, since it looks similar to the transposing kiln, might be Crystal Wizard Hide. And of course, Gwyn never came back. Dad beat Dad. And before she can say anything to us, kill us, I guess, it's time to go to the future. Future! Future! She's still praying. Presume just praying to send us away. And there we go, I'm back in. Oh, but would this be... This would be the drag heap again instead of the ring city, right? Presumably. There we go, and... Oh, goodness. It's like that meme where Spongebob gets really old really fast. Well, a nice quick one while well, the eternal worm devours Connecticut by Have a Nice Life plays. Here we are. Technically, the very end of the Dark Souls trilogy. We can see Lothric and Anorwanda over there, presumably. I believe. Some people think some of those might be Dracolaic. Let's light that bonfire, why don't we? So one of these wings is just going to be down... That's just down to Gale. I know that much at least. But the other way should be over to Shira. And then she'll try to kill us. Feeling there was rest... No, that's still Ring City, actually. Interesting. Hi, Philionor. How are you doing? Have some music. Yeah, nothing. Oh, it, it's a wall. It bounces off. So Shira will invade nearby, though I'm not sure she invades as an invader. Let's see. Oh, no, right, right at half. Fun. So down here, I believe, she should invade and get understandably angry that we killed her. Oh, no, actually. That's nothing. 
And the church is gone. Gotta go over this way, and if we go over to the right, I believe. Should encounter the Pygmy King. It won't be until we get over that way that we'll encounter Gale, I believe. The surprise final boss. I wonder who that is. Let's put him out of his misery. Sixteen souls. He respawns, I'm pretty sure, and eventually he disappears, but you can see his black blood drained. Over here on the right, I believe. Sure will invade in the ruins of something. This should be ruins of that church, which I'm not sure I'm not sure that's entirely geographically accurate. She should want to kill us for the evil we did to her charge. We're here and she'll drop the Mad King's crucifix. Uh huh. Hello. The Duke. Which Duke? Friend to Medir. Honor of the gods, glory of fire, and the fear of the dark. And you are very, very, very strong. Oh, wow. Interesting. We're gonna run out of FP. Oh, well, I interesting. And can we slow? Oh, interesting. You're very, very strong. And what are we gonna. Is that the blessing? Or uh, presumably. Oh, what? Oh. You have a lot of points using that thing. Interesting. Let's. Go over, we managed to catch you, and slam, and there we go. Cool. Interesting. Luckily, I don't think she's going to heal. If we just strafe. All we have to do is strafe. Alright. And boom, 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 slam, and. Okay, that was all we could really muster. Interesting. So. That's us up a bit, and you are, yeah, you are really tough. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, wow. Okay. Guess we should try to proc her tears again. She's certainly taking her sweet time. Thanks. Okay, cool. Thanks, and... Mm -hmm. We don't really need that, do we? So, and we got that. Got a little more of this. Thank you. Stay away before it happens and Oh thanks, Morastus. Great. And oh goodness up Alright, alright. Well that's up, I cannot afford to do that. Interesting. How many heals do you have? She might end up being more annoying than Gale. Because I can't just hmm. Whittle her down like I could with Gale. Oh, really? Okay. Oh my god. Presumably you're going to run out of FP eventually. I would like to think so. Wow. Okay. Cool, and what? What? Okay. Uh -huh. and dodge all the way that. And really? Okay. Kind of bear with it. This weapon is interesting, it's one of the few dark, few elemental weapons in the game that can actually be infused with a weapon. Because it's, it's got dark damage at base. You can actually add more dark damage to it that way. Which is cool. Dodge oh my goodness. Yeah. Harder to dodge than my way. I can strafe it, but I have to stay pretty far range, so. Just rush in and wait until she approaches us of her own accord. I think people are drilling and sawing downstairs. Wait for that, and then when you come in yourself. Thank you, and oh my goodness, thanks. Well, it still worked more or less, but the amount of. Ah, it's troublesome. Dodge. 
dodge, and then when you come in yourself, well, the chances of this not really working are actually high. I might end up dying here and having to try out. Yep, you've got lots of Estus. I don't enjoy that. Thank you. And then when you get to the range of a charge, because you actually... Hmm, interesting. So you might try using your arrow to intercept, but... Okay. Okay, then we rush in. Then we can grab you and deal a good amount of damage to you. Huh. Okay. Go ahead, go ahead. You're gonna do that again so we can rush in and spin and slam down. Oh my goodness. You are. I wonder how much S she has. Can't imagine what we're gonna do. But actually, getting out of the way of her attacks is more than vexatious. I. Okay. Frankly, I might be better off using drain hammers or something, who knows. Oh, what? Okay, I need to run. Okay. Wow, alright. I was not expecting Shira to be as violent as she was. No, never mind, I guess. There's something more frightening than... Gale, I suppose. Uh, it's... So it's not just Gale, Soul of Cinder, and Leonard's questline, it's Gale, Shira, in that questline. Okay. Hmm, alright. Big thing is, is that you can maintain a good amount of pressure, but so close. I'll try this again. I, there's a good chance I'll just go back to Soul Sword Twin Blades. Your speed would be helpful here. Lots of other things around that aren't just the Gale Arena. And I know there's another Ringed Knight around this way, so... Maybe give us something good when we hopefully kill it. Hello, Shira. Let's attack you while you're getting summoned, I guess. Over here, there you are. Hello, hello. Hi. Here we go. And slam. Oh, well, if you dodge out of the way of that, I guess I can't do much. At once, I am the honor of the gods, the glory of fire, and the fear of the Interesting. Thou shalt not go. Okay, cool. Dodge and get you out of the way and slam. And oh, that missed. Oh. It's got decent ability to. Okay, so. Just gotta go in it. out of the way of that and spin slam and just before you do any of that we need to heal. Okay, so dodge and oh, okay. Interesting. Catch on that is pretty strong. So just rush in. You don't really do a lot of rolling actually. And if we go straight back, we can just get rid of you. This is certainly something for sure, so. Yep, we can go for a bit of a trade, but we... Okay, alright. Interesting. Was that... Perseverance-like effect. Interesting halberd. Such a blade of that, too, but that might just be bone. Oh, alright, and... What? Uh-huh. Okay. Cool, I guess. That... Mm -mm. Yeah, really, I... I'm gonna have to just go back to Twin Blades. That is near certain. I just... As good as the damage the deal is, I hmm, go back. While you do that, we just finish our combo. Thanks. Cool. And what is? There we go. Follow up and sl ah, oh, never mind. Thanks. Okay. Oh great. Shoot. Go ahead. Shoot. Okay. Thank you. And just go over. Are you down and... Oh, what? Okay. You are truly obnoxious. Oh, but we... Oh, right, we didn't have enough stamina for that whole combo. And that makes the difference between life and death a lot of the time. 
And that's why that is really annoying, because just hold it. Oh, you're kidding. God damn. Yeah, I cannot afford to try that. I just need to use Drang Hammers or Twin Blades. Drang Hammers is actually probably a better combo, since she works like an NPC. Get something at basically 50% exactly. Or not. That works too. Good dark resist, so. Hmm. Alright then. Alright. Let's just put our flame mark on and try to get Shira down this way. Same way we'll fight Gale, I guess. Yeah, it. Okay, so that's very, very interesting then, because what that means is that. Specifically, the swords are good against big NPC enemies, non-human non enemies who are poise breakable. Then you just break their poise, but sometimes, you know, that doesn't happen. Sometimes you can't really do that. Since an armor's good, though. Since an armor's good. If we do it like this, we can apply pressure more adequately, and frankly, actually, the combo's cool, but we might almost certainly be better off using I've searched for the something else. Okay, cool. One, two, and slam, and yep, you can't get out of the way of that. Okay, thanks, so. One, oh, alright, and okay, cool. What? What? A true combo. Okay. Dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Do oh, goodness. Alright. I do, it does seem to me like she probably has infinite FP. Okay, roll and slam and what? Okay, alright. <clears throat> oh, you are pretty crazy, actually. So let's roll in and spin and alright. What? What? Okay. Come on, come on, alright. Thanks, let's do the same thing. Then just apply the Karthus and... Come on, okay. Run in it, slam, spin, crush, okay, cool. What I should have done was transition the running attack to a... Okay, it's really smart AI, actually. So we run in, one, two, three, and slam, okay, cool. One, okay, well that, what? Okay, one, two, and slam? Yeah, that is much, much better. But still, I, I think you, presume you only had three S's? That's what it looks like. Okay, slam, slam, one, two, three, and crush you, and... Alright, then we... One, two, three, four, and slam. How much assist do you have? You are... Okay, now you're out. That's good. Drain hammers are always good. Should always have trusted them. Two and... Okay, alright, alright, and... Oh my goodness. Come on, just... Go ahead. Go for your... Attack. One, two, three, four, and... Spin... Crush! Goodbye, Shira. Okay. Never have I ever. Forgiven will we count. Get Mad King's Crucifix then. Cool. Then there's also the other guy. Switch to. Let me see. Take that off and put on. Knight's Ring. And there should be another Ringed Knight somewhere in here, and then... Let's actually check the description of that Mad King's Crucifix real quick. Crucifix of the Mad King, Cross Spear, Malformed Corpse, Born of the Pagan Royalty, Mad King, Sure Spear, Knight of Filner, Put him to rest, Cross Spear, Couldn't kill him, Pin himself to him, To a Dark Room, St. Helmut Pulse, Strong Attack, Roar of Blessing or Vexation. Fill the Corpse. Wow. So the roar would be a big attack, 
around you, the blessing would be, I believe, that poise buff that she got before, the perseverance like buff. Vexation would be, it's that last ring nun? Vexation would be a, a big, dark, explosive projectile that follows both people. I know that the, I'm pretty sure that the ring of night shows up even before you find Gale, so I guess we can just poke around this area because it's pretty. It's very, very dry, but you see the sun. It's the very, very end of the Age of Fire. Right, right. But if I recall correctly, there's one Ringed Knight over there. I would like to fight him before fighting Gale. Which, I'm not sure if it would drop anything special. But it'd be cool to do, just, yeah, exactly. It's like checking every trash can in Pokemon, even if they, even once they stopped putting items in there. Because I guess they didn't want people poking around in trash cans. Probably smart. Let me just see real quick. City, future, map. Ring city location. Then at the end... Drag heap. Doesn't say what's in his arena. The arena. What else is in the arena? We got. Mm -hmm. Let me see. In the arena. Gale Arena. Ringed Knight. Ringed Knight. Gale Arena. Ring Knight. Ring Knight in Gale's Arena. Oh, and it drops. Filioner's Rest. Left broken structures over the hill and to the left. Drops a Titanite slab. Okay, cool. Interesting. So, just go back then. And then we'll fight Gale real quick and, yeah. We'll be chillin'. Okay. Impact. Impact. No comment. So we go to the left, we kill that one Ring Knight, then... Oh, but if I had had those souls that I spent on arrows, I would have enough to... I don't know, get one last level up before fighting Gale, but it's not like it matters at this point. We stick to the left, past there already. Stay away from Gale, go over this way. There is a lone Ring Knight wandering who drops a Titanite slab. And over there is a skills arena, and I can't get too close to him. At least until I have everything I need and want for the fight. Hello there, hi. Thank you, thank you. And oh, alright, I was not expecting that. Interesting, that is... That's a lot of poise. Okay, cool. Thanks. Spin. Slam, and... One, two. There we go. Just knock you down pretty easily, even from a distance, and cool. Nice. And we actually won the train. Lovely. And then we got Titanite Slam and two Titanite Chunks. Then we switch out to Refined Ring Hammers and put on Sunset Armor again and go back. Switch this out for Steel Protection, I guess. Yeah, cool. Then we go back real briefly, put our stuff on, and then fight Gale. Alright. Let's see if we can do this first try. I probably won't be able to. I will save this Ember as healing. And then... Karthus. Just in case. Put this shield up. Always gotta get more souls, I guess. Cool. Mm -hmm. So, and, oh, poor Pygmy's still dead, but, you know, that's life. Philinor couldn't save him, I guess. Well, that's my fault. Who's counting? And over here, we'll get close. This way, we'll be able to start it in the arena. We can follow this. Oh, we're following the Trail of Darkness. As they crawled away and tried to flee from him. And do I see anybody? I don't see anybody yet. Okay. Well, here we are. Hmm. 
Say it, Gail. Say the line. See all these pygmy corpses, and there's one of them. One remaining pygmy lord. It is interesting how you never see the pygmy lords until they're already dying. And frankly, they're not exactly small. I think they are pygmies. What? Still here? Hand it over. It feels crazy to actually be seeing this in real life. But I did see this when my friend introduced me to Dark Souls 3 by having me front his new Impulse 7 ball. Say the line. Okay, what if I don't do that? What if I don't do that? Okay, cool. Very Artorius! That was very Artorius of you. So I know we've dodged- oh, alright. Thanks. Slam it. A good amount of damage. Dodge- okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Cool, and what's this? Oh, okay. Never mind. Amber up it. Hmm. Do your big jump attack. I gotta learn what you do, I gotta learn how you fight. Okay, dodge. Ooh, ooh, I... Mm. How are you gonna do this? Jump it. Dodge. Okay, yep, the delay on that is kinda nasty. Okay, and we... Okay, we can actually poise break you somewhat well. Interesting. And I know you can be critical. Dodge. One two, three, and, okay, all right, two, and, oh, oh, dodge, dodge, oh, what, oh, we didn't die, though, that's the important thing, do I sound a little hoarse, I'll drink a bit, thanks for popping in, we are fighting the penultimate boss, well, the final boss of the DLC, who is arguably penultimate boss of the game, depending on how you interpret that, and, okay, I, Know that he's not as bad as dodge. Okay. Okay, cool. And just... Oh, interesting. So I can sometimes get two hits in, but... Dodge. Oh, my goodness. That took too long. And... Dodge. One, two, three, four. And dodge. Oh, goodness. Thank you. One, two... Oh, oh, did I... Nice. Oh, oh, I... That's just... Oh, the cue you're going for your crazy attack. Thanks. Okay, so let me dodge. Thanks. What? Okay. Interesting. I didn't know you'd do that. And am I going to get my poise break attack and dodge? Oh goodness, you are relentless. Uh, dodge. Heal. And oh my goodness. Nameless King type B. Thanks. Thanks. Dodge. Oh, please. One, two. Oh, or not. Or we just don't hit anything. Nice. I, okay. This one is not going to be it, folks. But we can try. Do oh, thanks. I did hit him. That's funny. And dodge. One, two. Oh, face transition. This. Uh, interesting. I think you might be a little slower here. So. You okay, bro? I think so. The blood of the Dark Souls. The blood of the Dark Souls 3. And you gotta wonder what happens during that fade to black. It's interesting that you don't really see his power up sequence. He just gets all. But he is hollowed now when he was not before. It means that if you want to be really fun, you can actually just hollow Slayer's Great Sword on him. I won't be, probably. Hammers are good, and I can't be shielding them. Okay, let's heal. I also need our Karthus. And actually, we could... We do have almost enough to use tears. Oh my goodness. Okay, cool. Alright, alright, and alright, cool. Thanks. Alright. And, hmm. 
That's gonna be everything in the way of our boss, which, alright. And how far are you gonna go and okay, alright. Thanks. Dodge, heal, and slam and okay, cool. And oh my goodness. Ah. This is certainly something. Uh, dodge. Want to dodge. Okay, he is a good deal slower now. It's actually very, very nice. Want to dodge. Oh, please. And I, okay. Oh, and that's how long it takes. Okay, cool. Hmm, alright. And I. Do oh, alright. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Give me. Oh, give me a critical on you, please. I one, two. You know, in terms of guts, clones, and souls, Gale is definitely one of the most gutsy. And they gave him. Okay, dodge and okay. Oh, please! I, oh, come on! And I, ooh, ooh. He, do, he doesn't go for the same crazy combos that he did previously. But now I'm almost out of normal assets, and I have no ash and assets. Okay, so that. Never mind. Hammer and dodge. Oh, okay. Do on. That was annoying to deal with. And one, two, and three, four, and oh, thanks. Okay. I should have done that earlier. Okay. And all right. Okay. This is gonna be death for me. Dodge. Fun. Fun. Okay. I just presume you should have. Oh, well, no, that's it. Interesting. So now, the difference is, he's gonna chase after me. You know, we got to phase three on our first attempt. Since he took a tiny bit of damage from the lightning. Phase three on our first attempt, that is actually pretty good. Though you have kind of seen him before. I just can't be too greedy. The nice thing is that now there's a fog wall over there and he will immediately chase us. As soon as we go through. Let's go through and... <clears throat> There is a pretty sizable bloodstain, but we'll get back there. Next part of the phase, and the nice thing is, he should actually go for that attack pretty much immediately. Oh, nice. All right, cool. One, two, or not, one, two. And dodge. Oh, great. Dodge, once you see it flash, that's when you go for counter and fall off it. Dodge, oh, no, I didn't have the right timing on that, so. Go for dodge. One, two, three, four, five, six, and dodge. Oh, what are you gonna do now? One, two. Welcome! We are fighting the final boss of the Soul series. Who is not the final boss of Dark Souls 3. Oh, cool to me? That's cool. Good choice. Oh, goodness. Uh, it will be. I'll probably be at least 30 more minutes. I think that's safe. And just, oh, okay, dodge, ooh, alright, mm -hmm. thanks, just dodge, I'm aware, I'm aware, my sole desire is to beat this, I gotta beat this today, and ooh, my, ooh, -y, ooh, and our, okay, alright, this is time to use our ember, thanks, and we, mm, we also need flame market, Dodge, okay, cool. Let's just cart this up. And thanks, dodge, dodge. Oh, I don't have enough. It takes way too long. How does how is that not dodgeable? At least not like that. Mm -hmm. And what are you gonna do now? One, two, and three, and four, and, and dodge. One, two, three, and four, and oh, all right, all right, all right. Oh, interesting. I do oh, come on! It, I feel like using something like Sun Princess Ring might actually be better because it, it's healing that doesn't rely on being able to use Asus. So that's an attack we should try to punish. And oh my goodness, I, okay. Two and what? What? Oh, one, two, three, and four. Dodge. Okay, so you can. I kind of need to be panic rolling that. Hmm. Just what? Dodge, dodge, hammer, dodge. Okay, thanks. One, 
That's finally a phase transition. I am... Oh my goodness. But... At least my blood stains around here. Cool. You Are you gonna start using your crossbow soon? Well, first you gotta get two of me. Oh, okay, alright. One, two, three. So you're slower in this form, which is good for me. But it also... Oh, alright, alright. And... Dark damage, if I recall correctly. One, two, and only get so many attacks off on you at once before we. Oh goodness, that. All right, and uh, dodge. One, two. Interesting. Can we dodge? Thanks. Dodge and do Oh, all right. I thought I was out of the way of that, but I guess not. One, two, and stay out of the way of you while you wait for those. Let's come back to you. so if we dodge. Okay, one, two, three, four, and dodge out of the way of that. And thanks. Let's not get hit by your ribbon. Dodge. One, two. Okay, all right. And what if we? Oh, all right. And ooh, interesting. Hmm. And just dodge, dodge. Okay, dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, what? Huh? Thought I would have gone out of the way of that. Dodge. Oh well. I, all right. Dodge, oh, please, and, oh, what? All right, interesting, that, that's tough. Dodge, okay, one, two, three, four, and, come on, what are you doing now? Thanks, thanks, and, okay. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, cool. One, two, three, four, and, dodge, dodge, and, oh, interesting, dodge. Okay, what, okay, what? Oh, wow, that is one ludicrous combo. Okay, interesting. I, uh, I should try my best to try to. Interesting and dodge. Okay, do that and stay out of the way of you as much as possible and uh, dodge. Heal, heal. And just gotta dodge. Okay, dodge. Okay, all right. What? Huh? Okay. And really, really okay. Weird. Okay, and just come on. What is... Uh, what attacks can actually reliably punish, if any? Dodge... Okay, thanks. Alright. Come on, I... Oh, please. I... Alright, and... D okay. You know, that's a funny way to die. Getting hit by that. Okay. Big thing is... There are... Aside from this guy, the only boss left is the final boss. And, oh, if I gotta use that amber, this better be the one that quenches it. Hmm. Soul of Cinder, in comparison, will most likely be kind of a joke. Given that, or I could, if this doesn't work, I'm gonna do a really funny strategy. I'm just gonna spam Chaos Bed messages at him. It's getting in close is really annoying. He's actually a lot like Dragon Slayer armor. To be honest. Dodge. Okay. In the sense that... He might be fast and decently good at closing gaps, but... In terms of actual melee, I mean actual range options, he's pretty limited. Okay. Come on, come on. Go for it. Go for it. And just... Dodge. Okay, there we go. One, two, three, four, and... Pa. Alright. Hmm. Doing okay for ourselves. We gotta take this slow and methodical as he is. Really annoying in phase one. Might deal with some damage, but he's... Smarter. He's not hollowed. More human. One, two, three, four, and... Okay, dodge. Hmm. Just can't overextend myself in terms of stamina. And dodge! Okay, cool. One, two, three, four, five, six, and... Oh, well, all right. Thanks. Okay, and then we gotta stay out of the way, and... Can I amber up? Thanks. Let's tap that, and... One, two, three, four, and... Dodge! Okay, that's how we need to do that. And, okay, we messed that up. Buffered the input way too much. Okay, cool, and just... Oh, not like that, not like that. Stupid, stupid. And uh, what? How did- I, I just couldn't switch while he was... Right, you can't buffer a switch while rolling. 
for whatever reason. Okay, and then just dodge all- okay. Thanks. Okay. But- oh right, we have the shield up for some stupid reason. Pull towards, and then we can take you down. Just dodge- oh, not the ways. Obnoxious, and- One, two, and- Alright, roll, 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 and- Dodge- oh, thanks, but- Mechanic rolled four times, but after that he- Come on. I use too much S's for phase one, so dodge it. Okay, thanks. One, two, and dodge, dodge. He's got to learn his timing his tells. And, oh, thanks. Dodge, dodge. Oh, please. One, two, three, four. Oh, what? Excuse me? Dodge. One, two, three, four, and there we go. Phase transition, and we have most of our stuff left, but it's still going to be painful. I just can't go too heavy against you. One, two, and he only does that big pull-out attack if you're close to him, so I can't actually use that as a punish opportunity, most likely. One, two, and okay, cool. That is an opportunity for second attack if I'm very, very fast with it, but I have to be fast with it. Well, I'm all right, and it's dodge. One, two, three, and, well, or to heal, or something. Okay, so one, two, three, and dodge. Oh, what? All right, and heal, heal. We need more Karthus Flame Mark. We need more Karthus. So before you, not all that fast, which is good, so dodge. And what are you going to do next? Okay, dodge. Okay. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Mm. It's basically just stamina depletion. One, two, three, and you can't do that if you're too close, which is annoying, and then you can... A couple more, and do Oh, well, no, no, never mind. Annoying. Okay, so just dodge all the way to that, and... Oh, come on, you... One, two, three, and dodge! Okay, cool. What if we... Oh, no, 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 all right. Yeah, I am... I'm trying. Believe me, I... Ah, uh, no! It's just painful. Okay. Just, oh, and of course use that as an Estus Punish now. Dodge. One, two, and... Thanks. Okay. Then we can... I guess... No, no, the rays are not what I want to do. And a couple more. And dodge. Okay. Dodge. Oh, well, all right. Very anime of you. Okay, and when are we going to get an actual... Oh, thanks. And dodge! Thank you. Ah. Uh, we're in trouble now, Toto. Uh, what if we heal in this? Karthus. Dodge! We need to... Uh. Okay, thanks. And what are you going to follow up with, if anything? Dodge! Oh, it is! It's great! Dark Souls 3 is almost, without question, the start of Souls getting really anime, which is peak, which is why it's so good, but also, what, okay. So that is, thank you for doing your funny Artorias slip on me now, and what, what, okay, oh, alright, dodge, and I guess the only thing we can punish is, if you do at least two attacks in a row, wait, what, huh, huh, excuse me, what, okay, what, alright. And can we... Did, what? Okay. Thanks, thanks. Wow. Okay. I... Yeah. Maybe I'll just... Stay out of the way of you. And then just... Oh, goodness. Not that, not that. World Sword. Bonfire, what's the rest of that? Oh, no! Go to hell! Okay. Well... Mm, yeah, I... I am going to have to go and get a few Ashen Flasks, but I am literally just going to spam Chaos Bed Vestiges against him until he stops moving. That's what I gotta do. Hmm. I think 11 and 4 should be safe. Also, with other hammers, we can equip more Guard equipment, which would be nice. Have your sunset, sunset, with sunset be. Sunset's hideous, though. 
This would be funny. Where is own stuff? Alva and give our Katarina invented something slightly lighter. Let's see. I've eaten today. I will make myself more food after this. I have some stuff ready for me. I appreciate the concern though, Alva. I actually a weapon. The big thing is that Gil doesn't dodge. Not Estes. This should be more than enough. We have our... Oh, interesting. We got that there. Then we need two tiers. But actually, if if we're just going full pyromancy, suppose it would be Sage's Ring. And Fire Clutch would be a fun idea, except for the fact that we probably can't afford to be taking all that much damage from him. So let's actually see what puts us right underneath. Well, where is Owen Hood? There we go. Go back, we gotta switch out to our tune. Shout to Chaos Bed Vestiges, which is... There we go, we have basically just the right amount of stuff. Fionor's Rest, which is right by Church of Fionor, basically. So he's weak enough to fire that we can just hopefully spam him with pyromancies. Yeah. I appreciate that. I... I am well aware that it is not a good idea to be doing what I'm doing, but I am not entirely... I'm a little crazy right now. Gotta beat DS3, move on to Sekiro, and then beat... Thank you, nice, and... Oh, interesting. That's... Good damage, and we can just mm, avoid having to deal with a lot of this crap this way. Oh, but oh, I need a lot more in the way of. Ha. Huh. Dodge. Interesting. I. Damage is good, but I might not have enough. Might need a lot more Ash and Flass. I'm already. Oh, right, because I don't have it equipped. That's right. Okay, cool. I I would need to go all Ash and Flask, and then just almost all Ash and Flask, and then just focus on dodging and nothing else, which is very much an option, but I... Thanks. Okay. Cool. One, two... I need to get my... Uh, thanks. The hammers are good. They got better. The main thing is... Uh, it's a long enough fight that... If I don't have a lot of stuff, I can just... I'll run out of various resources. It's a resource management puzzle more than anything else. And yeah, we ran out of that, because of course we did. So that big old bloodstain's gone. I, uh, I'm going to try this again with a large amount of Ashen Vials and try to get a bit more cautious what I do. The big thing is that I think 2 and 13 would be enough. But I am going insane. I am going absolutely insane. It's just this guy, then I take down this one more thing in Sure Crave, and then it's Soul of Cinder, and that's the end of the game. It's a lot of Estes and... Oh my goodness. 3 and 12 should be enough, hopefully, but we'll see. The big thing is that I was being too too aggressive. Because of that, he was hitting me, or more accurately, I wasn't able to hit him when he went for his jump attack. He came down, plunged on me, and hit me. So I was messing some things up. Okay. Let's take that and get our funny chaos bed messages up. And this thing has... It might consume a lot, but it does a lot of damage. It's got a very good focus point to damage ratio. Yeah, we can kill Gale, hopefully. We got pretty close last time. It's just phase, phase three onward, it became really, really hard to do anything to him. We actually had more than enough time. Well, what are you going to do? One, two ends. All right. That, hmm, dodge. Those are attacks that are good to punish. 
Let's read those a big plunge. And thank you. All right. Let's just get that up. And it doesn't seem to counter Ash and Estes in the same way as it does normal Estes. So, or I guess maybe he doesn't really punish either. But well. And all right. So all we have to do is move out of the way of that, actually. Come on, come on, and one. Just gotta see what we can actually do. I see you moving. We can't be too silly with it. Thanks. Another boom, another big boom, and... Okay, cool. Nice. That was a good hit. And out of the way, and one more. This is curious. I... Mm -hmm. And being able to avoid... Uh, staying away from him makes most of his attacks a lot more dodgeable, but it's not an exact science. I... Okay. And I need stamina. One, two, three, four, and dodge. Okay, cool. And he should be close to his face transition, which is nice. Dodge and slam and they were close. One more and oh my goodness, I I was stupid with that. Okay, all right, is this it? And there we go, face transition. This is an interesting idea, and I think it has a good chance of working, especially since this thing is. Okay, I need to take advantage of just how ridiculous the range on this is. And also, I could I might want to use Dust Crown Ring actually. Dodge. Oh, please. I, hmm. Big issue is that dodging toward instead of away is a total order right now. Dodge, dodge. Corona is. Oh, wow. Where are they then? Where are the Coronas? And. Okay. Thanks. Alright. And boom. Ah. Uh, need to be very cautious about this and good at. Okay, well, you know. This is a little cheesy, but you know, if it works, it works. Okay, so as long as I'm not stupid in the earlier phases, this is definitely how I'd like to do this. And one, dodge! Okay, thanks. One, and... Oh, so we'd be able to hit you during your next phase transition too now, so that's really good. So one, two, and three. Okay, what? Oh, all right. Thanks. Hmm... Interesting. And just dodge. Oh, thanks. But I... This is very, very useful. Very, very good idea. Dodge. Okay. But... I just want it. Dodge, dodge. Dodge. Okay. Thanks. Cool. Toss and... Maybe if I had a bit more. Okay. That's the thing, is that with... How many flasks do I have? I've got... 12. And I'd use 5. I could try maybe putting a few more in. But I think, actually, it'd have a lot more Estus if I... use Dust Crown Ring. Let's see how much it increases FP consumption, because this is not all that special. Let's take our Dust Crown Ring back out of storage. Storage box, and let's get our Dust Crown Ring. What did I just put in? That might not have been a good thing. Uh, let's see. Clutch ends. We have what we need, mostly. Just want to see how much Dust Crown Ring decreases spell cost casts, as it would slightly decrease HP. And that... Let me see what Dust Crown Ring does. Dust Crown Ring. And that consumption, uh, 25%, should be quite useful. Let's try this one more time. Decrease our max HP, but we didn't have any flasks to begin with. If we... I think eight. Maybe seven, actually. Seven Ashen Flasks would be more than enough now. That would be 
fine. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. Let's get you in position. And just see if we can toss and... Did that hit Kanda? And just dodge. We kind of whipped with a couple of them. That's fine. And once we see fast movement, we need to be smart about things. And uh, this is good, but I'm uh, all right. Mm -hmm. Phase two is going to be a struggle, though. And phase three is going to be a struggle. That said, he uh, he moves a bit slow in phase in the other phase. So if I'm smart about it, it should be horrible. And let's just do that. And come on. Uh, harder to stay away from him. Two, three, and dodge. And I think maybe he moves a little closer. Maybe, possibly. I right. dodge. And, all right. Toss. What am I gonna do? Toss and okay. That did not really hit all that well. Then can we go him? Oh, of course, of course, of course. Come on, come on, and just boom it. That hit at least. Let's just dodge it. Okay, dodge it. Dodge. Okay. Thanks. Alright. We're actually moving closer to the actual arena. That's funny. And just dodge. Okay, cool. Boom. Alright, and. That might actually be an okay idea for a follow up timing. When you get a very slight boys rank. After all, he. It's a bit. What? That hit? Okay, never mind. I. I figure that rolling away actually works better when you're doing it like this, and it usually does, but I mean, it's got to see how much normal S's I end up spending as compared to action S's like this, and I, this is actually really, really troublesome. Okay. Uh-huh. Teal. Then toss another S's at you, and okay, alright, and come on. Let's just kill you, and another is needed, and... Here we go, face transition. And... Okay, we had... We can afford a few more flasks. It's not so we don't just get out of these. But I... Uh, uh, so that is behind over there, and I... Oh, please, that... Alright. Alright, then. Dodge. This is actually a pretty decent place to fight him. Dodge. That's fair, but I think I'm just going to switch back to more because I don't need as much Ash and Estus. actually don't need all that much. And he killed us with the Way of Light Corona. What an embarrassing way to die. Okay. I think I could go 7 and 8. Because I don't need that much Ash and Estus for this. 7 and 8. That said, I... I'm going to try this one more time, and if it doesn't work, I'm going to go back to the hammers. Because the hammers were really good, it was just, I didn't know his moveset as much. And the nice thing about dealing with him this way is, I get a lot of time to just study his moveset. Let's go for eight, seven, I hope this works. Might. And the thing about having less HP is it also means that an Estus is closer to a full gear. So. Go back over there, and yeah, we can't... Pontiff's Eye would not do all that well in this fight, because he's not exactly a boss that lets you wail on him. Okay. Let's get our tears up. Thank you. And... Cool, okay, I'll spend messages. Take someone out. And we'll be chilling. Okay. Save night, Gale. We're up over here. We got our stuff going. Bit of boost to our pyro, bit of boost to our casting speed. That said, we might actually want. Uh, we'll be okay. Another ring to juice our power, but no, we need everything into just survivability. And cool. Counter that with immediate fire. Then, what are you gonna do? We dodge! Uh, can we. Good. Pretty good. What are you doing now? You'll dodge. 
God. Mm -hmm. Thank you, and... Alright, and... Let's go for another, actually. That attack is actually very, very counterable. Dodge, and... We need real aggression, and when he does his... Way of White Corona attack, we need to be better at getting out of its way. Okay, cool, and just boom. Dodge, and... Oh, what? Okay, cool, I guess. Thanks, thanks, and... Alright. Okay, cool. Got a bit more of that, though. Yeah, the nice thing is that now... Dodge and... Mm. Okay. One S, this is basically a full heal. And... Because we don't have as much health. And just dodge... Dodge... Oh, please. Alright. Weird angle to be in. Thanks. Alright, and... What if you... What if we went for another end? Just dodge... Dodge... Oh, alright, and... Okay. Dodge. Cool. And another, another, and just... Do oh, well, that was very badly calculated. Okay. It's an exceptional miscalculation. You know... If I wasn't as stupid... The big thing is... I got way too greedy. I went for two Chaos Bed Vestiges in a row, and I went for Chaos Bed Vestiges when I couldn't afford to. I will say, though, that even though I've already got 25 decks, and the soft cap for the effect of Dexterity or Virtual Dexterity, if you're including stuff like Sage Ring, on casting speed is at 50. Sage Ring is plus 30. Still, so every little bit helps. Actually, you know what? Let's try that. If we're only going for one, every little bit of power increase helps. That said, in that case, I might actually like Dark Clutch Ring instead. Then that, that is a meaningful damage increase. Just, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? But we have Dust Crown and, okay, interesting. Okay, uh, all right. Huh, it's an idea. And toss. Every little bit of damage means every little bit counts every bit more. Dodge and toss. What if I, what if I, and, oh, never mind. Thank you, cool. Feel like that. There we go, and dodge. Mm, thanks for trying to close the gap, I guess. Dodge. Mm. Go for a jump attack or something else that is more preeminently punishable. And, huh. Maybe if you get stuck, we go for multiple, but... Unless you... And you didn't stagger, which means... Guess that's decent opportunity to use another, but... Okay. And one more, one more, and... Boom. Oh, that... It only grazed you. Fun. And just... One, two, and just... Dodge, thanks. And... Dodge... Dodge. Oh, wow. Okay. I was not expecting that attack. What? Okay. Never mind. I... Okay. Mm -hmm. it's just, so much... Faster in this phase. I... Mm -hmm. I... It's interesting. I... Okay. Right and... Dodge and... Okay. Should be close. Close to the phase transition. Said I should probably cast Tears of Denial sometime soon. Go for it and jump it. Okay, right, one, two, three, four, and a big jump attack, which gets closer than the others usually do. Then we could. Mm, tears would be a fun idea, but. Uh, uh, and. Okay, that's gone. Okay, cool. Mm. And just. Out of the way of that ends. Come on, come on. That That's why being in range is so annoying. Being at range. Is that is quite frankly a pretty ridiculous attack. Dodge. Okay. And well, oh, alright. Okay. Hmm. Definitely how I want to do this, I just can't get greedy. Then of course your way of white groaning this and Come on, just dodge, dodge it. Oh, come on. I... Alright, thanks. Dodge it. Kill, kill. Come on. Toss. 
then toss it. Okay. Oh, thanks. All right, and dodge it. Estes. Huh? Toss it. Dodge. Dodge. Toss again and dodge. Mm, and of course you're doing that. Thank you. And just dodge. Okay, another one, I suppose. Dodge. Okay, cool. Uh -huh. Just. Oh, thank you, thank you. And go for a couple on you while that goes on. Great, great, okay. Cool. And. One more, and just. Dodge. Oh, alright, thanks. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. I. It's a fun idea. But he just he just gets too aggressive in that phase. I You know, I hate to say it, but it's gonna be hammers again. I don't hate to say it, but it's a little saddening. I would have thought I would have had something a little more fancy by now. <laughs> Frankly, I should probably at this point switch my rings favor and then in favor of this maybe pontify that's right over there so that could help out just for a bit of extra damage but we need a lot more flasks we need every last flask to make it count so we are gonna go back let's go all orange aid and then kill him okay this yeah exactly he's just way too much of a gap closer and you can kind of use the seats, but it's an interestingly, interestingly treacherous, treacherous might not be the right word, interestingly sloping arena for a boss. And it is very interesting that you have access to almost his entire arena before you actually get the boss fight, and then the fog wall actually locks it all off. I guess the question is... Would Phil, would Shira, what would happen to Shira if... Shira if Gale showed up? I didn't try that. Maybe I should have. Get our Karthus up. Karthus Beacon is a fun idea, but it lasts way too short. That's for 30 seconds, that's basically no time. And I'm, I'm not using Lingering Ring for this fight. Let's just traverse the fog. Maybe this way, see if we can take you down. Once we do this, there is one more little treasure. One fight against someone else. Come on. Dodge! One, two, three, four, and... Dodge! Oh, all right, and what? Okay. Interesting. Just dodge, dodge, okay. Dodge, okay, cool. One, two, three... Oh, what? Wow! Okay. Uh, all right. One, two, three, four, and that's the only one I can really count on doing that for. Uh, this is faster, but also slower. I uh, one, two, three, four, and dodge. Okay, one, two, and dodge. Okay, and just dodge. I believe you. And thanks, temper Estes. And oh my, oh wrong, wrong. Uh, Let's dodge. Getting confused on how I do this. Two and yeah, Pontiff is not probably the way to go here. I, at least not in phase one. I okay. Slam it. Slam. Okay. Cool. Dodge. All right. And come on. Okay. Top. Top. And really, really. Okay. One, two, three. Really. Okay. I. The big thing is. Pontiff Ring will not help me here. Simply will not help me here. Dodge. Yeah. Because in order to keep it up, I need to go for a bunch of attacks on him, and he is not going to give me that kind of opportunity. Twice of that, I should probably take. What should I take? Poise won't do much. I guess I could do Dark. We can do Dark Stone Point. That should be more than enough. Second phase is dark attacks become... Well, the dark follow-ups on his attacks become very hard to dodge and very threatening. 
So either if you do, either you have to dodge a dangerous and complete for everything more or less, or you have to you know tank the hit. And frankly, I'm going to tank the hit. I would rather definitely get hit by the dark fall up than maybe get hit by everything else. Okay, and just dodge. Oh, thanks. Running attacks annoying. Come on, come on. Jump and slam. And, okay. One, two, and dodge. Thanks. Dodge. Oh, wow. Okay. Huh. And really, really, and what in the... Okay. Dodge. One, two, three, four. That is the only time I can get relatively safe double hits. Dodge. Dodge. Just, what can we... Thanks. Dodge. Uh, dodge. Thanks. Uh, dodge. Dodge. And what are you doing next? Dodge. Okay, all right. Dodge. Okay, cool. One, two. Thank you. Bit of breathing room. So that is not... The big thing is I need to dodge to the side when he does that. Come on. I dodge. Slam. And dodge. Slam. Oh! Comes out so fast. I, okay. Huh. It's an interesting prospect. The fact that our Estus is incredibly devalued now is not a great prospect. And one, two, thanks. And can we... What about... Okay, cool. Big thing is, is... I know he can be critical, but I'm not good at parrying, and I'm not going to... I'm not going to learn parrying in an hour. Oh, please, you've got to be kidding me. Okay. But, if I want to be really funny, I could try Hammers in second phase, Pyromancy's in first, but the ring switch, even though he starts far away from me, it would just be way too demanding. This is just so relentless. It has so many attacks, it's a lot different from Madeira. I think he might be harder than Madeira for me. Depends. Dodge. Okay. Slam and... That did not hit. Dodge. Okay. Thanks. What? Okay. Thanks. Dodge. Oh, please. Alright. And... Dodge. Okay. Cool. One, two. One, three, four. And dodge. D oh, and of course he went for that overhead jump. That was a really annoying attack. Awful. And dodge. Okay, cool. Thanks. And... Oh, thanks. One, two, three, four, and... Overhead, and... One, two, three, four, five, six, and... There we go. So actually, you can be always broken at times, but it's not the kind of thing I could really should try relying on. Just... You go for a really, really good, strong... One of those attacks, and I just want to, and oh goodness, I. Oh, uh, oh. Uh, come on, hi. Let's dodge it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Time for more phases, hopefully, and. Do it. Oh, I. Alright. Alright, and. I'm just getting way too greedy. The only attack I can ever theoretically get multiple hits on is. He does a big overhead slam. Everything else, content myself with slight. Ship damage. Everything else is just not where I want to go. One, two, three, four, and slam, and there we go. Okay, cool. We're doing all right, but not amazing. Still have most of our S's left. Well, more than most. Okay, and slam, slam, and dodge. Okay, all right, and hmm. dodge, slam over there, and that's punishable. Alright, and they'll come back this way, which is fun. Mm -hmm. That, get yeah, this. As long as I'm not dumb about this, I can make this phase work better for me. I just need to know where to dodge. Oh, well, alright, thanks. Cool, and... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my beeswax. Dodge it. Okay. Please, just dodge it. Dodge! Oh, wow, alright. That was... You were closer than I expected. That was the thing. And dodge, dodge. 
Just dodge, dodge, dodge. Thanks. I I did okay for myself. It, oh, I was not expecting that to come back and bite me like it did. Okay. We're trying. Dodge. Okay. One, two, three, four, and... Thanks, Frost. I... I'm getting way too greedy, but... Dodge, dodge, dodge. Dodge. Slam. Take that out, and... Okay, heal. Probably put the carpus back on, and... Okay, cool. So then we... Alright, and... Alright, then. Let's... Dodge. Dodge. Okay. So you're gonna do more follow-ups to attacks now, which is... Interesting news for me. Big race attack, which I don't enjoy. And, okay, interesting. So dodge left of that, and dodge overhead, and slam, and... Okay, thanks. Oh, interesting. That didn't hit. Okay. Dodge. Just one, two. Dodge. Oh, all right. Dodge overhead. Hopefully, I cannot promise anything. And dodge. Okay. Dodge. Okay, all right. And, oh, please. Okay. Come on. Come on. And heal. Heal. Let's dodge. Okay. Slam it. Dodge. Oh, well, all right. Oh, come on. Hmm. I... Dodge. What is my... Okay. And, okay, interesting. I'm getting close. As long as I don't get too greedy, I should be able to do this. So, I... Uh, Alright. Mm -hmm. Seem to know for sure when he actually ends a combo, and then... That's easier said than done. And I, dodge. Dodge. Oh, please. One, two, and... What are you doing now? Thanks, and... Wraith attack. Cool. What if I... On it. Run in, don't even hit anybody, I guess. But dodge, dodge, okay. Okay, the big thing is I need to, how am I gonna, what is, okay. Dodge, okay, all right, and dodge, okay, cool. What if I hit you and I, oh, the lightning killed me. Wow. The big thing is that I need to dodge into his attack instead of dodging away from his attack. Because that was what was leading me to get caught by... Oh. That was what was leading me to get caught. Well caught. Which is... Can I not rest? No, I could, but... I thought for a second that someone invaded me. I don't even have an ember up. Okay, cool. Let's do that over there, and this... Okay. Come on, come on. I'm trying. I'm trying my best. Please. Okay, now we know, just don't get greedy. Do not get greedy, never, ever, except for a big vertical plunge, go for two hits. Any other time, you only go for one hit, no matter how fun it might be to try to go for more. Or how tempting it might be to go for more. You just simply cannot guarantee survival if you do. Ever slam and just dodge, dodge. Okay, what are you gonna go for? Very safe opportunities like that. That's good. And see, we didn't have the time we wanted, but okay, cool. And do oh, all right, and ah. Oh. So you need to instinctually dodge when he goes for that overhead. Dodge. Okay, thanks. I just can't dodge. Uh, thanks. Two and dodge. Oh, cool. And we dodge, 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 dodge. Then the overhead, which we go for a couple on. Thanks. Dodge, dodge. Okay. On two and all right and dodge. Oh, wow. All right. Mm -hmm. Dodge. Okay, a couple. Just a couple, and a couple more, and... Dodge! Okay, dodge. And what if I... Slam it. Hammer. Dodge. One, two. I guess we're very close to the phase transition, but I can't. Four to be greedy. Two, three, four, and then go. Sword blow, and then one, two, three, four, and... Almost. Almost. We... Just... The more S's we have, we can... One more, and... There we go, that worked. Let's carve this up real quick and... 
I... I need to save that little bit for later on. It just dodge, dodge, dodge. Thanks, thanks. Okay, cool. Oh, wow, okay. I didn't think you were going to do that attack, actually. Never mind. I, okay. Just dodge, slam it, dodge. Oh, well, I, mm, I need to dodge to the side of that. I really do. It. No, no, I... Mm, I messed that up so much. I, okay. Dodge. Okay. So, what? Okay, that kind of works. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I need to, needed to, needed to. Dodge. Okay, cool. And out of the way of that. And. Alright. One, two, and. Mm -hmm. Doing okay for ourselves, but still having some issues here. Just. Dodge. Slam it. Uh, one, two, three, and. Dodge. And we can't. Oh, please. Oh, well, that's interesting. Seems stream up has run out of system space to record. That's how long this has gone. Okay. Come on. That really tells you something. Dodge it. Okay, please. I oh my goodness. I alright. Alright then. Okay, cool. One, two, and dodge. 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 Okay, thanks. Alright. Tears. I need my tears up. Dodge. Okay. Slash it. Okay. Well, I did not mean to do that. Did not mean to do it like that. Okay. So I. Mm, mm, I all right. All right. And. Mm. Come on it. Dodge. Slam it. Dodge it. Okay. Thanks, I guess. Ah. Oh, thanks. Is everything still working stream wise? I mean, I'll just re download my own VOD later from YouTube or something. And Twitch. I need to. Uh, Dodge and oh, I need to oh please all right and okay okay good that's the important thing slam that down and one two and just dodge okay good that's the important thing and just there you go and we need to get out of the way of that and mark this up and time for final phase really really what in the god hand stupid. What that means is that I really, really need to focus on getting rid of clips. I mean, getting rid of old VODs here. Clips, if I haven't... Okay. Let me see something. Let me see. Temporarily available, but... Yep, it stopped. My goodness. Yep, guess who's running out of system space. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh... This is going to take more later. Okay. Frankly, I should just delete some of the crappier VODs and just... I mean... But... I just really need to catch up on my damn clips. Okay. Oh, there, hello. Come on. It's not expecting things to take this long. And just... Dodge... Hmm... Come on. Go at me, go at me, jump at me. Dodge, dodge, okay. One, two, and dodge, dodge, okay. And glow. One, two, three, four, and there we are. We can dodge. One, two, I guess. Those attacks are lengthy enough that we can, at times, try to get a, another hit in. One, two, that is not... It was not... Okay. Okay. Took my hand off the controller. That was stupid. And just... Glow. One, two, three, four. And dodge. Okay. Slam and... Alright. And... One, two, three, four, and... Glow. One, two, three, four. But we didn't hit because of the terrain. That was really weird. Okay. Slam and just... The... The less risky we take this, the better. The higher chance we have of not dying. And dodge, and we, there we are, and oh my goodness, I, okay. Come on, we need a little bit more. Stamina's running out, and oh my goodness, I, okay. One, two, and all right, what if I 
to and slam S. There we go. And we haven't used any Estus yet, which means we're in a decent position. Just got it. One, two, three. Stay decently far away. And just... Oh, well, all right. I... Well, interesting. I wasn't expecting that. I... And just... Do... Oh, wow. Okay. I... Weird. Stupid. Annoying. I... Okay. We need that. We need that now. Dodge it. Okay. Yes! They are. He's got projectiles. Because of course he does. Just... And dodge it. One, two, and dodge it. Slam it. Mm -hmm. Dodge it. Slam over there, and just... What are you going to do now? One, two, three. Go on the other side of that, and dodge it. Okay. Got a bit of a hit in. Just go for something and dodge it. Okay, cool. Just got it. Okay, please. Uh, all right, and what? Huh? Okay. Weird. Take this slow and steady. And try not to... Oh, thanks. All right. Thanks. And Billy. Billy. Dodge. Okay. I'm on to it. Mm -hmm. Dodge. Okay. Slam and just... Oh, you're out of the way of that and dodge out of the way of that. Thank you. Dodge the right way and... Okay. Dodge. Okay, thanks. One, two, and... Okay, luckily we can stun you long enough to get rid of some of that crap, so... Okay, we, we stayed out of the way. That's good. And... One, two, and... So if we hit you, we can guarantee that. Frankly, that, that attack looks more than meaningfully reminiscent of Executioner's... The Executioner's stuff. Dark and Bloodborne, which... Okay, cool. Alright, and... Okay, cool. Come on, and I... Dodge, okay, oh, right, and, come on, what, what, okay, what, interesting, interesting, I, okay, lightning, lightning, and, oh, come on, I, all right, just dodge, slam it, dodge, what, okay, please, I, you're a lunatic, when can I guarantee a, dodge, uh, dodge, what are you gonna, so two is usually safe, but it, Dodge, uh, dodge, okay, one, two, you go for three, it's definitely safe, but the fact that you just go for more and more fall-ups to all your attacks is very annoying. We have a decent amount of Estus because we've been playing the safe, I, dodge, okay, that is actually a decent attack to try to counter, so I, mm, just dodge, dodge, okay, dodge, okay. One, two, I, I dodge. What am I gonna dodge? Dodge, okay. And dodge, thanks. Still hit, just good. One, and, oh. Just dodge, oh please, and I, what? And of course, no more Karthus. I, all right. We are kinda, it's just pure hammers at this point. Dodge, oh please. Come on, dodge. Thank you, and one, two, and dodge, and all right, and one, two, and dodge, and thank you, thank you, and oh, what, I, all right, I couldn't see you, what, always, always, okay, dodge, oh, what, ah, oh. timing on that was awful, okay, and dodge, dodge, what more, and dodge, 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 oh, please, I'm... What? And that killed me because of the follow-up? It's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Oh. I... Honestly... Even though... Cellsword Twin Blades are faster. I can equip a bit more armor this way. This is gonna suck, but... It might be what I have to do. Get more attacks off, get more everything off. This is literally my final appeal. If Cell Swords can't make it happen, literally nothing can. Because he is, well, he's not that much weaker to sl strength than other physical damage types. But he does kind of resist Slash. It's whatever. Come on.
Come on, get over here. Dodge it. One, two, and just dodge it. Dodge it. Okay, yeah, this dodge. Do oh, well, all right. I, never mind. By that, but I dodge. One, two, three, and dodge. One, two, and dodge. Okay, this. I'm still getting too greedy, but this is much faster. Which does mean more DPS for the sake of bursting this guy down before more garbage happens. Dodge. One, two, three, and thank you. Very, very good. Okay. So if you go for big attack that we can really punish, we can get, hopefully, we can get a couple attacks off of it pretty much no matter what, but... And just dodge. One, two, three, and four, and... Okay, all right, and... Okay. <laughs> Doing really good damage, but we are getting the leader, and that is not a good sign. Okay, well, all right, and... Mm, dodge. Dodge. Okay. One, two, and... Wow, there we go. Now, that is definitely what I want to be using. The speed on it is just very, very crucial, and dodge, okay, dodge, okay, one, two, and, okay, one, oh, all right, and this that doesn't deal much damage, but still, one, two, three, dodge, dodge, okay, what if I, one, one, two, and dodge, okay, thanks, dodge, okay, now this is much, much better, it's not even close, dodge, dodge, okay, thanks, one, two, and three. Okay, dodge. Thanks. Mm. Dodge. Okay. One, two, three, four. Wow. Now that is much, much better. It's honestly kind of stupid. And okay, and let's dodge out of the way of that. And we should have gone to the other side, but that's all. Okay. I gotta say, as fun as. The wind blades are. It's kind of crazy how strong they can be at times. One, two, three. So three is definitely very doable. One, dodge. Okay. Yeah, because we can try to wink and attack it, even if he tries to follow up. So dodge. Okay. Dodge. Okay. Cool. Thanks. And just dodge. Okay. All right. And one and and just. Dodge. Dodge. Okay. Dodge, thanks. And, okay. One, two, three, and... Do oh, all right. And, of course, the... That got me. Stupid. Oh, thanks. Oh, we're doing okay. Dodge. It. Slash. It. Oh, okay. And dodge. It. Okay, all right. And... One, two, and... Mm, okay. Cool. This is sloppier, but we can just afford to be sloppier because our weapon's better. Very least it's faster. Dodge mm. and dodge and mm. too far away. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, all right. And dodge and okay, thanks. One, two, and dodge. Okay, all right. And dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, heal, heal, and heal. We need tears back, but okay. Let's go for that. And what am I? What? I couldn't switch. Okay. But we already did so much better than we did last time. That's ridiculous. Okay, so... No use fighting him with literally anything else. I try so many things and it literally always returns to... Karthus... Flame Mark buffed, self sword Wind Blades. I... Okay! Alright! I get it! I get it now! Uh, okay. Come on. Come on. Get over this way. And dodge! One, two, three. Dodge. Dodge. Mm -hmm. DPS is already much, much better. A lot safer, too, which is just as important, if not more so. Thanks. And dodge. One, two, three, and four. And dodge. Thanks. 
go for three hits very safely, but more is a tall order. And go shoot one, two, and one. Wait, what? You did your big roar. Okay. One, two, three. And I didn't even hit you, so can't imagine that anything really happened. Okay, just one, two, and dodge, and one, two, three, and dodge. Okay. Now we are... This is sloppier, but if it works, it works. And back. Thank you. See, we could oftentimes make it work by just getting a convenient stagger break. And, I mean, boys break, stagger with... And dodge. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We're close. Oh, all right. And dumb, dumb, and dumb. And what are you going to do? And one. There we go. Let's S this up. Carth this up. And see if we can't make this beautiful thing happen. Okay. So, just dodge. We have white circle it. And dodge. Okay, thank you. One, dodge. Oh, all right. Thanks. Dodge. One, two, and... Okay, we can stun you out of that attack. It's a ludicrous. Dodge. One, dodge. Okay. Dodge. One, two, and... Wow. Just... The DPS is really, really good. Dodge. I know that it's possible to get a critical on you, but... Stance break, but I... Mm, it might not be an option to what I have right now. Just get in close and one, two, and okay, thanks. Dodge, 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 back. Mm -hmm. Might be tough for more car with this, but until we run out for sure, I thanks and dodge, and then we dodge. Mm -hmm. Could be dodge, okay. One, two, and dodge, okay, interesting, and Dodge, okay, dodge, okay, and one more, one more, one, two, and, okay, lightning will strike, that does hit you too, but I, mm, mm, okay, mm, and I, interesting, and I, what are you doing next, and, come on, and, one, dodge, okay, one, two, and dodge, dodge, okay, I should probably really try to... What? Okay. Dodge it. Okay, cool. One, two, and it's... I don't have any other assets, so... Just need to dodge it. Try to... Uh, once you go through a three-hit combo, we will simply... Go for a three-hit combo so that I can... Uh, just put my fire back on without fear of fall off. And thanks, and alright, cool. Alright, and dodge on the way that ends. Cool. Alright, and this would ideally be how we want to get this done, so. And dodge. Okay, wait, what? Okay. Two, three, and slash, and oh, well, we didn't hit anybody. Okay. The more we stay at max HP, the better. Even if we don't have any kind of special wood sword ring or anything. And then just dodge. Okay, and one, two, and dodge. We can dodge. And Salt Sword just being so much faster is so crucial that this entire build is even working. And there we go. So, alright. Thanks. And dodge. And how much more is dodge on the way of that? And one, two, three, four, and one more hit. One more measly hit. Let's actually put on how this silver serpent ring early. Just to ensure we don't mess it up. Okay, and and you're one hit away from death. And counter! Baited your charge, baby! And that's all. Guess someone else is taking home the Dark Soul. Cool, so there's one damn boss left in this game. Okay. So we should get a good amount of souls. Happy about this. So some people argue that this is literally the Dark Soul. So I'm like, yeah, what are the Dark Souls? Pigment or champion would ruin him little hope of a safe return. So there are a couple a couple of very short things I want to do, and then I kill the final boss, and then Dark Souls 3 is over. 
Wait, being a randle, depict a painted world. Dark soul, picking words, dry and consume the dark soul. Eight them to rehydrate the dark soul. So, the only things left are there's something in shared grave, and also if we go to. Gotta go back to the painted world real quickly, too. Okay. Give the blood of the dark soul to the lady. No, no! This was the one that was harder. We just did the final boss of the final DLC. Arguably the final boss of the entire Dark Souls series. I'm just going to be fighting the, the final boss of the main game, who is not going to be as bad. Presumably. I think. I hope. So, yeah. And we'll get our funny word of Hollow's ending, and that'll be all. Just see something real quick. Uh, This file is too big to recycle. Do you want to permanently delete it? I guess. Let's give that her. Get the blood of the dark soul. You're welcome. Nice. Please tell me my name. I would name this painting after thee. Sure. My thanks. I do have a name. I will paint a world of that name. And if we don't give her the name, she just says it's Ash. So we get for finishing that. I wonder when Uncle Gale intends his return. No comment. My thanks. Ashen one finished the pinnacle by Craig on a face, could leave home. We will make his return. That he'll like the painting that you've worked so hard to get. No comment. So in that case, I will simply should be something else in shared grave, but also we can finally join Rosaria's fingers. I still never did it. And Cathedral the Deep, for whatever reason, has all that. The Rosaria's Chamber, and... The fire makes it sound like it's going to explode, frankly. Okay. So the only thing left is Soul of Cinder. And, oh, another macro. Okay, I guess. Oh, but they're not hostile. Oh, well, you know, there we go. One hit. Hazel Pick and Xanthus Crab. Oh, a mangrove with... Oh, so that's another way to get... Hazel set. You don't talk, do you? Eventually, I think we'll get the Covenant item. Presumably. Oh, no, we just didn't activate it. Sure, let's go. There we got Rosari's Fingers. Thank you. So this Covenant's obtained proof. Offer Pepton. Let's offer one, and that should make Ring Finger Leonard take some stuff. We don't have many at all. Don't want to do any of that. Cool. We come back. Rosario will be dead. Ring finger Leonard will... Oh, and here you are. Hello. Figure out where to find the completest quest line. Rosario, after all, find the other finger. Wound. Tongues for the mistress. Free Unchained. Sure called Madri. Romance among the rest of us. Hmm. So maybe that's... Oh, but... If that's Hazel... She wouldn't have been killed by someone else, but I suppose they could have tricked her into... I don't know, doing too many reverse and turning into a mangrub. I do find it interesting that they've got a similar thing going on to the reverse in Elden Ring, where you do it enough and you basically turn into goop. So, do we have to leave the area or just reload it? We did reload it. So what I'm wondering is, would we get... Ah... Yep, so she's dead, and we'll get a black eye orb. What do we invade? Oh, no, we have to switch. Village remains, black eye orb, and that would be... Already be. Sorry's killer, roll over killer, returning victorious. Serene as it casts its gaze towards Irithal. King orb. So, we're in Irithal. Because I don't want to poke around a bunch. Black eye orb... Guinevere's Chamber. Oh, the room above Aldrich. I figured it'd be near Anorlando, but Aldrich specifically is a fun choice. Let's go back over to Aldrich's place and invade our friend Leonard. Leonard. And we could use Rosaria's soul afterwards to revive her or transpose it. Frankly, I don't particularly care for either, so 
if we're invading, nothing we do right now will actually make a difference. So let's go in. It'd be funny if you could go if you could go down there and get sucked down the hole. Or if you could just, I don't know, get cut up a little by that. So we go in this chamber. Oh, and that is apparently, I suppose, the point of the chamber. What's interesting is that since Rosaria's soul gives bountiful sunlight, like I go quivering, it arguably implies that. Let's see. Implies a connection between Rosaria and Guinevere. Well, that's that's a heck of a noise. Go down, we kill this guy, then we. I don't know. I enjoy a good time. I'm sure that's it. No comment. I sowed the seeds. I'll prune the nets. Thank you, and Zeus the goddess. And one, two, three, and all right, all right, and spoiled her soul. Oh, beast wrapped in human skin. Okay, so you're you have complicated feelings about being a finger. So I presume that this might be evidence that there's connection between Guinevere and Rosaria, that he was there secretly to try to get Guinevere's soul back from Rosaria? Interesting, so... You've got a lot of S's. Be fair, so do I. Two, three, four, five, and there we go. Blessed Rosaria. It's insane, you know. There we go. Ringfinner, Leonard defeated, returning to your world. So that was the last real quest related to loose end tie up, and then the only other thing would be. Soul of Rosaria, Crescent Moon Sword, and Silver Mask. Let's check out that Soul of Rosaria. Very tiny. Exit Quartz, Mother Rosaria, spring back to life, as if nothing had ever happened, but. Does it say anything about her, does it? And where is that mask? Leonard's silver mask. Mary burns his entire body, face was terribly scalded. Same from restoring them even after becoming a finger, which... Interesting, because... Ex oh, I didn't even think about it, but yeah. Rebirth would be able to restore physical injuries, in theory. So now we go back to share a grave. And that'll be all. Should be something more left. I guess the question is... Maybe I will just still use Cell Sword Twin Blades against the final boss, and then equip Lightning Blade on it. Maybe. Sure, Grave is over here, and I am... There's an item on the side, and I'm curious as to how I'm supposed to get it. It does look very, very similar. The Dark Souls 1 Catacombs. So where is that item? What is it? I go over there and somehow, some way. Hmm. Shared grave upper level, or I'll just look it up real quick. I'm gonna take a quick look where the enemies and then look it up because I do not want to have to wait any longer to finish this up. I'm going a while. Okay. And there we go. Well, all right. Two, three, and more skeletons. Yay! All right, and one, and all right. One, two, three. So somewhere up here it should be not an illusory wall, but something said, "Look above." Make use of above. So I presume that some kind of. Huh? Or wait, did I? Wait, how do Shared Grave item? It's through Shared Grave. Shared Grave item. Location under. Where do I grab that? Get to an item shortly after Shared Grave. Jumping in. Valley. Tunnel in the cliff. Spot before you enter Shared Grave. Okay, so there's a tunnel back that we have to 
Find our way into. Okay, that should be simple enough. Do that real quick. Then we go kill Soul Cinder. I am. Yeah. Thanks! Okay. Right, right, right. Gotta find a way back up. And, oh, thank you. Great. One, two, three. Well, even though bludgeoning is better, technically. The swords are just so fast. Oh, there was another item here? Wait. The, oh my. Okay. And is this something with a lap? Just a lightning gem? Or. Why did I not find this before? I'm like, oh, this is just. The area I could have been in previously. I just didn't take that road. Oh, you know, if that works, it works. I don't really mind. Okay. It'd be really fun to die here. Wouldn't like to, though. Simple gem and. Oh, so they're calling me stupid. Okay. Cool. One, two, three, and four. And more, or. Hmm. So, what is up top? The end of all this. There's clearly nothing there, so. Well, I got the item I wanted, so. Let's escape this place. Actually, it said something about a tunnel by my deer, though, so I. I am. Hmm. Or is... They're talking about something different. I... Come on, come on. No, oh, alright. I'll just... Oh, and there's a tunnel right there. I didn't see that. I was too preoccupied. One, two, three, four, five, six. Interesting. Okay, so right here. One more little thing. I think. And an item, and that's... It's just two tight knot scales. Okay, whatever. I can see that. I didn't see that from before, so... Last thing to do is going to be play to place the final cinders of a lord. And then, and then... Mm. Place it up over here, and the way to the kiln of the first one will be open. Theoretically, just a teleport, I'm sure. Alright, Holy... Holy King Lothric, last hope of his line. Well, never became a king, did he? That's the thing. Put this down and wait. Oh, do we have to do it from here? Okay. Funky. And we weren't exactly facing it, were we? He looks the head's a bit bigger than his own. So now that we've placed all the cinders of the Lord, and Rudolph should give us something, among other things. Uh, when all this is planned, is it not? Yeah. Five mm. Nice, huh? That's undeserving. And he shall die at Colossus. Speak with the firekeeper. Okay. The eyes show a road. Destitute of fire, bear and burn, and was a darkness. And a betrayal. Fire paint a new vision. What is that? Run intense. The eyes of the so what is Wait, wait. Five little ones with thy own hands. Should thy fate in pain such foul betrayal? Betrayal. So now we can go to the kiln, and it seems to be burning a bit differently. Do they now? Thank you. Mm. take a bit of additional attunement just for the final fun. And what I wonder is how many souls do I have? What could I use? I thought I used all of these. Gotta get one more level of something. And oh well that's actually a lot. Lord fit to make the fire. And get another level. That will probably be it. We're using Let's use that then. So now that we've talked, I wonder if Rudolph should go with the score ring in theory. 
I think. Ruby rings. Okay. So, what if I took the man? All right. Cool. So I guess I would have to kill him with the skull ring. That's whatever. And time to go to kill him. And to finish everything up, gotta switch my. Not my flash around, but my spells around a little bit, and of course we can just go back, but whatever. Noble Lords of Cinder. Oh. The fire fades. He burned up. Oh. Wow. And the Lords go without thrones. Just like the intro cutscene. Hey, I've never seen this. Time to seize the flame. As Julia would have it. But said, I wonder if she would have anything to say. I didn't go back to her after we took out her sister. Well, alright. Well, the way to the kiln of the first thing. Is she going to crown us? Or sprinkle them over as ashes? Ashen 1. I wonder if there could be an Ashen 2. I didn't say that. Burning and shriveled. True Lord of the Undead. Let him grant death. Oh. To the old gods of Lord. Deliver us of the first. We don't talk about Ashen too. this. Why that bonfire? And here we are, killing the first flame. Guys, it's... This is... Oh, it's an alternate fire link. But it's not in the same place. Flame was running. Oh, of course it's behind. Oh, well, it's before all these, so... Should be close. I want to talk to Elfrida one more time. To see if she has anything to say about us. Have, I mean, talk to Yuria to see if she has anything to say about we killing her. It's killing her sister because her sister certainly had a lot of things to say about her when we were killing her. Oh. Uh, was Soul of my sister. Shrimp to ash would abandon Wandor. But it nourished thy lordship. Small kindness. Shadows cast by fire. And mantle of usurper. So she does have something quick to say. The follows. True face of mankind. And do you have anything to say? Well, it is interesting that it's a very similar place. Pierced upon the first flame, fire. The winking of the fire. Fall upon me, time to find the very end, eyes showed me. Okay. Thank you. Back to kill and to the end. To the flameless shrine, whose relationship to fire wink is beautiful unknown. Of the first flame. And then. Got that bonfire. Let's actually. Yeah, we should take a torch. That's right. Let's see what's here. Storage box. Take a single. It counts as a shield, so. There we go. Cool. Poke around a little here and see what we have to see. Anything over here? Presumably not. So the question is, which what would our direction of egress be? Where would we have to go? And pass there? No. Does it say anything? And it says the same. Oh, it's just like untended graves. Oh, but it makes sense because <sighs> Firelink is, after all. I mean, untended graves and kiln are, after all, ultimately alternate states of Firelink. Okay. How do we need to find? Let's flame a shrine. Let's attune some spells. All we need are. We could try using lightning spears, but that's stupid, so we go for lightning blade. And we switch to. That's gonna be our best still. 
then. That's good, that's good. Mr.'s chain is fine too, but... Priestess is ring, and then... What can we put on? I guess we'll put on chain home. So, there we are. Let's put our tears up. Have to do a lightning bolt right before, when the fight starts. This will be... Be nice to get this done first time. I mean, first try. Here we are, and unlike Firelink Shrine, doesn't take a bunch of time to load the rest in. The Dark Sun Eclipse is come. Seems familiar, now the real fight begins. Praise the Lord of Cinder. That... Oh, and it's just like the Drag Heap. That's where they got that idea. Proceed to the first flame. So it just teleports us there. Interesting. Alright, okay. This is very, very... Did this... Oh, well... Okay. That... Alright, then. <laughs> but this is very drag heap, so it makes sense. That's where they get the idea from. Travel the drag heap. Why would I do that? I did everything there. Actually, actually, actually. There is one very quick thing to show. That is... There's a reason I bought the coins from the old stone hunt hack now, which is that, that we've killed Gale and cleared everything out. She has undergone a curious transformation into passive angel. Hello. The old woman's ashes and once the wet nurse to royalty, old stone up woman, dreadfully run their course at crew the dra drag heap. And should be. Oh, and it's right over there, another final angel. Your final transformation, which I guess is, even if it's unpleasant, probably better than becoming one of those pilgrim butterflies. So, back to the kiln of the first flame. Why do the areas even exist separately, frankly? Oh, whatever. Alright. Time to take them off. Just gotta show off how that bonfire worked, I guess. And over there is... Oh, and it's in the trunk of an arch tree in it. Oh, so in that case... I didn't even think about it because I hadn't really seen DS3 kiln, but... In its own way, it's basically... The drag heap, and what is that over there? Who knows? I doubt the devs know. Especially given how unfinished DS3 ended up being, but... This trunk of a tree similarly only fought the demon prince in, frankly, and... Oh, are people summonable? Wanderer pill shade, no thanks. Then... Yuria should be somewhere too, but... Whatever. We do this so as always. I really can summon Duria. Son, oh, someone just show him. The Vort Hammer. Duria of Wander with a Dark Trip. We can just kill her afterwards, it's fine. So we got our Lightning Blade and Soul of Cinder. Hello, friend. Not really. In Japanese, this guy is known as Avatar of the Lords. One, two, and dodge. Okay, alright. Really? Wow. You okay, we can. Be funny here then. This is. I'm not actually good for the hammers though. Alright. Dodge. One, two, and. Interesting. We can just DPS you down. Well, dodge, dodge. Oh, alright. Uh, could have been an idea, but. Dodge. Oh, alright. Hmm. Lightning Blade is very, very good to have, but I might actually still prefer having hammers and dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, alright. Uh, interesting. That was delayed. Okay. You're, oh, thanks for the lance. That's miracles if I recall correctly. And is that thanks? Kind of felt like a ring knight actually. And okay, thank you. And you just this is going to be a very scuffed fight. But I uh, wow. Okay. So that's really good at catching. Interesting. Punching. So in that case, we can't poise break him. At least not like this. So it's back to the hammers. Crescent Moon Sword, Lunar, it's Power of the Moon, Journey of Rebirth, so it's got magic, and therefore Moon. It's Night and Herald, it's Weapon. Crescent Blade, Crescent Moon Blades, so that's... That's good, that's decent. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure I'd want to be Embered. Presumably, though, after we kill, 
So center, it'll ember us. So we've got a good amount of durability. We will be okay. That fog vault was interesting considering that only one side actually got a pillar abutting it. It's a little off-center, frankly. Okay. And presumably you'll attack us first thing, which, well, whatever. Hello, thanks. So that means... We don't get any chance to get a free hit on you like we might have last time, which is all right. Dodge. Thanks. Okay. And dodge. Cool. One, two. And dodge. Okay. One, two. And dodge. Okay. All right. And okay. And heal. Dodge. Slam. And all right. And oh, nice. We can we. Oh, that wasn't actually a visceral. I mean, a critical opportunity. That's a lie. One, two, three, four, and slam, and... Now this is... You're not as bad as Gale, but not by a country mob. Okay, dodge. Okay, one, two, three, four, and slam the hammers, and... Okay, cool. Dodge. Okay, all right. Thanks. One, two... Oh, interesting. Fun attack. All right. Dodge, dodge. Okay. All right. Dodge, dodge. Charge that. One, two, three, four, and... Mm, I, all right. Heal. Gonna go Gwyn mode relatively soon, I suppose. And then we... Dodge, dodge. Uh, so we need to dodge out of the way of that instead of trying to... Dodge. Mm, okay. Interesting. Dodge. This is less a hard boss, a more interesting boss. Okay. One, two, three, four, and... Oh, what? I, all right. Dodge. Thank you for doing staff mode, I guess. Mm. Dodge. Oh, thanks. I, all right. Thanks. Dodge. Oh, wow. And we just dodge away. Got it. Dodge, thanks for the comment of your... Wait, what? Thanks. Wow. You're actually really threatening. Dodge. Okay. Oh, okay. Interesting. That That's interesting. That's different. And there we go. So that means... Put Lightning Blade back on, we still have our tears up, and now you're going. Win mode, hello, old friends. And just dodge, dodge, okay, all right. Oh, great, thanks. Wow, okay, I did not expect that to be a thing you could do. Dodge, okay, one, two, still not terrible, if I recall correctly, even in win form, which is kind of sad, but oh, my goodness. And will that kill me straight up? No, it won't. Okay. So we can just burst you down like a silly, silly guy. Okay, cool. Let's dodge, dodge. Okay, cool. And one, two. Still wake up. Oh my goodness. What a scuffed way to do this fight. But you know, a victory is a victory no matter how it happens. And heal. Okay. And dodge. Oh, what? Okay. And just dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, thanks. That would. Oh, so if we got hit by that, that's what would happen. That's the, okay. And we can't use tears, so we just need to. Oh, all right. Dodge. Okay. Oh. Uh, but we. Dodge. Oh my. Okay. Oh, lightning storm is. That's annoying. Okay. Well, let's lightning void up real quick before more garbage happens, and hopefully take you out. Take you out and dodge. One, two, three, four, and. Five. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, thanks. It's dodge. Okay, just out of my way. And, uh, please. Uh, only a few more hits necessary. Just dodge. Okay, thanks. What are you going to do? And dodge. One, two. And that's the end of Dark Souls 3. It's the final boss of Dark Souls 3. Goodbye, fake Gwyn. So it's time for the credits, I guess. Ward of Cinder Fallen and Ember Restored, or... No Ember... No, we did get our Ember Restored. So, let's choose our ending. Steeped in Strength, True Strength, Ward of Cinder, Ward of the First Flame, manifest themselves as Defender of the Flame. The funny thing is, is that unlike other Souls games, we can actually leave. We don't need to do anything right now. We also don't even need to go into New Game Plus here. So we could summon the Firekeeper. No. So if we choose to link the first flame, we're just going to take the first flame, right? I hope. Let's see. It'd be really funny if I got the ending I wasn't trying to get. 
If it works, it works. Hmm. Point of the Usurper. And this is... Are we going to take the flame and turn to the Lord of Hollows, or did we mess up and... Okay, we're not sitting down, so... Yes, I think we're... Are we taking the flame? We literally have what we need for Lord of Hollows, and I swear, if we sit down... Okay, we're not sitting down. This is good. Time for evil mode. Oh? Wait, what? Uh-oh. We, we, we beat the game. It is what it is. Yep, we got the end we wanted, and for whatever reason, if I recall correctly, Audrey's still alive here. In this weird twilight. There we go. It only took a lot of grinding, but I killed Madeir and Gale. Soul Cinder only took two tries. And these are... One of those might be Yuria, but the other... Maybe Aurelian? And Henri's back there, and all these hollows. Maybe I should have worn the pretty ring. Uh-oh. Well, that's all. Got the achievement for the usurpation of fire ending, but the stream does not show that. Nice. That was... I have very complicated feelings about this game. It was really, really good, but also at the same time it... It was a great game, but it was really bad for this challenge. That's what I'll say. But we got to use the hammers at the end, which was fun. Got to use them in lightning mode. We got to use lightning hammers, which is frankly unbeatable. Yeah. Well, if it was really a pregnancy, then I wouldn't be able to play Dark Souls again for a month at least. But I... Mm, well, Sekiro is in Souls, and technically Elden Ring is in Dark Souls. This is the last Dark Souls game. And then if I get through Demon Souls, well, Demon Souls isn't Dark Souls either. They're entirely different games. No comment. I just... This reminds me of when... I think you're there, stressing that when Larry and I beat the Ender Dragon and I went through the End Portal, I actually read all... I went through all the End Poem and all the credits because I'd never actually legitimately beaten the Ender Dragon before. Because it just never was something that really interested me. Especially since I've always been more of a modded Minecraft guy than a vanilla Minecraft guy. And since Microsoft took over and Minecraft has become a game absolutely designed by committee, the entire ending sequence was over an hour. And Larry and I had to talk about all sorts of things. We had to complain about the state of modern video games just to get through. That's life. That's life. Yeah. And the next should be Sekiro, which is apparently even shorter. The big thing about it is that it's all about mechanical skill. There aren't really a lot of changes you can make to your build. I will probably be playing on Bell Demon, which is sort of early New Game Plus, a harder difficulty. But in the end, it shouldn't be that bad. And then Demon Souls is silly, you can just cheese it with magic. The thing about Demon Souls is that kind of like. Bloodborne, there's no actual option to actually have equal stats when you start out, but Bloodborne at least had a class that was a lower level than all the other starting classes, and if you leveled up at the same level, you could have effectively the equivalent of equal stats at their level. But in Demon Souls, there are a number of classes, but none of them have anywhere close to equal stats, and the equivalent of the Deprived, say, from Dark Souls or Elden Ring is... Well, a class that actually has more stats in exchange for fewer items. They tried balancing them in different ways. For example, so I'm going to have to choose the lowest level class because it'll be the closest to, you know, the easiest to actually equalize my stats from. It'll be royalty, which is funny for a number of reasons, but the big thing is that it actually starts out with a couple of very, very good items. So we'll see. The big thing, though, is that I will need to clear out a lot of VODs in order to... I'm going to need to clear out a lot of VODs and turn them into clips in order to get... 
You know, we get enough space probably to actually install the PS3 emulator and Demon Souls that I'm gonna need to actually play the game. But we'll see what happens. Well, the installation of equipping, the installation shouldn't be all that bad. There are places I can go to just basically download it prepackaged. No problem at all. I would not expect you to sit through the credits. Thank you for the tips, and thank you for just chilling out. It was a lot of fun. Glad you were here. Okay. So I wonder what might happen afterwards. And yep, the narrator was Pixenalin. Be amazed. Let's see if there are any other names I recognize. The big thing is that Yorshka Martha McIntosh also plays the main sort of level up girl of Elden Ring Melina, who you might have seen. And okay, and Lap is also William Vanderpuy, the same as Patches, because he is Patches. But I guess if you got the DLC or played the game after the DLC came out and hadn't seen him yet, it wouldn't spoil it for you. All right. We'll see what happens. I know that after the credits, they give you the option to continue in a new game plus or not, and I don't think I will. Because I do want to do the grind for the remaining covenant items on my own time. Because a lot of them are quite good. For example, in particular, Dark Moon Blade can oftentimes be better. The big thing is that I can't directly check the spell buff of weapons. I mean, of Catalyst. The calculators, you can do these build calculators online for Dark Souls 3, like with a lot of other Souls games. And Elden Rings is the hits the most popular event, almost inarguably. It will actually tell you what your spell buff is on a given casting tool if you put it in and then give the stats you want to have. But in Dark Souls, they don't have spell buff, at least not immediately visible, but there's a spell damage calculator that, for whatever reason, does not show spell buff definitely has to be in there internally, but it's just not there. It also does not tell you how much you'll get from a weapon buff either, which is annoying. And it was useful for me comparing certain catalysts, but it wasn't amazing, amazing. But for Elden Ring, at least I'll be able to do a good amount. The big thing about Elden Ring, though, is that most of the weapon buffs in Elden Ring are a lot less useful, because among other things, they're just weaker. Their effects are not as numerically strong. Arguably, though, I think you can actually get to a higher maximum spell buff, so that's probably part of why they balanced it. But the best weapon buffs are the ones that don't really revolve around damage, pure out of damage at all ones. That, they would be ones that would give you more damage against specific targets, specifically. There's a weapon buff that gives you extra damage versus undead. And also one that gives you... I'll sleep. I'll live. Also one that gives you a bit of extra... Silicon Studio. Let's make 3 dot game heroes. Can we also make... Bravely Default? Yeah. Well, before that, I need to make myself food. I need to turn myself into food. I need to feed myself to something. Okay, cool. Well, that's Dark Souls 3. Current state, bonfire, don't wish to begin now. I don't wish to begin now. Okay. Oh, in that case, let me check something real quick. And what do you have to say? Let's actually just level up real quick. Let's see. Level up real quick and get one more quick level. Sure, why not? Okay, and just to make sure I don't lose this. Not that I really would. Oh, and... Oh, and Ludolef leaves. The skull ring there because he dies when that happens. And, okay, we can't do soul transposition right now, can we? Pick up items, skull ring, and examine. Oh, you can transpose things with his corpse, as long as you've given it to him already. Soul Skull Ring talks about the Soul Feeder detected in sensory group souls. Of course, cursed corpses burned, pendant sensor souls, air permanently stained. So in that case, I will could begin journey to I don't think I will. I just wanna see what's going on with that other bonfire now. I assume they're not gonna let just let me get another ending. Let me see. Also, I think you can actually kill Yuria to get her weapon and her equipment. She also just disappears and drops it if you go back after 
having her as her co-op partner for the final boss and oh interesting it's just not here or it's burned out i wonder what would happen if you chose another ending if you chose another ending would it still be burning or what let's go back to the shrine real quick let's see if there's anything there And is Yuri going to be here now, or... Huh? Oh, she's still here. You know... Well... We don't exactly need... Uh, Linking of the fire. Mr. the friend from its mantle. How is our ship? Have it for her own. Okay. You know... Let's take Dark Drift. Sorry, Yuri. One, two, three, and... Interesting. Oh! Oh, but she'll just... Let us kill her. That's right. You know, maybe we did a bad thing. Got her ashes in Dark Drift, and... Oh, but her I guess her set only shows up if you actually fight Soul Cinder for her. Oh... Well, Alright. We got. And we don't have the dex for it. Dark Trip, Cursed Sword, Unseen Void, First Weapon, Contained 100 Alliance. Equip that, and then switch our ring, I suppose, and then. I wonder if. We could do a buff, maybe. Actually, if we switch to Hunter's Ring. I wonder if I can buff this thing. I can, actually. See, it's translucent. It's actually. We got this from Agdane in Dark Souls 2. The funny grave guy, it's his weapon. And we... Yep, and it goes right through shields, because it's different. There we go. Still lightning this. Not sure if that affects the damage dealt through shields, but... Cool. It's the end, I guess. Alright. And with our ill-gotten gains, we will end things. It was fun. Thank you for watching. Sign a to DS3.